Okay, Jeffy, here's your peas and here's your Coke. Jeffy! <sighs> Jeffy, just eat all your peas, okay? But I want chocolate cake, Danny. You can get chocolate cake if you finish all your peas. Promise? Yes, yes, I promise, Jeffy. Just finish all your peas. Put your stupid Coke out there, get your stupid Coke. You know, I'll, I'll just leave it. Um, Danny, all done. You're all done? Yeah. I ate all my peas, Danny. Are you sure it's not on the floor, Jeffy? Nope, not on the floor. I, See? Told you, not on the floor. I guess, I guess you did eat all your peas. Wait. Hey. J Jeffy, move. No. Jeffy! What? You burn all your seat, Jeffy! Chocolate cake, please. You, you're not getting any chocolate cake, Jeffy! <laughs> You promise I can have chocolate cake! You promise, you promise! You Shut promise. up, Jimmy! I said only if you ate all your peas! You're not getting any chocolate cake! Since you're being a bad boy, Jeffy, I'm gonna eat chocolate cake in front of you. What? Jeffy? Where'd he go? Jeffy! Jeffy, where'd you go? What? Jeffy? Jeffy, unlock the door! Jeffy! You unlock that door right now! Jeffy! You put that chocolate cake back! Jeffy! Jeffy! Ah! I'm gonna kill him! I'm gonna- Jeffy! Unlock the door! Jeffy! Jeffy, unlock the door! Je ah! Jeffy! Jeffy, unlock the door! Ah! Jeffy, unlock the door right now! Ah! What am I gonna do? The front door! I can go to the front door! Jeffy! Jeffy! <laughs> Jimmy! No! Jimmy! I'll lock the door, Jimmy! Once your password. Let me inside my house, Jimmy! Nope. <sighs> okay, what am I gonna do? The garage! The garage! No! No! Jimmy! 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 Oh my god! What am I gonna do? There's a window! There's a window open! Oh yeah! Uh. Oh, when I get up there, I'm gonna kill him. <sighs> hey, Danny, what are you doing? Jeffy! What? Let me inside the house. No. What? You, you better not close that window, Jeffy. Why? Uh, because I, I have to take my medicine. It, I, I, it's really important. You don't take medicine, Danny. Yes, I do, Jeffy! Jeffy! Oh! Jeffy! Oh, my God. Oh. I hate him so much. What are you doing, buddy? Uh, uh, excuse me, officer. I I'm just uh, trying to get inside my house, you know. Inside your house? Yeah. Well, why don't you just use the front door? B because my uh, retarded roommate locked me out. Really? Sounds like you got a grudge against somebody, huh? Uh, can you get that light out of my eyes? No. Have you been drinking? Huh? Maybe, maybe a DUI? Well, I haven't been driving or drinking. Yeah, we'll see about that. Um, so this is your house? Yes, huh? th this is this is my house, and I'm just locked out. So can you help me uh, get in? Mm. Well, we'll go see. Come on. He's not gonna answer. Well, try the doorbell. What? The doorbell? Yeah. See what difference it's gonna make. Yep, see, that's what it was. Um, uh, can I help you? Uh, yeah, excuse me, sir. Jimmy, help me in! Whoa, 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 what do you think you're doing? Uh, you can't just go barging into this man's house. It's my house! Well, we'll see about that. Uh, excuse me, sir, I, I don't mean to bother you. Oh, yeah, you are. Oh, well, I'll, I'll try to make this quick. Um, does Good. he live here? Him? Uh, yeah, d d does he live here? Um, I've never seen him before in my life, officer. Oh, really? Yep. Uh, oh. Jimmy, you know I live in! Come on, Jimmy! Let's go! Come on, come on! I'm all gonna right, kill him! Right, right, I'm right, gonna right, kill him! Alright, all right. since you don't live here, I'm gonna have to ask you to get off the property. I do live here! Well, we just talked to the owner and he says you don't. How do you know he's the owner? The man answered the door holding chocolate cake. He's obviously got money. That doesn't mean he's the owner! Well, okay, either way, you can't go over there anymore, okay? If I get another call saying that you're over here, you're going to the slammer, alright? Drunk bastard. Uh, uh, Jenny! Oh, what am I gonna do? It's freezing outside. I gotta get inside the house. The attic. I can go inside the attic. Let me get the ladder. Okay, I'm in the attic. Now, how do I get inside the house? The air vent. The air vent. Yeah. Oh, Jeffy, here I come. Now when I see you, I'm gonna punch you in your retarded face! I hate you, Jeffy! I hate you! Oh my god, I can't wait to kill him. I'm coming for you, Jeffy! I'm coming! Oh my god, when I see him, I'm gonna punch him. I'm almost there. 
어, 그냥, 그냥, 뭐, 아! 
Jeffy, are you okay? Jesus Christ, Junior. Dude, his power level is over 9,000. 9,000? What power level? What are you talking about? How do you know his power level? Dude, you don't have a scouter? I never joined the Boy Scouts. Junior, he's going Super Saiyan. Super Satan? No, not Satan. Saiyan. What's he saying? Look at his hair, dude. It's blonde. Yeah. Yeah, the brighter his hair gets, the more powerful he becomes. Yeah, I, dude. I thought blondes were stupid. No, not if they're male. I'm so confused. Junior, we really just need to get out of here. Yeah, dude. Okay. Oh. Jeffy, you go Super Saiyan? Well, that's no match for my purple finger laser! <laughs> oh, you messed up now. <laughs> oh, Jeffy Cool. Very, very weak Kai Blast. Now prepare for the most powerful purple finger laser you've ever seen! Two in the pink! Oh yeah? Well watch this! Come on! Oh, daddy. oh how are you stronger than purple finger? It's my wife's weakness! You asked for this! What the uh, 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 Alright! Time to run your lunch like a weird kid! Oh, what is that? Oh, is that Dragon Ball? Oh, I need six more of these. Hey, Jeffy, how was school today? It was good, Daddy Gook. Wait, what is that? It's a Dragon Ball, and I just need six more balls. Right now, I only have one ball because I'm like Lance Armstrong. Oh, Jeffy, earlier today, I found a ball just like that. Gimme, see it. Here you go. <gasps> Gimme, Gook. F yeah. All right, Daddy, now I got two Dragon Balls. Now I just need five more. Um, Jeffy, that's only four fingers. Oh, well, just imagine I have one more finger, that's how many more balls I need. I need five more Dragon Balls. Why do you need five more? Because once I get all seven Dragon Balls, I can summon the dragon and he'll grant me a wish. Do you get picked on at school acting like this? Yeah, but I kicked his ass! Jeffy! What, Jeffy, like, do you have friends acting like this? Marvin! I'm being serious, baby, he's acting weird. Daddy, daddy, don't you dare disrespect Dragon Ball Z! This is serious! I just want to make sure you're not getting bullied, you know? Daddy, you're going to make me go Super Saiyan! <laughs> I'll poop my pants, Daddy. Just don't hurt yourself, Jeffy. All right, Daddy. I'm gonna go look for more Dragon Balls. I just hope this is a phase. Yeah. Mm mm mm. My enchiladas are almost done. I sense balls. Oh, <gasps> there's two more Dragon Balls right there. Hey, you! Give me your Dragon Ball. <gasps> no way! No way! You can't have my Dragon Balls. I'll destroy the world before I let you have my Dragon Balls. Hand over your balls. I'll make you hand them over. I'd like to see you try. All right, you asked for it the hard way. Come in the lava! Come in the lava! You really thought you were more powerful than me? Just wait till you see my Gallic gun! It's not more powerful than when I go Super Saiyan! Mm -hmm. My nipples are so hard right now! Nipple beam! Ah! Nipple beam! Just impossible! Uh, uh, those balls are mine now! Marvin, what was all that noise? I don't know. Check it out, Danny. I got four Dragon Balls. I just need three more to summon the dragon. Jeffy, were you breaking stuff downstairs? No, don't worry about it, Daddy. You don't even understand Dragon Ball Z. But I'm gonna go look for the other three. <laughs> Come on, Ken, it's your turn. Come on, hurry up, just hit one. I smell balls. Oh, there they are. There's two more Dragon Balls right there. Hey, you, hand over your Dragon Balls. Oh, no, you don't. I don't give you consent to grab my balls. Well, they don't belong to you, so hand them over. Oh, you don't want to fight me. I'm too powerful. Not as powerful as me when I go Super Saiyan. Oh, you don't want to see my final form. I'm too hunky. I guess we'll see about that. <laughs> <laughs> Pathetic. Now I'll show you what true power looks like. <laughs> now you will experience the true power of the dark side. Unlimited power! 
I, 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 I'm too weak. <laughs> Just kidding. I'm hunky as shit. You want to fight? Come on. <laughs> I don't even need to fight you. That's how lame you are. I can get my son to fight you. Jeffy Hahn, I choose you. Jeffy Hahn. But what the? Jeffy Hahn, you Thunderbolt. Jeffy Hahn. Yeah. yeah, I think that's how that goes. Let's grab these Dragon Balls. On the sixth day of Christmas, my true love gave to me six Dragon Balls. Oh, you found six? Don't you need one more to make a wish? Precisely, Daddy. I need one more Dragon Ball to make a wish to the dragon. What are you even going to wish for, Jeffy? You'll see. <laughs> Who's that? Hello? Hey, we got a noise complaint from your neighbors. They said some nerds were fighting in here and yelling. Oh, that's just my son. He's going through a Dragon Ball Z phase. Whoa, no way. <laughs> Kami, Hami, Ha! Oh man, I'm a huge Dragon Ball Z fan. I love it. Not you too. Oh yeah, I've been a fan ever since I was younger. It's great. My son won't stop talking about it. Well, there's a lot to talk about. Who's at the door, Daddy? Oh my God, no way! Where'd you get that outfit? Target. Oh hell yeah, I'm going there right after this. Jeffy, what will make you stop talking about Dragon Ball Z? I'm not gonna stop talking about Dragon Ball Z until I collect all the Dragon Balls and summon the dragon. Kid, you're not gonna believe this, but I have a Dragon Ball. No way. Oh yeah, look, I confiscated it from this homeless guy that was trying to smoke it in a spoon. <gasps> Daddy, that's the seventh Dragon Ball! That's the last one I need to complete my ball sack! Wait, you have the other six Dragon Balls? Sure do! Oh my god, can I watch you summon the dragon? I don't even care about the witch, I just want to see the dragon. Sure, come on! Oh yes! I don't understand what's going on. All right, Jeffy, are you ready for this? Yeah, let's do it. Uh, okay, someone explain what's going on. Once I put this Dragon Ball with the others, we can summon the dragon and he'll grant Jeffy one wish. Yeah, our balls have to touch. Uh, okay. All right, Jeffy. Are you ready to see the coolest thing you've ever seen in your life? Yeah. <gasps> what, 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 what's happening? The dragon's coming. Oh. Wait, don't chill my ear. <sighs> Hi there. I'm Doofy the Dragon. Oh, everybody bow. Wait, wasn't he on Good Morning America? Shh. And I'm here to grant you one wish. Uh, Jeffy, what do you want to wish for? Um, I wish I had that kid's outfit. Wait, Bill. Oh, sick! Pew, pew, pew. Wait, you stole Jeffy's wish! Yeah, you snooze, you lose. Yeah, now we're definitely gonna fight! Now I'm gonna spirit bomb you! Yeah. Oh, no you don't! Not if I spirit bomb first! <laughs> Will Jeffy get revenge on Brooklyn Guy for stealing his wish? Does Brooklyn Guy have any powers whatsoever? Find out next time on Dragon Ball Z! All right, Jeffy, it's time to go to bed. This is my bed. This is where I sleep. You're going to sleep on the floor. On the floor? Yes, on the floor. So let's go put your PJs on. But, Daddy, I don't want to put my PJs on. I want to wear my big boy pants. See, I got my big boy pants on, got my diaper on. Well, Jeffy, I'd let you sleep in your big boy pants, but every time you sleep in your big boy pants, you poop in them. So if you can promise me you're not going to... If you can promise me you're not going to poop in them... The... You know what? You're going to sleep in it. But, Daddy, it's squishy. I bet it is squishy. You're going to sleep in the squishiness. But, Daddy, I'm not ready to go to bed yet. I'm not tired. Jeffy, it's 10 o'clock at night. You have to go to bed. Well, can I play my copy in now? No. <laughs> Jeffy, I said no. Ow. No, go to bed. But, Daddy, I'm not tired. I'm hungry. Can I have some cereal? In the morning. I want fruit loops. No. With milk. I said in the morning. <laughs> Jeffy, go to bed. Just, just go to bed. <sighs> All right, Jeffy, I'm gonna turn off the light, okay? Okay. You're not afraid of the dark, are you? No. Okay. Ah! What, Jeffy, what's wrong? Nothing. You just screamed. No, I didn't. Yes, you did, Jeffy, you screamed. No, I didn't, Daddy, I didn't scream. <sighs> okay, just don't scream. Ah! What's wrong? Nothing. You, you screamed, Jeffy. Daddy, I'm not screaming. Yes, you are, that was you screaming. I didn't scream. It's just the two of us, you're the one that screamed. No, I didn't, you screamed. No, I did it. When did we all scream for ice cream? Stop it. Okay, <sighs> Ah! What? Nothing! You keep screaming! You keep screaming at me! Because you're screaming! I'm not screaming! Oh, oh you're not screaming? No. Oh, okay, oh, well, we'll see. Ah! Did I saw your mouth open! No, I wasn't! Yes, I saw it with my own eyes! No, you didn't, you're blind! Just stop it! Stop screaming! Just I'm knock not screaming! Knock it off! You knock it off! <sighs> I saw your mouth moving. No, you didn't, Daddy. You can't see anything. Jeffy, stop it. I'm not doing anything. You're screaming! No, I'm not! <laughs> Jeffy, stop it! I'm sorry, Daddy. I 
I'm just scared of the dark. You just said you weren't afraid of the dark. No, I didn't. Go to bed. But, Daddy, I need a nightlight. No, you don't. Big boys don't need nightlights. But, Daddy, what if the boogeyman comes and tries to eat me? The boogeyman's not going to eat you because you want to know what? The boogeyman doesn't eat kids who poop their pants. The boogeyman doesn't eat kids with poopy pants? Nope, so you're all good there, buddy. Well, Daddy, the boogeyman's never going to get me. <laughs> I lied. Uh, the, the, the boogeyman loves poop. The, the boogeyman eats kids, especially who poop their pants. Well, it's too late, Danny. I'm already pooped in my pants. I know. I already heard it. I'll just go to bed. Meow. Meow. No, he didn't. Meow. Jumpy, I said no cat piano. Meow. 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 What? What did you do with my cat piano? I, I, I ate it. Why are you doing that? Jimmy, just go to bed. Are you really that hungry that you had to eat my cat piano? I said go to sleep. But I'm just trying to understand why you would eat my cat piano. Why wouldn't you eat your own cat piano? Jimmy, just, just, just go to bed. Or why would you not eat someone else's cat piano? Go to sleep. Hey, I'm trying to understand. Jimmy, if you don't go to sleep, I'm going to staple your eyelids shut. Why are you doing that? First, you eat my cat piano. Then, you want to staple my eyelid shut? Go to sleep! <sighs> Go to sleep, Jeffy. Take this to bed with me. Mm, root loop. Mm. <laughs> Who's the noise? Huh? I'll step your eyelids. I'll do it. Huh? Oh man. Jeffy, you okay? I need a glass of water. I'm thirsty. Oh man, I need a glass of water. <laughs> <laughs> In the house! They made a huge mess! Wait, let's go! I have to call the cops! I have to call the cops! Oh man, where are the cops? Where are the cops? I'm so scared! Hello? Hey there, you call the cops? Yes, officer, somebody broke into my house! Oh no. Did they take anything? I don't know, it's just a huge mess! Okay, let's go have a look. See, officer, look! Look at this huge mess! Do you just not know how to pour a bowl of Fruit Loops? You think I did this? I did not do this! What do you think? Somebody just broke into your house, passed up everything valuable, and decided to make a Fruit Loop mess on your counter? Yes! That doesn't happen! Well, it did happen. I want you to find out who did it. Okay, okay, you know what I think happened? What? I, I'll tell you what I think. I think you made this mess, and then you called me because you want me to clean it up. I don't want you to clean this up! Well, good, because I'm not doing it! Unless you slide me a hundred. Unless I slide you a hundred. Slide me a hundred? I don't want you to clean it up. I want you to find out who did it. Well, I don't even know if this is a crime. It is a crime. Someone broke in and made a mess. Well, you know, cereal mess on your counter is not the kind of thing you see on America's Most Wanted. Well, it should be because it's a, it's a crime and someone broke in and did it. I want you to find out who did it. Well, I don't know. Do you have any kids? I have one kid that's not mine. Well, why don't you ask him instead of calling the cops? I could be hiding in the bush, pulling people over and giving them speeding tickets. You know, real justice. Huh. Jeffy did want Fruit Loops before he went to bed. Jeffy! Man. When you scare me, Dad. What? Is that a spoon? Yeah. Are those Fruit Loops? It looks like it. You made a big mess in the kitchen, Jimmy. What mess in the kitchen? There's a huge mess in the kitchen. I didn't make a mess. Oh, come look at it. Come look at it. 
This mess right here, Jeffy. You did this mess. Man, I didn't do this mess. Yes, you did, Jeffy. Don't lie. No, I'm not lying. I didn't do it. Then why were there a spoon with Fruit Loops by you? I don't know, Dad. Maybe it was the boogeyman. It wasn't the boogeyman, Jeffy. You did this. You did it all last night. Before bed, you said you wanted to eat Fruit Loops. I never said that, Dad. I don't even like Fruit Loops. I like Cheerios. You're my fiber. Jeffy, you like Fruit Loops and then you did this mess. Dad, I did not do this mess. <laughs> oh, look, Jeffy. Look, a, a, a trail of Fruit Loops. Okay. Let's, let's follow them and see where they go. Okay. Oh, wow, Jeffy. Just wow. The Fruit Loops go right to where you were sleeping. But I didn't do it, Dad. Yes, you did. The Fruit Loops are right where you were sleeping. Dad, someone planted these here. No, they didn't. It's rigged. It is not rigged, Jeffy. They're trying to frame me. Who's trying to frame you? The Boogeyman. No, that's not the Boogeyman, Jeffy. What? What? These Fruit Loops look like little colorful buttholes. That's Jeffy, don't, don't talk like that. Look, 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 you, what? I didn't do it. Yes, you did. So, you, so you're saying you didn't do it? No, Dad. And if I did do it, I didn't see myself do it. You didn't see yourself do it? No. That doesn't make any sense, Jeffy. You, you did do it. Did you do it? No, I didn't, Dad. I told you. If I did do it, I didn't see myself do it. But I don't think I did it. Okay. Well, I'm going to find out who did it. Good. I'm, I'm going to find out who did it. If you didn't see yourself do it, then I'm going to see you do it. I'm going to see you do some more stuff. All right, security camera set up. So if Jeffy leaves the room or makes a big mess, I'll catch him lying and then I'll ground him. Hmm. All right, Jeffy, we're going to go back to sleep. And when we wake up, am I going to find another big mess? Dang, I didn't even do the last mess. Yes, you did, because the Fruit Loops came all the way to where you were sleeping and I... No. No. Okay. No. Okay, okay fine. No. All right. Well, when we wake up, I better not find another big mess. Okay, dang. Because this time I'll know. I'll have proof. <laughs> Jimmy! No. Hmm. Jimmy! What? What, what? what are you doing sleeping in my bed? Oh, I just wanted to sleep with you, Dad. No, no, no. You sleep on the floor. I sleep on the bed. Well, no. It's not really fair, Dad. Yes, Jimmy. You're supposed to sleep on the floor and I sleep on the bed. I'm not going to sleep with you in the same bed. Well, huh. Oh. Jeffy, did you make another mess? No. Are you sure? Yeah. Because I hid cameras. Cameras? Yeah, I hid cameras. So if you did, I'll be able to see. Let's, let's, let's go see, Jeffy. Okay. Oh! 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 Jeffy! What's wrong, Dang? Why did you make this mess? I didn't make the mess. You didn't make this mess? No. You promise? Yeah, I didn't do it. Well, I set up cameras, Jeffy, and we're going to be able to see if you did it or not. Cameras? All right, Jeffy, let's check the security cameras. What TV show is this, Dang? It's not a TV show. It's you on the security camera leaving the room. <gasps> Who's that, Dang? That's you. Oh, why'd you be in this diaper like that? That's what you do. I don't do that. Wait, wait, look. Uh, see, look, it's you messing up the couch, Jeffy. Dang, that is not me. That is you, Jeffy. And that is you messing up the couch. <laughs> see, Jeffy, you made a big mess. That kid's going to get a spanking on his butt. Yeah, you're going to get a spanking on your butt because it's you, Jeffy. Look, making a big mess. That's not me, Dang. You, Jeffy! Throw instead of making a big mess! Oh, I don't know why I threw your cushion at the lamp. Wait, wait, Jeffy, tell me why you did. You knocked at the camera? Why would you do that, Jeffy? Dang, I didn't do it! It wasn't me! That is totally you, Jeffy! That you are grounded! What's grounded? That, that means no toys? No, <gasps> no, 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 nothing fun? <gasps> uh, 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 you're, you're a bad boy! <laughs> yeah, cry, just cry. You think Jeffy's a bad boy? Yes, I did, you're a bad boy. <laughs> Boy, you're not a bad boy. Okay, look, you're not grounded if you help me pick up the couch and everything. Okay. All right, and then and we'll go back to bed. I just stop making messes. Mm -hmm. All right, Jeffy, we're gonna go back to sleep, and you better not make another mess, cause now I got you on camera and I saw you do it. So there's no excuses. If you do it again, I'm gonna ground you. That means no toys, no helmet, no, 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 nothing. But, but, no, 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 but daddies, you did it. We saw you do it on camera. There's no excuses. But I didn't see myself do it. Yes, you did. You saw yourself do it on camera. So stop saying that. Do not make another mess, okay? Because I got cameras everywhere. <sighs> Please kill me. Whoa. Jeffy, stop it! Go back to bed! I knew you were making those messes! Huh? What, Jeffy? What? Mm. Wait, he's sleeping. Wait, he's sleepwalking. 
That's why he's making all those messes. Oh man, I feel so bad. I've been yelling at him for sleepwalking and he can't help it. Oh man, I'm not supposed to wake a sleepwalker, but I gotta wake him up before he makes a big mess. Jeffy, wake up. Huh? Would you, wake up. What, Dad? I'm not sleeping. Yes, you are. You're sleepwalking, so you need to go back to bed. Sleepwalking? What's that? It's, it's, it's when you, you walk around while you're asleep and you can't help it, so I'm sorry for yelling at you, but you gotta go back to bed. Oh, no, Dad. I'm not sleepwalking. I've been awake the whole time. What? I just, I'm scared in the dark, and so I keep my eyes closed so I don't have to see the boogeyman. What? And so I try to do things with my eyes closed. Like, I try making a bowl of cereal with my eyes closed. I try cleaning the living room with my eyes closed. I just try to do stuff with my eyes closed. Daddy? <laughs> Daddy, you still there? So you just make messes on purpose? Daddy! <laughs> Daddy, where you at? Alright, Crass, today we're gonna be learning the alphabet. So sing along with me, Crass. <clears throat> A, A, B, B, C, C, D, D, E, E, F, F, G, G, H, H, I, I, J, J, K, K. One more K, and we'd be fucked, Crass. L, L, M, M, N, N, O, O, P, P, Q, Q, R, R, S, S, T, T, U, U, V, V, W, 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 dot x x x dot com y y n n z z now now i i no no my my a a b b c c's next next time time won't won't you you sing sing with with me me now i know my a b c any questions cross uh yeah what would have happened if we would have added another k i don't get it uh is that a real website google it when you get home Alright class, you're gonna need to know your alphabet because tomorrow each and every one of you are gonna have to come in front of the class and say your ABCs. And if you miss one letter, you fail the whole class for the whole year. Uh, you said if we miss one letter we fail, but do we have to say every letter twice like you did or can we just do it the right way? You have to say every letter twice just like it is up there. They wouldn't put it up there if it wasn't right. So memorize your alphabet, and I'll see you tomorrow, Crass. Okay, the wrong way. Got it. Oh, man, guys. I don't want to talk in front of the class. I'm scared. Why? Because I'm afraid I'm going to pee my pants. Well, don't. I can't help it. Every time I talk in front of somebody, I get scared and pee my pants. I'll just do what I do when I talk to people. Imagine me in my underwear. Rock hard eight pack. Big pecs. Huge dong. I'm talking huge dong crammed into a tiny little speedo. Hot damn, Cody. Well, Jeffy, you say you pee your pants every time you talk to someone, but you're talking to us. Oh, man. I just pissed my pants. Yeah, my pants are wet, too. Hey, Daddy. Hey, Jeffy, how was school? It was awful. I peed my pants again. You peed your pants again? Yeah, I was just talking to my friends, and I got scared, and I just started peeing my pants. Jeffy, you need to stop peeing your pants. I know, Daddy, but I can't help it. Every time I start talking to someone, I get scared, and then I pee my pants. I'm peeing my pants right now, talking to you. Jeffy, peeing your pants at this age is not normal. You're too old for that. I know, Daddy, and it's going to be even worse tomorrow, because tomorrow, i got to get up in front of the entire class at school and say my ABCs. My pants are going to be all full of piss. Well, Jeffy, why do you keep peeing your pants when you talk to people? Are, are you scared of people? Like, what, do, you, do, you, do you not like people looking at you? No, Danny. I just get so scared when people start looking at me. I wish I was invisible. But you wish you were invisible? Yeah. Well, um, I got something that'll help you, Jeffy. I got something that'll help you. Oh, you do? Yeah, I got you these, uh, invisible glasses. Invisible glasses? Uh, uh-huh. But I can see them. Well, the glasses are invisible, Jeffy. But when you put these glasses on, you'll turn invisible. <gasps> really, Daddy? Yep, yep. And they have magic invisible powder in them. And when you put them on, you turn invisible and nobody will be able to see you. <gasps> can I try them on, Daddy? Yeah, you can try them on. But remember, when you put them on, you'll be invisible. I won't be able to see. <gasps> where did Jeffy go? <gasps> where, where's Jeffy? I'm right here, Daddy. Jeffy, where are you? Daddy, I'm right here. Jeffy, where are you? I can't Daddy, right, right here. Where are you? Daddy, right here. Oh, there you are. Jeffy, thank God. I thought I lost you forever. So Whew. they really work, Daddy? Yeah, they work. I couldn't find you, Jeffy. You were, you were gone forever. But, you know, tomorrow when you're at school and you say your ABCs, put those glasses on and the whole class won't be able to see you. Okay. Thanks, Daddy. Yeah, go have fun with them. <sighs> He's such an idiot. All right, class. 
I hope you all study the alphabet because each and every one of you are gonna come up here and say the alphabet. All right, Cody, you're first. Yeah, this is gonna be easy peasy. I'm about to imagine myself in my underwear. Whoa, Jeffy, nice glasses. You can't see me, Junior. I'm invisible. What? Junior, I got these glasses on that make me invisible so no one can see me. They can only hear me. What? Well, I can see you. No, you can't, Junior. I'm invisible. Your goofy glasses. I can do whatever I want. Watch this. All right, Cody, you can start saying your alphabet now. <clears throat> A A B B C C D D E E F F G G. Jeffy, go back to your seat. What? What? J Jeffy, you just hit the teacher in the face. Yeah, sure did, and he didn't even see me, cause I'm invisible. Now, if you'll excuse me, there's some things I need to do while I'm invisible. Could that be? Uh, hello? Hey there, is this your son? Yes, unfortunately. What'd he do? I caught him at the beach smacking girls' butts. What? Sure was, Daddy. I was smacking the shit out of him. Like, whoosh. Yeah, they didn't complain or anything, but I arrested him anyway because he was making me jealous. Whenever he does it, it's cute, but whenever I do it, it's a crime or something. They're like, stop grabbing my butt, old man. He was going crazy on them butts. Sure was, Daddy. I was getting more ass than a toilet seat. He was. I wish I was him. I wouldn't wash that hand. I didn't plan on it. I, he was supposed to be at school. Oh, he was at school. Ass school. Actually, it was more like ass detention because he was punishing them butts, just spanking them. Yep. Call me Principal Ass Smacker, Daddy. Jeff, you're so grounded. Uh, look, could you just keep an eye on your kid, please? I don't want him going on a rampage around town on all the butts. Oh, I'll make sure I take care of him. Jeffy, get your ass inside. All right, Daddy. <sighs> Jeffy, you skipped school to smack butts on the beach all day. Well, when you put him like that, Daddy, doesn't sound too bad, now does it? Jeffy, you were supposed to go to school. I did go to school, and I punched my teacher in the face. Why? Because I'm invisible, he couldn't see me, and I can do whatever I want. Jeffy, you're not invisible. Yes, I am. Daddy, you gave me these glasses and told me that they made me invisible, so now no one can see me. Jeffy, you're not invisible. I lied. I said those glasses made you invisible so you had a better time talking in front of the class. I lied. You're not invisible. I can see you. Oh, yeah? Well, if you can see me, how many fingers am I holding up? Four. Hmm. Well, I can't even see how many fingers I'm holding up because I'm invisible and I can't see my own fingers. Jeffy, you're not invisible. I can see you. Daddy, I think you're just jealous because your hand doesn't smell like butt. Why, why, why would I be? I'm not jealous of that. Oh, yeah? Well, then how many butts did you smack today, Daddy? Zero. All right, well, I got six more than you. <sighs> Smell my hand, Daddy. It smells like six fat asses. Jimmy, you know what? You're grounded. Go to your room. Oh, yeah, Daddy? All right, well, you wouldn't even see me if I was in my room. So I'm out this bitch. <sighs> Hello? Hey there, I'm back. This time I caught him videotaping girls in a public restroom. What? Yep, it was pretty high quality video actually. 1080p, 60 frames a second. I had to uh, confiscate it and download it to my laptop. Hmm. I just got two grand out of my bank account because I ran out of toilet paper. Now, now, now where's my wallet? Hmm. You set that right here for now. Oh, oh, here it is. Silly me. You mother -fucker. You get the fuck back here! I'm gonna shoot your ass! Oh, Dan got shot! What? Yeah, hey there, Mario. Jeffy got shot. How? Well, he was trying to steal money from an ATM and somebody shot him. Trying to steal money from an ATM? Yeah, don't worry though, I can't arrest him because he's a minor, so... Bad! That's bad! You do not steal things! No! Bad! All right, that's about all I got. Jeffy, why are we trying to steal money from an ATM? Because I'm invisible. They couldn't see me. Jeffy, if you're invisible, then how'd you get shot? Because he was just randomly shooting, and he 360 no-scoped me because he's a PC player, that bitch. You know what, Jeffy? I'm done with those glasses. You're not having the glasses anymore. 
But Daddy, I need my invisible glasses! No! What, invisible glasses? What's he talking about? Okay, look, I, I told him that these glasses will make him invisible when he puts them on because he had a project at school and he was afraid to talk in front of the class, so I said when he put these glasses on, they made him invisible. Well, well, like, do they make him invisible? No, you just saw him! But, are you sure? Because he, he got away with a lot of stuff today. He smacked butts. Yeah, he got really lucky for smacking the butts, but these glasses don't do anything. They're just normal, stupid, ugly-looking, goofy glasses. Huh. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to confiscate those glasses. Uh, I don't want them, uh, falling into the wrong hands. You know, I, I, I can't risk these actually turning somebody invisible. But they won't. They don't work. They're not real. I just made that up. Oh, I'll be the judge of that. Uh, but, but, but I have to take these for, uh, for, uh, evidence. So I'm just gonna go take these to the bathroom. Um, I mean, I mean the, the, the evidence room. Because the, these are evidence. So that's, that's where I'm going. But, bye. You can see me, can't you? All right, Jeffy, it's time to go to bed. Okay, Dad, good night. Good night, Jeffy. Oh, wait, Dad, can you leave the light on? But leave the light on, why? Yeah, I've been hearing scary noises, Dad. Like loud banging noises. Loud banging noises? Yeah. I haven't heard any noises. Well, I have, Dad, so can you just leave the light on? Fine, Jeffy, I'll leave the light on. Good night. Good night, Dad. Okay, Jeffy's in bed. Now I can relax. What's that noise? Jeffy, what was that noise? Oh, you heard it too, Daddy? Yeah, Jeffy, it was like a loud banging noise. <gasps> Jeffy! What? What happened to your crib? Oh, let me show you, Daddy. Show me, what, did you bite it or something? <laughs> Daddy, stop it! Well, what are you doing? I'm hitting my crib with a hammer, Daddy. Why would you do that, Jeffy? You're the one making the loud banging noise. Oh, I guess you're right, Daddy. Jeffy, why'd you make me leave the light on if you're just gonna hit your crib with a hammer? So I can see what I'm hitting, Daddy. Jeffy, that's stupid. You better not hit your crib anymore ever again. Give me it. Jeffy, stop it. Jeffy, if you hit it one more time, you're grounded. If you hit it one more time, I'm taking all your toys. If you hit it one more time, I'm kicking you out of the house. If you hit it one more time, I I'm gonna unadopt you. If you hit it one more time, Jeffy, um, I'm gonna take you out of school. You're never going back to school again. Stop it, Jeffy! Jeff, give, give, give me the hammer! Give me the hammer, Jeffy! Just go to bed! <sighs> I can't believe Jeffy was destroying his own crib. Ah, Daddy! What, Jeffy? I had a scary dream, Daddy! Well, a scary dream about what? A scary bunny rabbit was trying to eat me! Uh, a bunny rabbit was trying to eat you? Yeah! Well, Jeffy, you're dressed as a bunny rabbit. Do you think you were just trying to bite yourself in your dream? No! Well, Jeffy, look, it was just a dream. Go back to bed. No, Daddy! Can I please sleep on the couch? Well, no, you're not sleeping on the couch, Jeffy. I'm on the couch. Please! Let me sleep on your couch, Daddy! Fine, Jeffy. Go to sleep. But it, it, it was just a dream. And just for the night. <laughs> what, Jeffy? It was a scary bunny rabbit who was trying to eat me again, Daddy! Jeffy, it was just a bad dream. It's not real. Yes, it is, Daddy! It was like... No! Oh. Hey, please! Oh, right, Jeffy, right, you know what? I'm gonna call a doctor if you're really having this bad of a dream, and, and maybe he can stop it. Let, let me call a doctor. Hey there, I'm the problem. What's the doctor? <laughs> oh my god, I can't believe I did that. I, I am all over the place today. Line! Uh, no, I, I got it. I'm the doctor. What's the problem? Okay, the problem is, doctor, is uh, my son had a bad dream. He had a bad dream? Yeah. What do you want me to do about it? Do you even hear yourself? You called the doctor because your son had a bad dream? Well, who else am I supposed to call? Nobody! You're supposed to tell him to grow a pair and then you send him back to bed! Well, he said it was a really scary dream. Oh, it was a really scary dream? Yeah. Oh, did you give him some milky and try rubbing his tummy? Wait, no. Oh, maybe that would have helped. Well, maybe you should have done that before you called the doctor about a bad dream. Well, can you do all that for me? No! No, I'm not going to do that. What, what, what? You want me to tie his shoes, too? And put out put out his clothes for tomorrow for school? Or, or go talk to his school bully? And, and then maybe after that we can go play catch in the yard. Wait, wait, really? No! No, I think you just want to pay me to be his father because you don't want to be a parent. 
Oh, look, he just said he was having a bad dream. Jeffy, tell him about the bad dream. Hey, a really scary bunny in it, and the bunny was trying to eat me. Bunnies are not even scary. This one was. Oh, look, is there a way we can, like, stop the bad dreams? Like, 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 any way we can do that? How? How? You tell me one good way that we can do that. Um, well, can we, like, go inside his dream and, like, and kill the bunny in his dream? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we, we're gonna do that. Yep. I, I was actually thinking that, and then you said it. I, I can't believe you did that. But yes, that's exactly what we're gonna do. Wait, really? Yeah, yeah, really, really. I, I even got the machine. It's out in the car. Yeah, I brought it just in case. Just in case something like this was gonna happen. We're wait, doing this. Wait, really? Oh, yeah, we're doing it. I'm pumped. I'm ready to go. I, I am doing this. But, um, first I gotta change my shirt. This, this doesn't really show up on green screen. Uh, okay. Yep, there she is, the Dream Machine 3000. She is a beauty. Did you write that on with Sharpie? Oh, uh, I'm sorry, where is your Dream Machine 3000? Huh? Let, let, let me see it, where's it at? How does it work? Well, you see that hilarious tinfoil hat that I made for Jeffy? Yeah. That doesn't do anything. But that cable right there connects up to this machine, so whenever he falls asleep and starts dreaming, a portal will appear right here, and then we can just jump straight into his dream. Wait, that's how easy it works? Yeah. Alright, Jeffy, uh, go to sleep. <laughs> See, there it is. There's the portal. Wait, so, so we just jump in? Yeah, just uh, move over here. Oh, okay. All right. Now, uh, before we go in, real quick, um, if we die in the dream, we die in real life. So let's be careful in there, okay? Uh, uh, okay. All right, so we jump in on three. One, two, three, jump! <laughs> Where are we? We're in Jeffy's dream. You remember the dream machine and all that? We're not in France. Uh, I, I'm sorry, I just it, it just looks so weird, you know? Yeah, people's dreams get pretty weird. Sometimes they're even wet. Is that a flying Cheerio box? Uh, yeah, looks like it. This is so, so weird. Where do you think Jeffy is? Hmm, I don't know. Jeffy! I'll start looking for him. Jeffy! 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 Where is he? Is that him? The dinosaur? Jeffy! Hey, look, Daddy! I'm a dinosaur! Roar! Wow, that, that, that's great, Jeffy. Uh, why is he a dinosaur? Because in dreams, you can be whatever you want. Oh, uh, well, well, Jeffy, where's the scary bunny rabbit at? I don't know, Daddy. I haven't seen him. Well, Jeffy, we came inside your dream to get rid of that scary bunny rabbit. Now, where is he at? I don't know, Daddy. You want to see me turn into a giraffe? Uh. Oh, look! I'm a giraffe! Hey, everybody! I'm a giraffe! Oh, Jeffy! How are we supposed to help you if we can't find it? Do you see the scary bunny rabbit anywhere? Um, no. Well, maybe Jeffy was lying and he just made all this stuff up. Look, let's just go home. But, but really? Yeah. Oh, what? I, I mean, I, I just thought maybe we would spend a little more time here. I mean, we just got here. So. But, but we don't see the scary bunny rabbit, which is the only reason that we're here, and you said if we die in here, then we're stuck in here, so I'm not going to risk dying. Well, I mean, I mean, yeah, that's true, it's just there's, there's a lot of other stuff here that we haven't explored. But this, so. we didn't come in here to explore, we came in here to kill the bunny rabbit, so if we don't see him, let's go! Okay, yeah. Go uh -huh. Oh! Uh -huh. <laughs> All right, there's the portal. Let's leave. Yeah, uh, are you sure you want to leave already? I, I just feel like this has been kind of lame. Well, I don't want to risk dying like I said. I don't want to die here, so let's go. Yeah, uh, all right. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Jeffy, wake up. <laughs> wake up, Jeffy. <laughs> there was no scary bunny in your dream. I know, Daddy. I didn't see it either. So you're just making it up? No, I promised there was a scary bunny. Well, it's not there anymore, Jeffy, so go to bed. You wasted this nice man's time. Aww. Yeah, you did. I'm sorry for wasting your time, but, uh, you know, he always makes up stuff. Yeah, well, I guess I got the Dream Machine 3000 out for no reason. I mean, it's still a nice machine, though, but uh, thanks for all your help. All right. Where are you going? Yeah. <sighs> I like this. This is nice, you know? Just two dudes sitting back, having some root beers. Root beers, you know, like the soda. But this is nice. This is... I like this. How long do you plan on staying? Uh, man, don't make me go back home to my wife. Ugh. You, you remember how your son said he had a bad dream? Uh, yeah. Well, I had a bad dream once. I dreamt I was in my late 40s in a failing marriage with a truckload of debt. Then I woke up and it wasn't a dream. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. Me too. Ah, Daddy! Jeffy? The scary bunny's in my bedroom! What, the scary bunny's in your bedroom? Jeffy, stop lying. He wasn't in your dream, and he's also not in your room. Wait a minute, Mario. What? what? Wait, 
Wait, Mario? Yeah. What, Mario. I, I think that's the first time I've ever called you by your name. Wait, yeah, I think so, yeah. Mario. Ew. Yeah, I don't like that. What? what? Mario. M Mario. It's just so loud. It's like Mar Mario. Is that what the M on your hat stands for? Yeah, w what were you saying before the Mario thing? Oh, oh, yeah. Uh, remember how we had a portal that let us go inside of Jeffy's dreams? Yeah. Well, I forgot to mention that things inside of his dreams can escape through that same portal. Wait, so you're telling me that the, the bunny rabbit could be in the real world right now? Yeah, maybe. Well, well, I think Jeffy's lying. I don't, I don't, I think he could just be making it up. Well, we should still go check it out. Come on. We, we gotta go wabbit. Uh, okay. All right, Jeffy, where's that rabbit at? Oh, no, Daddy! Oh. Ah, he's right there, Daddy! Uh, well, what do we do? Grab him! <laughs> he's too quick! Yeah, I'm feeling like a tortoise right now. Y you know, like from the story, with the, with the tortoise and the hare and the race. Yeah. But, but hey, uh, the, the tortoise won, though. How are we going to catch him? Um, I've seen a lot of cartoons, and I think i got an idea. Uh, okay. This, this, this is stupid. It's gonna work. How? Okay, look, I've seen a lot of cartoons, and I know that bunny rabbits like carrots. And those are some nice, juicy carrots in that box. When he comes up, I'm gonna pull the string, and he'll be trapped, and then we Amazon Prime him to, like, Antarctica or something. Uh, okay, are you sure it's gonna work? Yeah, it's gonna work. Oh, here he comes! Yeah, that's right, that's right. You get those carrots. Get those carrots. Get those carrots! What? Ah, oh, dang it! What happened? I, I got too excited and I pulled out too soon. What, what, he was right there! Yeah, I know. I just, I was excited and I got selfish. I just wanted it so bad. Well, he was right there! What are we gonna do now? Don't yell at me, okay? We'll think of something. Let's just, let's just set the box back up. He's not gonna fall for that twice. Let's try it. All right, it's definitely gonna work this time. Well, what are the odds of him coming back a second time? Look, bunny rabbits like carrots, okay? He wants those carrots, the juicy carrots. He's well, there he is! Ah! What, did, did I get him? No, you messed up again! What, really? Yeah, he, he was right there, he was about to eat him, and then you freaked out again. What? Uh, oh, I'm sorry, okay? Just, just set the box back up. It's not gonna work a third time. Let's do it again, I promise, it'll work this time. Okay, third time's a charm. No, 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 there's no three times a charm. I think somebody else should pull the string. Why? Because you messed up twice already, so give it to Jeffy. Well, I don't understand why I can't just pull the string. Because you messed up twice already. I don't want you messing up again. Well, I said third time's a charm, didn't I? There's no third time to charm because you pulled out too early the first two times. Well, okay, you know what? You sound just like my wife. She's always nagging me, saying my pullout game sucks. Because it does suck. You pulled out too early two times already. Well, okay, you know what, man? That's a low blow. What, what are you going to make fun of my ED next? Well, I'm just saying you missed the shot. Oh, okay, you know what? You sound just like my high school basketball coach? Okay, yeah, I missed the game winning shot, okay? And yeah, I lost the entire game and I got made fun of. But you know what? I tried. Well, you tried the first two times and guess what? You messed up. Okay, yeah, but at least I'm trying, okay? I'm doing the best I can over here. I don't see you doing- ah! well, Jeffy, did you get him? Yeah! You get in the box, guys! He, he got him! Let, let's go check! Let's get him! Alright, let's see that rabbit. Yeah, let's see it. Jay! Well, where's the rabbit? And where are the carrots? Oh, uh, the bunny rabbit took the carrots. Oh, you're supposed to catch him with the box, Jimmy! Oh, I was scared, Daddy. Oh, what are we gonna do? Set the box back up. No! No, no more box! I'm tired of the box! It's, it's dumb! So what are we gonna do now? Alright, I, I, I got another idea. Alright, is this your kid? Uh, no, that, that, that's Bowser's kid. Awesome! Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna plug the machine into him, and then whenever his dream portal shows up, I'm gonna take a carrot, and then I'm gonna wait for the rabbit to show up, and then I'm gonna throw the carrot through the portal. Oh, and then the rabbit will get stuck in his dream. Yep, he's not your kid, so who cares? Yeah, I don't care. Alright, that's awesome, yeah. Alright, let's just plug this in here. Nope, see, there's the dream portal. Uh, now just get the carrot, and then we gotta wait for that rabbit. Okay. What? What? There he is. Alright. You who missed the bunny rabbit, come get this juicy carrot. Go! Okay, I think he's buying it. All right, you want it? Go get it! Yeah, we did yeah, it! Yeah, yeah we, we did, did it! it. Yeah, uh, uh, <laughs> we just hit you in the face. Oh, uh, well, well, we did it though. What do we do now? Uh, oh, oh, run! The kids waking up. Oh my god! Uh, <laughs> scary bunny rabbit! <laughs> All right, Jeffy, it's time to go to school. Daddy, let me tell you something. I don't like school. I know you don't like school, Jeffy, but every kid has to go to school. Except for me, because I don't have to. You do, Jeffy. You do have to go to school. <sighs> Jeffy, I don't have time to play games. You're already running late. Look, I'm going to go wait in the car. You better be out there in two minutes. I have to brush my teeth first. <sighs> then brush your teeth really fast, and then meet me in the car, okay? I'm going to be outside. All right, daddy. Now I'm all out of toothpaste, and I can't brush my teeth. Oh, well. Come on, Jeffy, we don't have all day. You have to go to school. 
Get your ass in the car, Jeffy. It's time to go to school. I don't have to. You do have to, Jeffy. You do have to go to school. Get your ass in the car. I'm giving you a spanking. Well, you better clap these cheeks, Daddy, because I'm not going to school. Get your ass in the car, Jeffy. I'm, getting, I'm taking your Fortnite. Fine, Daddy. You win. Oh, my God. So annoying. Where did Jeffy go? Jeffy! Where'd you go, Jeffy? Well, you know what? Uh, I'm gonna leave without you. Uh, after school, I was gonna take you on a, on a toy shopping spree, but since uh, you wanna play games, uh, you know what, you're not going. So, I'm leaving without you, Jeffy. I'm leaving without you. Ah! What, what was that? Ah! 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 Jeffy, what's wrong? You ran over my leg, Daddy. Well, what was your leg doing behind the tire? What was your tire doing in front of my leg? Jeffy, why would you put your leg anywhere near a car tire? Because I didn't want to go to school. Well, was it worth it? Was it worth not going to school by breaking your leg? I don't know, Daddy. Do I have to go to school? Well, let me call a doctor. Just come on. <laughs> Jeffy, it's okay. I called the doctor. He's on his way. Daddy, I think my leg is broken. Well, stop swinging it around like that. <laughs> oh, all right. Hey there, somebody call a doctor? Is that a chicken leg? Oh yeah, you caught me on my lunch break. It's okay, I got time, what's up? Well, uh, I accidentally ran over my son's leg with my car. How do you accidentally run over your son's leg? Well, it's a long story, we, we just want to know if it's broken. Well, if it's broken, why is he chewing on it? <laughs> Wait, Jeffy, spit that out! It really hurts, doctor! Well, how do you even know it's broken? Well, uh, Jeffy, are you sure it's broken? Hold on, let me make sure. Wait, what? <laughs> Give me the hammer! Give, oh, give, oh. Give, give me the hammer! Well, if it wasn't broken, it definitely is now. Well, well what do we do about it? Um, well, let me take an x-ray of the leg, and I'll be right back. Alright, so I got the x-ray. Is it broken? Oh, no, it's perfect, actually. Wait, really? Yeah, just look for yourself. Oh, man, doesn't that look delicious? Look at all the meat on there. Oh, it's gonna be so good when I take this first bite. Oh. What are you doing? You're supposed to x-ray my son's leg! Oh, yeah. Yeah, that'd be smart. I should probably do that, too. Why would you x-ray a chicken leg? Oh, well, see, I'm paranoid, and I x-ray all the food that I eat, you know, in case somebody tries to hide some glass or razor blades or something in there. I'm like a walking Chernobyl from all the radiation that I've eaten. My balls have balls. I have a tail. I pee green slime. But that's, that's probably from something I did in college. You know, wrap it before you tap it. All right, so what are we doing about my son's leg? Are you gonna x-ray that? Yeah, sure, I can do that. But, uh, first, I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat this. What, what, what? Ah, how rude! Just x-ray my son's leg so we can see if it's broken. Fine. Okay, so I got the x-ray. Is it a chicken leg again? No, it's your son's leg this time. Wait, so it's broken? Yeah, his fibula here looks pretty bad. It looks like a chair after my ex-wife sat on it. Broken, because she's fat. Alright, so how do we fix my son's broken leg? Oh, it's fine. We'll just put a cast on it, and it'll heal on its own. A cast? B what the fuck? What? He doesn't have any toes. Jeffy, you don't have any toes? My little piggies went to the market. That's what my mommy told me. Yeah, they must have wee wee weed way the fuck home. They must have loved roast beef. Well, can we give him like a toe transplant? A toe transplant? What, are you gonna donate your toes? I don't have any to give. Uh, uh, okay, okay, well, let's just get back to the leg. So you have to put a cast on it? Yeah, I guess I can put a cast on the leg right now. Alright. So how's the cast coming? Oh, it's coming pretty good. I'm almost done. Uh, Jeffy, could you hold that down for me? Yeah. Alright. And done. Oh, look at that. It's just like new. Now I can finally eat it. <laughs> what, what? Oh, come on! I just wrapped that! You were supposed to wrap my son's broken leg! Oh, yeah. Yeah, I guess I could do that, too. Just do that! His leg is broken! Alright, fine. <laughs> Alright. And done. There's the cast. How's the cast feel on your leg, Jeffy? There's a big-ass sock, Daddy. It's not a sock, Jeffy. It's a cast. There's my baseball bat. Bow up! <laughs> you just got hit in the head with my pee, pee Daddy. 16 inches of Jeffy pipe. <laughs> okay, how long do you have to wear the cast for? Uh, probably about six to eight weeks. Six to eight weeks? That's forever! What are you, five years old? Oh, that's forever. That's what you sound like. Oh, okay, what about him going to school? How's he gonna go to school? No, he can't go to school. He pretty much just has to sit in bed and not move. Just get him whatever he needs. I already do that for him. Oh, good. Then this shouldn't be too hard. All right, well, I will see you again in forever. <sighs> Jeffy, look, let's just get in bed so you can't move. All right, Daddy, pick up my pee pee. <sighs> you're touching my pee pee, Daddy. It's your leg. All right, Jeffy, look, you're gonna stay in your room for six to eight weeks until your leg gets better. So if you need anything, just call me. Daddy! What, Jeffy? Daddy, I don't wanna be in my room anymore. I wanna go back to the couch. I just brought you to your room, Jeffy. Why didn't you tell me that when we were leaving the couch? Cause I just got lonely when you left. <sighs> All right, let's go to the couch. 
All right, Jeffy, you're back on the couch. Well, now, Danny, I want to go back to my room. Well, no, Jeffy, you're not going back to your room. We were just in your room, and you wanted to come to the couch, so you're staying on the couch. Well, I changed my mind. Well, I'm not going to help you walk from here to your room over and over again. Well, if you didn't break my leg, then I would just walk to my room myself. I did not break your leg, Jeffy. Oh, okay, Danny. Well, I guess a ghost was driving your car and put your car in reverse and backed over my leg. Well, Jeffy, I wouldn't have ran over your leg if you didn't stick your leg under the tire. Well, you should have been paying more attention, Daddy! I, I guess you're right, Jeffy. I should have been paying attention when I was driving. So I guess it is my fault for breaking your leg, so I'm sorry. Well, apology not accepted, Daddy! Well, whatever, Jeffy. If you need anything, just call me. Daddy! What? Oh, I'm hungry. What do you want to eat? French fries. You're not eating French fries for dinner, Jeffy. That's not healthy. Oh, well, I guess I'll just sit here with my, with my broken leg that you caused and just starve and think about French fries. All right, Jeffy, fine. I'll get you french fries. With green ketchup. Green ketchup? Yep. There's no such thing as green ketchup. Well, then find it, Daddy! Fine, Jeffy. Just lower your voice. All right, Jeffy. Here's your french fries. Where's my green ketchup? And here's your green ketchup. Oh, hell yeah, Daddy. Give me sin. Hey, Daddy. I'm about to sneeze. Well, you know what, Jeffy? You better eat all of that. I'm not eating that shit. Looks like boogers and poop. Well, Jeffy, I went all the way to the store. I went all the way to the store to get that. You're being a dickhole. <laughs> you broke Jeffy's leg, and now you're saying Jeffy's a dickhole. I didn't ask for my leg to be broken. Okay, Jeffy, what do you want me to do with this? What, what do you want me to do with it? Throw it away. I don't like it. Oh, Jeffy, I went all the way to the store to get you green ketchup, and now you're not gonna eat it. <sighs> oh, I can't believe Jeffy's being annoying. I'm coming, Jeffy! Daddy! What, Jeffy? Can you get me my cat piano? Where's it at? It's right behind you. <sighs> Jeffy, why didn't you just get it? Cause my leg is broken! <sighs> Ow! Daddy, ow! Oh, I'm, I'm, oh, I'm sorry, Jeffy! Well, just because you broke my leg once doesn't mean you have to keep torturing me, Daddy! Oh, look, look, here's your cat piano. I'm sorry, Jeffy. Thanks, Daddy. Why are you hitting it with your broken leg? Doesn't that hurt? Oh, it hurts real bad, Daddy. Well, then use your hand. Oh, yeah. All right, if you need anything, just call me. Daddy! What, Jeffy? I love you. I love you, too. Oh, look, 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 look. Instead of screaming my name every time you want something, look. Here's a bell. So every time you want something, just ring the bell, and I'll get it. Oh, hell yeah, Daddy. That's what I'm talking about. Yep, so that's how it works. Every time you want something, just ring the bell. All right, so I'll see you later. Jeffy, stop it! I want something, Daddy! What do you want? A bowl of ice cream. You're not getting a bowl of ice cream because you didn't eat your french fries with the green ketchup. Ice cream. No ice cream. Ice cream. No ice cream. Ice cream! No ice cream! Ice cream, ice cream, ice cream, ice cream, ice cream! Oh, fine, I'll get it, you little shit! <laughs> First you break Jeffy's leg, then you call him a dickhole, and then you call him a little shit! <laughs> okay, I'll get your stupid ice cream! All right, Jeffy, here's your ice cream. What do you want now? A new daddy. Why? Because you're full of shit. Why would you say that, Jeffy? Where's the chocolate ice cream at, daddy? You never said you wanted chocolate ice cream. You just said you wanted ice cream. I always eat chocolate ice cream. Well, next time say you want chocolate ice cream so I know what you want. Chocolate ice cream. I'm not getting you chocolate ice cream. Chocolate ice cream. You already have ice cream. We don't have chocolate. Chocolate ice cream! I'm not getting you chocolate ice cream! SpongeBob toys! What? SpongeBob, I'm not getting you SpongeBob toys. Go get it! No! Hop ass, Daddy! I'm not getting SpongeBob toys! <laughs> SpongeBob toys! I'm going! What do you think I'm doing? All right, Jeffy, this is the only SpongeBob toy I could find. Danny, what's wrong with SpongeBob? He looks just as cracked out as you are. Jeffy, look, it's just a fun toy. Help me stretch it. That's what she said. <laughs> Jeffy, why'd you let go of it? Because it was annoying as fuck. Well, Jeffy, that was the only SpongeBob toy I could find. More SpongeBob toys! Well, look, they didn't have SpongeBob, but they had Patrick. Daddy, that was my face when I saw the girl with the fat ass. It was also my face when I found out that we didn't have any chocolate ice cream. Well, Jeffy, th those are the only two toys you can play with. That's the only ones I could find. Fortnite pinata! What? Pinata? Fortnite pinata! It's not your birthday. Where am I going to get a pinata at? Fortnite pinata! Okay, I'll Google it. I'll find it. 
All right, Jeffy, here's your Fortnite pinata. Daddy, where did you bump your head at? What? That is not the Fortnite pinata. Well, I don't know what Fortnite is. Go play Fortnite and try again. <sighs> All right, Jeffy, how about this? Oh, hell yeah, Daddy. That's what I'm talking about. Give me see it. Well, you, why would you break it, Jeffy? It came off of his Jeffy! No! Why would you break it? I don't know, Dad. I was just trying to get it open. Well, look, there's cool stuff inside it, like, like whatever those are. And, and Toys? Yeah, look. Fortnite toys? Look, there's some at the door. So, look, just, just play with this, and I'll be right back. Thanks, Dad. Uh, hello? Hey, I'm Jeffy, teacher. And I see he no come to school today. And I hear he break your leg. Yes, uh, Jeffy broke his leg and he's not going to be able to come back to school for six to eight weeks. Oh, just because he break his leg doesn't mean he doesn't have to run. So I bring you six to eight weeks worth of homework and he has to do it whilst he fail. Oh, yes, he still needs to learn even though uh, he broke his leg. So I'll make sure he does this, okay? All right. Thank you. All right, Jeffy. Who was at the door, Daddy? It was your teacher. What did his ass want? Well, he brought you the next six to eight weeks worth of schoolwork. Schoolwork? I'm not even school. Yes, Jeffy, but just because you broke your leg doesn't mean you can't learn. Well, my brain don't work. We all know that, Jeffy. I'm not doing it. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. Eat my ass. You know what? No more bell. No, Dad, hold on. I gotta ding it. I got something to say. <sighs> you. No more bell for you, Jeffy. Dad, this was my face when I saw all that homework I got. And that's gonna be your teacher's face when you finish all this homework. Oh. Several months later. <sighs> All right, Jeffy, you only have a few more pages of homework left. Kill me. <gasps> Jeffy, I think that's the doctor. It's been six to eight weeks. I think you get your cast off today. Yay. A few moments later. <sighs> All right, and there you go. The cast is off and your leg is back to normal. Well, back to normal for you, you no toe heaven freak. Well, doctor, thanks for fixing his leg. Jeffy, I hope you learned your lesson these last six to eight weeks. I sure did, Daddy. Now get ready to go to school, okay? Okay. <sighs> Hopefully Jeffy learned his lesson. Where? Jeffy! Where are you at, Jeffy? <sighs> Jeffy, what are you doing? Daddy, you better hurry up and run these bitches over, because I'm looking forward to another six to eight week vacation. <sighs> <laughs> oh man, I'm so sick. <laughs> no, Jeffy, stop it. Stop it, Jeffy, I'm sick. I'm sick, Jeffy. Stop, no, no, stop, stop it, Jeffy. Stop it, Jeffy. Stop it, Jeffy. Eat your hat, dang. Stop it, Jeffy. Give me my hat back. I don't have Hi, Mario. Where have you been? Yeah, you've been gone for like a year. I got stuck at a stop sign, Mario. It wouldn't turn green. Cause stop signs don't turn green. Yeah, that's what the cop told me. Danny, I think she moved to Baltimore. Oh, that's silly, Jeffy. Well, you've been gone for like a year, but I don't really care. I, I'm sick, can you just help take care of me? Oh, I'm so sorry, Mario. Let me check to see if you have a fever. Oh, hot, 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 hot. Oh my gosh, Mario, you're burning up. I'll go to the store and get you some medicine. No! You're not allowed to leave. Yeah, you might leave and go to Baltimore again or something. No, 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 every time you leave, you leave for like a year. You're gonna stay right here, okay? You're not leaving, you're not going anywhere. Okay, Mario, but let me at least call a doctor, okay? Oh, right, you're gonna call a doctor right here. You're not gonna move. Just pull out your phone and call a doctor. Okay. <coughs> hey there, somebody call a doctor. Oh my gosh, you look horrible. Oh, okay. Now I'm sick and my feelings are hurt. You know, you're not much to look at either. You know, if you were one of the only two girls left on Earth, I'd say show me the other one. Anyway, Mario is really sick. <laughs> Can't you help him? Oh, he's sick. Well, what about me? I'm sick. Nobody seems to care about me. You know, who does the doctor call when he gets sick? Nobody ever seems to care about me or my feelings. And that apple a day thing, that's bull crap. I've been eating an apple every single day and I still got sick. Okay, well, you know what? You shouldn't have became a doctor if you're just gonna whine and complain every time someone gets sick. All right. <laughs> You know what? Your game suck and I'm not helping you. Well, hey, I need a doctor. Oh. <laughs> what are we going to do? <laughs> Poor Mario, why don't I make you some soup? Does it involve you having to leave the house? No. Okay, then great. Go make me some soup. Just don't leave for a year. Okay. <laughs> oh, Jeffy. 
I'm gonna, I'm gonna, <coughs> Mush it, Daddy. Okay, Mario, here's your alphabet soup. Alphabet soup? And there's a special message in there just for you. Special message, get well soon, Daddy. Oh, I get what you're trying to do. You haven't been here for a year, so you're trying to get freaky. I mean, I'm sick, but I can still take off my gloves. Jeffy wrote it for you. What? Yeah, Daddy, I spelled it for you. And I also have your spoon right here in my gooch. Nani? <laughs> Ew. Yeah, let me get it for you. But no, no, you don't. <clears throat> oh. What? oh, yeah, Daddy, get away from that. No, get away from me, Jeffy. I don't, want, I don't want the stupid spoon. Throw it away. Daddy, here comes your train. No, 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 the train's derailed. Put it back. Okay, Daddy, I'll put it back. Wait, no, no, no. <clears throat> Uh, okay, okay, you know what? I'm not really in the mood for soup. But Mario, it will make you feel better. No, it's fine. I'll just sit here and die. At least let me get you some medicine. Okay, you can get me some medicine. Just don't leave the house. Okay, bye. What? Oh. <sighs> All right, Mario. Here's your medicine. And I brought you some cough drops, too. Okay, first of all, I'm not going to take the cough drops because I feel like I'm choking on them when I'm sucking on them. And I'm not going to take the NyQuil because it tastes horrible and I don't want to go to sleep. You know what, Mario? You're really mean when you're sick, and I'm dead trying to take care of you! Okay, if you're gonna cry, can you, like, go in another room? Because I have a headache, and I don't feel good. <laughs> All right, Daddy. I'm Dr. Jeffy, and I'll be taking care of you this evening. Aw, Jeffy, you're so cute wanting to play doctor and take care of your daddy. It's so sweet. Um, excuse me, ma'am? I did 12 years of medical school at Johns Hopkins. I will not have you talk down to me. Now, if you'll excuse me... I need to evaluate my patient. Oh, so cute playing dress up. <laughs> All right, sir. I have your patient information here. I just need to go through and make sure it's correct, okay? No, I don't have time for this. I'm feeling sick. All right. According to the chart, we have that your name is Daddy. Yeah, sure, it's Daddy. And your date of birth is really, really old. Okay, I'm not that old. Well, you are getting older, Mario. <sighs> and we also have that your weight is fat. I'm not fat. You could go on a diet. <sighs> and we also have that your height is short. <laughs> I, I'm not that short. Well, you're not the tallest person either, Mario. <sighs> and then your temperature is hot AF. Well, I am burning up. I have a fever. All right. And your injury is bald. <laughs> That's not an injury, and, and I'm not bald. My hairline's just pushed back. <laughs> you're getting bald, Mario. No, it's my hairline. It's not that bad anymore. <sighs> and we also have that you have a rash on your pee-pee, and it burns when you pee. What? <gasps> Mario, what have you been doing? while I was away. Well, definitely not you. I mean, unless you can give yourself a hand burn. That's all, that's all I think I could have did. Well, I'm prescribing some soothing cream for your wiener, Daddy. I don't need it. I don't need any lotion. I don't need anything. I'm sick. I have the flu. <gasps> you have the flu, Daddy? I think we need to operate. What? No, we don't, we don't need to operate. I just need you guys to leave me alone so I can take a nap. <laughs> all right, Daddy. I need to check your vitals before we operate. Aww. Cute in your little outfit. Jeffy, you look ridiculous. You look stupid. Mario. Daddy, mommy's right. You got your grumpy pants on. No, I don't have my grumpy pants on. I have my sick pants on. I don't want people to bother me. Well, I need to listen to your butt. Well, you're not going to listen to my butt. Mario, play along. He's being creative. He could be a doctor one day. He's not going to be a doctor one day because he's stupid. Mario. Oh, Jeffy, don't start crying. Look what you did, Mario. Isn't that just... Be a doctor one day, and everyone needs to shut up. Oh, okay, fine, fine. Okay, you want to listen to my butt? Look, my butt's right here. Here's my butt. Listen to it. Stick up your ears. No, I don't want to listen to your butt no more, Daddy. It stinks. Listen to my butt right here. No, Daddy, I don't no, like look. it. It beats by my butt. Listen to it. Daddy, you got poop in your butt. I, don't I think we need to operate. I don't have poop in my butt. You don't need to operate on my butt. No, Daddy, we gotta operate. I gotta scrape it out. You're not Bend gonna, over, give me a. You're not gonna scrape it out, Daddy. <laughs> Look, no more, no butt stuff. Look, I don't want medicine. I don't want operation. I don't need you to be a doctor. I don't need a doctor. I just want to lay down and rest. You know, just stop bothering me. Oh, oh, Mario, Mario, I have an idea. What? My great grandmother had this old family recipe, and I know it'll make you feel better. Okay, well then go get it. Okay. <sighs> okay, here's a special cup I got for you. It has an M on it for Mario. Or monkey. And the secret recipe is a cup of warm water and a lemon. Or moose. A whole lemon? Yes, Mario. I'm supposed to drink that? Yes, Mario. How am I supposed to drink it? Yes, Mario. I would like to make a suggestion to put something in the cup in my most professional doctor opinion. No, Jeffy, it's fine. The recipe is fine. I would like to put my Band-Aid that's been on my leg 
bed for two weeks in the cup. Jeffy, no. Jeffy, yes. Boy, Jeffy, if you stick your band-aid in the drink, I'm not gonna... Money. Okay, now I'm not gonna drink it because there's a band-aid in it. And I also wanna put my lucky penny in there. No, no Jeffy. If you, okay, I'm definitely not drinking it because now there's a band-aid and a penny in it. And I also wanna put a blue thumbtack. Oh, no. Jeffy, no! Okay, it doesn't matter the color, it's still it's a thumbtack. I'm not gonna drink it. And a nerf dart. Okay, that, that's stupid. Okay, I'm not I'm definitely not drinking it. You know what? This is all stupid. I don't need Hold on! What? Last but not least. I need the hock loogie in it. Jeffy! No, 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 don't you dare spit in this drink. Stop it. You're not spitting in the drink, Jeffy. Oh, oh no, 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 stop. Okay, okay, you know what? I, no, no. Hey, yo, what the f***? Okay, you know what? You just spit in the drink, and there's so much stuff in there, I don't even know what it is, so I'm just not gonna drink it. Mario, you're never gonna get better. Yeah, with you two, I'm never gonna get better. With you taking care of me, being a stupid, dumb doctor, and for you just buying me a bunch of random stuff, no crying. Okay, look at the crying. I wish I had the old doctor back. I wish I had the old doctor. Hey there, somebody call a doctor? Oh, thank God you're here, doctor. They won't stop screaming and crying in my ear, and I'm so sick. Yeah, I just wanted to come and apologize for how I was acting earlier. You know, I'm sick, and I got all these jobs, so I gotta be a doctor and a cop and a firefighter, all while being sick, and there's no one there to take care of me. Then I gotta go home to my ugly wife so she can nag in my ear all day. And don't even get me started on her snoring. Oh, well, I'm sorry to hear about that, doctor, but I've been so sick. I keep coughing <laughs> and sneezing, and I have the worst headache ever. Well, honestly, I didn't have a headache until they start screaming in my ear. Well, maybe you shouldn't be so grumpy, Mario. Well, maybe you should cut some of the hair around your ears so you can hear me and understand that all I'm doing is trying to not be annoyed all day. All right, Daddy, it's time for your shot. Wait, who's this chump? I'm Dr. Jeffy. Oh, no, you're not. I'm the only doctor in this city, and this town ain't big enough for the two of us. Where'd you even get your degree? I did 15 years at Johns Hopkins. Oh, yeah? Well, I did six months at community college, so take that. Um... How are you even a doctor? And where have you been for the last year? Miss, I'm gonna move to Baltimore. I don't want to hear a word out of you. All right, guys, I'm sick. Can we, like, focus more on me? And you, take that doctor outfit off now. How about you save some jobs for the rest of us? Well, how about you make me? How about we throw hands? All right, doctor fight. <laughs> take my medical oh, excellence. Oh, stop, settle down. Stop it right now. Stop it. Oh, oh my gosh. He drank his NyQuil! Yeah, he's out like a light. I wouldn't drink that. That's gross. Oh, we should probably let Mario get some sleep. Yeah, he'll probably feel better when he wakes up. But I don't want to see you here again! Oh, Mario, I'm so glad you're feeling better. Yeah, I'm sorry for being rude earlier. It's just, I don't like being sick. And also, you were gone for a year, so I was annoyed at that. I know. I'm sorry, Mario. Well, I'm feeling a lot better now. Rawr! Since you're feeling better, Daddy, Mr. Shark's gonna eat your hat! Oh, no, 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 no. I hope he doesn't eat my hat. <laughs> Joseph, what do you want to do today? Uh, I don't know, dude. Wait, where's Cody? I don't know. <laughs> oh, baby, you know me so well. <laughs> oh, you're such a freak. Oh, you nasty, nasty girl. All right, I'll see you later, Mom. Wait, that was your mom? Yeah. So that wasn't a hot girl on the phone? Ew, no. My mom's like a six at best. Oh. So what do you guys want to do today? Whoa, look over there! What? Haha, <laughs> made you look. What? Seriously, dude? What? Made you look? Like, what, what? What? It's like a prank. What, are we kindergartners, dude? Yeah, what a five-year-old little joke. Like, oh, made you look. Hey, Cody, look over there. No, there's nothing there. No, no, look, Cody, it's the coolest thing ever. No, there's obviously not going to be anything. Cody, look! No! <laughs> Made you look! Yeah, you literally made me look. Oh, isn't that so funny? Wasn't that really funny, Joseph? <laughs> yeah, dude, hilarious. Yeah, so <laughs> funny. Oh, made you look. Dumb. You're five years old. All right, guys. You guys just want to watch a movie? Oh, yeah, with popcorn. Yeah, popcorn. Yeah, and butter? Yeah. And salt? Yeah. All right, yeah. Let's go ask Chef Pee to make us some popcorn. All right. Oh, man, oh, man. I gotta hurry up and finish this dinner for my boss. Oh, let me taste test it. Oh my god, that's horrible! Hey, Chef Pee, Pee can you make some popcorn for me and my friends? No, Junior, I'm cooking this dinner for your dad! But we want some popcorn! I don't care what you want, I have to cook this dinner for your dad! But we want popcorn! Mm -hmm. You know 
what, Junior? Give me that popcorn. Give me the popcorn right now. Give me the damn popcorn. All right. You got it? I'm cooking the damn popcorn right now. Chef BB! What do you want, boss? All right, Junior, I'll be right back. Guys, you know what'd be really funny? If we pull a prank on Chef BB, we should hide in the microwave, and then when he goes to open the microwave, we jump out. <laughs> yeah. Let's do it. Come on, guys. Get in the microwave. Okay, dude. What, boss? Is my food ready yet, peasant? Who are you calling a peasant? And no, it'll be ready in five minutes. I could die in five minutes. My food better be ready sooner than that. <laughs> ah, I can't stand my boss. Always yelling at me and wanting me to cook and clean. Oh, yeah, yeah. Junior, stupid popcorn. Let me start it. What's that noise? Chef Pee, Pee turn the microwave on. What's that mean? We're gonna die, dude! The radiation's gonna kill us! Wait, help! 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 I'm getting tired. Ooh. Oh, that must be Junior's popcorn. <gasps> Junior Joseph Cody, what are you doing in the microwave? Uh, what the hell are you doing in the microwave? I told you not to be in the kitchen. Get out! Oh, come on, guys. Uh, uh, I don't feel good. Well, of course not, Junior. We just got microwaved. Is that bad? Yes, Junior. That's very, very bad. We soaked up so much radiation, I'm surprised our heads didn't explode. Well, what can radiation do? Well, it can give you cancer. Or superpowers, dude. No, that only happens in comic books. Shut up, Cody, you're such a nerd. Yeah, yeah, shut up, Cody, you're stupid. I, I, I'm not stupid. You're stupid. Come on, Cody, I'm not stupid. You're stupid. You can do so much better than that. You should have called him a bib-wearing baby because he wears a bib all the time. <laughs> yeah, and then Joseph would have high-fived me. Would have been awesome. Why'd you call me that, Cody? What? You just called me a bib wearing baby. Well, no, I didn't. Hey, Joseph, you heard him say that, right? No, he didn't say anything, dude. He said, I wish I would have called you a bib wearing baby. Why would you call me that? But, J -J Junior, I don't know what you're talking about. Huh, that was weird. How did Junior know I wanted to call him a bib wearing baby? Still, Junior's so sexy. I'm gonna make out with him so hard. It's Ew, Cody, you just said you wanted to make out with me really hard. What? what? No, no, Junior, I, I didn't say that. I was thinking it. Ew, why would you even think that? That's gross. Wait, wait how did I just hear your thoughts? Oh, my God, Junior, did you just read my mind? Wait, I can read minds? W okay, let's try it out. Uh, I'm going to think of a number between 1 and 100, and you read my mind and tell me what it is. Okay. Ken's freshly waxed booty hole. What number was it, Junior? What number was I thinking of? It wasn't a number at all. <laughs> no, it's not. But still, that means I can read minds. Yeah, that's really cool. I'm going to try to read Joe's mind. I never find the knife that I used to cut my neighbor's throat. Oh man, I could go to jail for a long time. What was he thinking about, Jenny? Uh, cereal. Oh, how did you know, dude? Yeah. <laughs> it's so cool that you can read mine. Yeah, cereal. <laughs> um, I'm gonna see if I can read my dad's mind. Oh, Chef Pee-Pee's taking forever with my food. He needs to hurry up. Uh, hey, Dad. Not right now, Junior. I'm hungry and I'm mad. Well, what are you thinking about? I'm thinking about how I don't want you annoying me right now, so leave. God, Junior's so annoying. I wish I would have adopted a girl instead of him. Dad, am I adopted? Uh, <laughs> no. What makes you think that? <laughs> Go downstairs and check on Chef Pee-Pee. Make sure that my food's done. Uh, okay. Oh, man. All this popcorn everywhere. Now I have to clean up this huge mess. Hey, Chef Pee-Pee, is my dad's food ready? No, and it's not going to be ready anytime soon because you made this huge mess. Oh, okay. Oh, just think of happy thoughts, Chef Pee-Pee. Happy thoughts, happy thoughts. Oh, like your first kiss. Oh, it was a Boy Scouts and it was with a boy named Freddy. I kind of liked it, though. But I can never let anybody know my secret. Who's Freddy? Oh, but how did you know about Freddy? Look, we just bumped the heads. I didn't like it. Okay. Just go! Get out! Stop interrogating me! <laughs> Hey, Junior, what was your dad thinking about? I think I'm adopted. Oh. I also read Chef Pee-Pee's mind. Ooh, what was he thinking about, dude? I don't know. I don't think I can talk about it. Oh. Well, it's still really cool that you have superpowers. I know. Maybe you guys have superpowers, too. Mm-hmm. 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 Joseph, what do you think your superpower is? Ooh, maybe I have laser vision. I can shoot laser beams at my eyes. Ooh, you should try it. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Human torch. So he's burning alive? Yeah. Oh, let me see what he's thinking about. Oh man, I remember when I went to Boy Scouts and I said my name was Freddy and I kissed Chef Pee Pee. But I told him that we would never talk about this ever again. What was he thinking about? Uh, he said he wants us to call the fire department. He wants water and to be put out, you know. That makes sense. Hello? Hey, you got a call about a fire? Yeah, my friend's on fire! Oh, is he? Yeah, he's like on fire with flames and everything. Wait, like for real? Yeah, like for real, come on! 
Oh man, I really hope this kid doesn't find out that I'm not actually a firefighter. I'm just a male stripper, and when he said that his friend was on fire, I thought he meant he was really hot, like he wanted me to take my clothes off. Well, what are you doing? Come on! Uh, yeah, okay, I'm coming. Okay, my friend's right here! Oh my god, he's burned to a crisp! What happened? Well, we wanted to scare my chef, so we got in the microwave when he was making popcorn, and he accidentally microwaved us, and then we all got superpowers, and his superpower was to light himself on fire, and then he burned himself to death. Okay, these kids are nucking fucks. They obviously just killed their friend and then made up the story about the superpowers afterward. So what do I do here? Uh, I mean, I should call the cops, but... Wait, wait a minute, I am a cop. Uh, I mean, I have the outfit out in the car, but... No, 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 I don't want to do that. Oh god, if I arrest him, I'm just gonna have so much paperwork. And I just want to go home and eat a TV dinner. Oh, oh god, that'd be good. Oh yeah, chicken and dumplings? Oh yeah. Wait, wait, do I have one in the fridge? I think I do. I mean, I had one last week, but there's probably still one in there, right? Well, it's okay. If there's not, I'll just go by the store afterward. What? Oh, God, but that's a whole thing. No, no. Okay, okay, you know what? If there's not one in there, I'll just order pizza. I'm the pizza man. Oh, man, I have so many jobs, and I can't even afford to pay the bills. What's going on? Oh, oh, no. It's been a really long time, and I haven't said anything. These kids probably think I'm crazy. They probably know I'm a male stripper, and I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, I, I, I can't help you. Sorry. B bye. So, Junior, what was that guy thinking about the whole time? I don't know. Something about eating chicken and dumplings? Ooh, chicken and dumplings. So, is Joseph really dead? Yeah, I think so, Junior. What's the point of having a superpower that lets you catch on fire if it hurts you? I know, what a lame power. <sighs> what do you think my power is? Ooh, maybe your power is to bring people back to life. You should try it. Okay. <laughs> huh? What? You just cloned yourself! Oh, a pretty sexy clone of myself. Oh, you're not so bad yourself. <laughs> Wanna make out? Sure. Cody, 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 Cody! You can clone yourself? Yeah! Oh my god, do you think you can clone yourself a third time? Let's find out. <laughs> hey guys, what's up? What's cooking good looking? Oh, Junior, I'm about to have a menage a moi. What? There's three Cody's? Alright, Cody, that's too many Cody's. <laughs> Junior, there's no such thing as too many Cody's. But could you get Joseph's body out of here? I need room for all my Cody's. <sighs> yeah, I'll move Joseph's body. All right, Cody, I moved Joseph's body. Thanks, Junior! What? Cody! Why are there so many Cody's? Yeah, sorry, Junior, I have a problem. I just couldn't stop. What are you gonna name all these people? Well, the one above me is Cody. What's up? And then next to him is Cody. What's up? And then the one next to him is Cody. What's up? And then that one's Cody. What's up? And then this one's Cody. What's up? And then that one over there is Cody. What's up? And then that one... Oh, what's his name? Oh, yeah, that's right, it's Cody with a K. What's up? Uh, Cody, that is way too many Cody's! Well, Junior, like I said, there's no such thing as too many Cody's. Well, what are you gonna do with all these Cody's? We're gonna have a big gay party, right? Yeah! yeah. What, 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 Cody, don't you think it's dangerous for all those Cody's to be out in the wild? Well, yeah, now that you mention it, I don't know if the world's ready for that much hunkiness. It might implode. Oh, well, we gotta go stop all those Cody's! Yeah, let's go wrangle some Cody's! He's mine! No, he's mine! Uh, Cody, they have Ken! Get your hands off of my boyfriend! Well, get Ken! I can't, Junior! Don't you know how hunky I am? Nobody can fry my fingers off of Ken! Ken. My mom has tried! Well, well, what if we have a superpower we didn't know we had yet? Well, like what? Like, like, what if we did have laser vision like Joseph thought? Uh, pew! Well, Cody, wait, I have laser vision! Oh, yeah, get that one, get that one! Okay! Pew! <laughs> Cody, I have laser vision! Oh, Ken, my baby! Cody, what if you have laser vision too? Take your glass off, go see! Okay! Alright, Junior, I got my glasses off. What? You're just still so ugly. <sighs> just focus, Junior! Do you have laser vision or not? Let's find out. Pew! You have laser vision! Alright, let's kill some Cody's! <laughs> Look, Junior, there's a Cody on the stairs! I got him. Pew! Nice shot, Junior, but don't get cocky. Alright, let's get the other ones. <laughs> Look, Junior, there's two Cody's playing with their balls. Let's get them at the same time. Alright, pew! Yeah, yeah, we got him! <laughs> Do you see any more Cody's? Oh my god, it's Banana Cody. Oh my god. You gotta waste him, Junior. But he's so cool, though. That's what he does. He gets in your head and makes you think he's cool, so you don't want to kill him. But you gotta kill him, Junior. <gasps> okay. <sighs> oh, I don't want to do that. That's for the best, Junior. Okay, there's only one left. <sighs> there's the last Cody. He's drinking Dr. Pepper. Dr. P, not in front of me. I got him. No, I got him. <laughs> Okay, we got rid of all the Cody's. Yeah, I feel kind of bad. I wish we kept at least one, you know, just so we can, like, do stuff to it. Well, then just make one. Okay. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's not working. Try harder. <laughs> oh, 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 I, I pooped. What? I pooped in my pants. You pooped? I pooped.
You no way. I did. I pooped in my pants. I, I it's I I'm gonna have to change because I pooped. Oh my god. Yeah. I, I smell. I smell it. I'm sorry. Well, sorry about that, but I had to change my clothes, so I changed into Banana Cody. Ba -ba -da -da, banana Cody. Joseph's dead, but he'll be back in the next video. Ba -da -ba -da -da -da. If you want superpowers three, just like, comment, and subscribe. Ba -da -ba -da -da, banana Cody. My Stompasaurus Rex! Jeffy, stop it, you're being annoying. <laughs> Jeffy, stop it, you don't go play outside. I can play outside? Yeah, yeah, you can go play outside, just stay in the yard and don't talk to strangers. Okay, Daddy. <sighs> I don't have time for that. Rawr! I got my dinosaur shoes on! Rawr, 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 rawr! Hey, little boy, you want some candy? Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, I want some candy. Well, how about you get in the back of my car? <laughs> we'll have some fun. Okay. <laughs> yeah, get in, get in real quick. Come on. What, what is Jeffy doing? Why is he getting in that car? <laughs> <laughs> What's going on here? Uh, nothing, sir. Um, I'm the Uber driver. What, Uber driver? Mm -hmm. Jeffy, do you know who this guy is? No, but he offered me candy. <laughs> Jeffy, you get out of this car right now. I bent half. Just you, you want the candy, right? Yeah. Then come on, get out of the car. Come on, get okay. out of the car. You better get out of here before I call the cops. Uh, I'm sorry, yes, sir. You get out of here. Oh, sorry. Jeffy, why'd you get inside a stranger's car? Because he had candy. I told you not to talk to strangers. Hold up, Daddy. You said don't talk to strangers. You never said don't talk to strangers who have candy. And he had candy. Jeffy, it's the same thing. Don't talk to strangers. What would you have done if he would have taken you? He probably would have taken me to the candy store and bought me more candy. No, he wouldn't, Jeffy. He doesn't have the money to do that. Daddy, these are king size. He obviously got that cash. He got that paper. Well, no, Jeffy. He doesn't have that paper. He would have taken you to his house and chained you up. Oh, kinky. I like where this is going. No, Jeff, you're not supposed to talk to strangers. Would you have gotten to his car if he didn't have candy? No. So you only got in his car because he had candy? Yeah, I'm glad we established that. Well, Jeff, you're not supposed to talk to strangers even if they offer you candy. If he offers you candy, you're supposed to punch him in the face. Why would I do that? He was just being nice offering me some candy and if I would have punched him in the face, I never would have got the candy. He wasn't trying to be nice, Jeff. He was trying to take you by offering you candy. When people offer you candy, every time, you're supposed to punch him in the face and grab the candy. All right, well, what about Halloween? I'm just supposed to be rocking MFers at the front door? Like, ding dong, here's your candy, bop! No, 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 Jeffy, on Halloween, you, you don't punch people with candy. Halloween's the only day you don't do it. Dang, I'm so confused. Oh, Jeff, Jeff, I'm gonna sign you up for self-defense classes, because if you knew self-defense, you would know not to get us inside a stranger's car, and you would have hit them, you would have rocked them up. So, you know, I'm gonna sign you up for self-defense classes right now. <sighs> Oh, please answer. Oh, uh, hello. This is Jackie Chu. Hey, Jackie Chu. It's me, Mario. I was wondering if you could teach my son karate. Oh, yeah. I could teach your son karate, but it's going to cost you $200 an hour. $200 an hour? That's expensive. Yeah, but I got to put cat and dog on my family dinner table, and cat and dog ain't cheap. Okay, well, is there any way you can give me, like, a discount, you know? Well, we got uh, $200 hour, $100 half hour, $50 15 minute, and uh, we also have $25 seven and a half minute. You're just cutting everything in half. Yeah, discount. Well, no, that's not a discount. Look, 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 I, I just really need to teach my son karate because someone almost took him today, and I want to teach him self-defense so he knows how to get out of those situations. Oh, $200 hour. <sighs> Whatever. <laughs> Okay, I need to find a cheaper option. A cheaper option. <sighs> All right, Jeffy, I found you a cheap karate instructor off of Craigslist. Yo, what's up, young blood? Gang, gang, what your cracker gotta do to get an N-word pass, you heard me? Hey, you gotta get a black belt if you want that pass. Oh, word up. <laughs> oh, no, 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 there will be no passes given out. Jeffy, he's here to teach you karate. What's your name? Oh, my name, Blackie Chan. I got it in the hood because I know how to play Mortal Kombat real good. Well, how much do you know about karate? Oh, I know a lot about carrot tea. I don't like it too much. It messes with my stomach, you know what I'm saying? Carrot tea? Yeah, carrot tea, you know. Carrot flavor tea? Well, no, 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 no. I, I, I hired you to teach him about karate, you know, fighting. Oh, I know how to fight. Look, look, I know how to fight. I've been to prison, okay? You gotta know how to fight enough, because if you drop a soap, you the gone. Well, no, no, okay, but like, I need you to teach him, like, self defense, because today, someone pulled up and offered him candy, and he got in their car. What? Candy? What kind of candy? It, it, it was this candy right here. Ew, this is disgusting. This is the cheap candy. If it's not Snickers or Reese's, I'm not getting into that car. Well, no, no, you, he shouldn't get in the car no matter what type of candy they have. What? Well, what kind of car was it? If it was a Lamborghini, I'm getting in that car. No, it was not a Lamborghini. It was a regular car. 
Well, don't get into regular cars with people with regular candy, okay? Well, yeah, you, you, no matter what candy they have or what car they have, you just don't get into a car with a stranger. So that's what I want you to teach them. I want you to teach them self-defense. Like if someone comes up to him and, and offers them to get in the car for candy, you know how, how he says no, you know? Yeah, well, I can do that. Um, all right, I got this piece of wood from Home Depot. I think you're supposed to break it or something. So hit it. <laughs> oh, man, you did it. Oh, man, that was incredible. All right, now where my $20 at? I'm not going to pay you. You didn't do anything yet. Oh, oh, God. Okay, look, I'm going to be the creep. Oh, look, little boy, I got some candy, and I want to tickle your butt. Now, what is your response? Oh, okay. I'll take your candy, and you can get the tickling. No! This is cheap candy. I'm not tickling your butt. Well, no, 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 don't let anyone do that for any type of candy. Look, you know what? We're done here. You know what? Here, you know what? Here's $20. You can leave. Ooh, $20. All right. Hey, hey, Applebee's. How come? Oh, okay, Jeffy, do not listen to anything he said. That, that, was, that was a waste of time and a waste of $20. Look, Jeffy, I just want you to learn self-defense. Well, I already know how to fight, Daddy. Well, but then why'd you get in the car? Well, because I wanted the candy. Jeffy, Jeffy, so, so that's what I want you to learn. You, you know what? You're not going to learn anything. Let's just go put you in bed, and you're not allowed to go outside anymore. Come on. All right, Jeffy, you're going to go to bed, and you're not allowed to go outside anymore. But what about going to school? What, what, what do you mean? I have to go outside to go to school. Okay, you can go outside to go to school. That's the only time you can go outside. And what about to check the mail? You don't need to check the mail. I'll check the mail. But what if I got a package? I'll let you know if you have a package when I check the mail. Well, can I go outside to chase the Easter Bunny? No. What about Santa Claus? What about him? Uh, he's outside. He, he's outside when he's on the chimney, but then he comes inside so you can see him when he comes inside. Well, Daddy, what happens if I need fresh air? Then open a window. Oh, but that's outside. No, you stay inside the house and open the window and just stay inside. Well... Can I stick my fingers out the window? No. Why? They're just fingers. Okay, fine. You can stick your fingers outside. All right, what about my hand? Yes, your hand. And my arm. You can stick your arm out the window. And my head, shoulders, knees, and toes. But How no. about just all of me? No, you can't go outside, Jeffy. Oh, Dad, I wanted to go outside. You're not going outside. <clears throat> no. <clears throat> Jeffy, you're going to... Don't, don't hiss at me. Stop it. Jeffy, you, you stay in bed. You're not allowed to go outside, okay? Ooh, I guess who's back? <laughs> I want to give him some more candy. <laughs> Ooh, I wonder what room he's in. Oh, I bet it's that one right there. How do I get his attention? <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> You're showing how shy? Who's there? Hey, little boy. It's me, remember? The guy that gave you candy? Oh, yeah. Thanks. Uh, hey, I got some more. Don't you want some? Just come outside. I can't come outside. I'm not allowed to. Only my fingers. Aw, that's no fun. Well, you can throw me the candy. No. Why not? Because you have to come outside. But what if you try and tickle my butt? <gasps> how did you know? I, I mean, um... Uh, I wouldn't tickle your butt. I, I just want to give you candy. Well, I can meet you at the front door. <gasps> oh, 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 oh. Uh, okay, let's go to the front door. Oh, I'll be there in a minute. <laughs> I can't believe Jeffy got inside a stranger's car and I tried to teach him self-defense. Oh, there's no use for him. I can't wait to give this little boy some candy and tickle his butt. What? That's from my front door. What? I'm calling the cops. <laughs> All right, I'm here. Okay, then. Just open the door, little boy. All right, but I can't come out and shine. That's okay. Just open the door. Okay. <laughs> I got you now. <laughs> You ready for me to tickle your butt? <laughs> there will be no butt tickling today, sir. I will mess you up. <laughs> oh, my reaction skills suck. <laughs> Ow! Ow! I need to do something! <laughs> I, I can't believe I got caught. I would have gotten away with it too if it wasn't for you meddling kids. Yeah, we've been trying to catch the butt tickling bandit for years. But you finally did it, Jeffy, with those karate skills of yours. Uh, would you mind shutting the door for me? Yeah. My face! You just closed the door on my face! Ow! 
Oh. Sorry. Oh, it's fine. Let's let's just go tell your dad what you did. There will be no butt tickling today, sir. I will mess you up. <laughs> oh, my reaction skills suck. <laughs> <laughs> Why did you just do something? <laughs> oh, oh my God. Yeah, your son closed the car door on my face. Well, but he stopped the creep. But yeah, I guess he did that too. Well, Jeffy, I guess you didn't need to learn karate after all. You already know how to defend yourself. I told you, Daddy. I already know how to fight. Every time somebody messes with me, bop. Yep. Bop, just like the car door right on my face. Bop. Well, how do you close the car door on your face anyway? Well, I didn't get out of the way because I was too busy daydreaming about my cat. You see, my cat likes to chew on, like, lamp cords and stuff, so I left him home alone, and usually I unplug the lamp cords, but I think there's a lamp cord I forgot to unplug, so I'm just kind of worried about him. And he has asthma, so there's that. Well, I hope your cat's okay then. Yeah, me too. And anyway, the message of this video is never talk to strangers. And, and be careful when people are closing car doors so they don't slam it on your face. Yeah, so Jeffy, did you get the lesson of this video? Yep, don't talk to strangers, even if they have candy. And, and the car door on the face. Whatever. All right, Jeffy, I'm glad you learned your lesson. You're allowed to go outside again. Just don't talk to creeps. Yeah, I can go outside. Yeah. All right, Jeffy, I'm gonna throw the baseball and you're gonna hit it, okay? Jeffy, stop hitting yourself with the bat. Jeffy, stop it. All right, Jeffy, I'm gonna throw the ball and you're gonna hit it, okay? Ugh. Oh, bitch, why would you throw that ball at me? Jeffy, you're supposed to hit it. Fuck you. Oh, Jeffy, look, when you play baseball, you throw a ball and you hit it with the bat, okay? So look, hit this ball with the bat when I throw it, okay? Uh, ugh. I can't wait to get Mario's house payment. He's late. Ah! Jimmy, run inside, run inside, run inside. You've got to be fucking kidding me. What the? Ah! 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 Why are we running inside, Danny? I hit the ball. I know you hit the ball, Jimmy, but it, it hit Goodman's windshield and it cracked it, and now he's going to come here to kill us. Okay, what are we gonna do? We gotta think, we gotta think fast. Uh, okay, I'm gonna lie. I'm gonna say it wasn't us. Uh, uh Jeffy, I need you to go upstairs and pretend to be asleep. Well, I'm not tired, Dad. Pretend to be asleep, damn it! Fine, you can say please next time, asshole! Okay, okay, he'll be here any second. Uh, 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 let me get ready, let me get ready. Uh, hello? Is this your fing baseball? Uh, uh, no, no, well, why would that be my baseball? No, I, I don't even own a baseball. Why, why would you even ask me if that's my baseball? That's weird. Well, the weirdest thing happened, Mario. I was in your neighborhood coming to your house to get your house payment, and I looked up to check the weather, and I was like, holy shit. The weatherman lied to me. He said it was supposed to be sunny, but it wasn't. It was cloudy with a chance of fing baseball. And this baseball landed and cracked my windshield. Well, me, right? What, it, it, it cracked your windshield? Oh, oh yeah. Oh my, I'm so sorry. That's, I don't know who would do that. It must be some hoodlum kids or something doing that. I, I don't know. Well, are you sure it wasn't you and your son? My son, Jeffy? Jeffy would never do that. Jeffy doesn't even own a baseball. Oh, that's really fucking weird because it says Jeffy's favorite ball on it. That, 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 that is weird. What, what, why, why would it say that? I, you know what? I, I think we're framed. I think the neighbor is trying to frame us and, and they wrote that on the baseball and then cracked your windshield. Framed. Yeah, framed. Well, frame a picture of my stretched out ass, Mario. Well, uh, well uh, it, it wasn't it wasn't us. I promise. I I, I swear. You can, you can even ask my son, but he, he he's he's sleeping. Well, I'm gonna wake him up. I'm waking him up. I'm gonna ask him. <laughs> Jeffy, wake up! All right, Goodman. You want to see my son, Jeffy? Well, look. Here he is, sleeping with his baseball bat. Does that say Jeffy's favorite bat? Yeah. And this says Jeffy's favorite ball. Oh, come on! Don't you think these two items are related, Mario? No, 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 I, I think it's a coincidence, you know? I, I think we're being framed, still, by the neighbor. Well, damn. The trail's gone cold. How am I gonna solve this case of whose f***ing ball this is? Well, it, it's not ours. It's, it's not ours. You don't think Jeffy used his favorite bat to hit his favorite ball, which hit my favorite windshield? What? Why would you do that? You talked about Jimmy! Oh my god! You talked about Jimmy! Oh my god, I gotta, I gotta call a doctor! I have to call a doctor! Hey, you called the doctor? Yeah, thanks for coming. See, my friend here is knocked unconscious and I wanna know if he's dead or not. Alright, I'll take a look. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm, yeah. Well, well, he's dead? Oh no, he shampoos and conditions. His hair is really soft. B but is he dead or not? Um, no. No, uh, he does have a really big bump on his head, though. What happened to him? Oh, well, uh, he bumped his head from, uh, uh jumping on the bed. Yeah, jumping on the bed. 
Now, I said no more monkeys jumping on the bed. I was very clear about that. I know, but he couldn't help himself, you know? <sighs> He's alive? Where am I? What's my name? Who, who, who are you guys? He, he, he can't remember anything. I guess he has amnesia from the bump on his head. Amnesia? Uh, your name is Mr. Goodman. Mr. Goodman? Yeah, and the reason you were here is because, uh, you're gonna give each of us a couple million dollars. Yep, a couple million dollars. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, millions of dollars, yep. A couple million dollars? Yeah, each. Yeah, you said you were gonna give it to us, like right now. Nice try, asshole! I remember everything! You hit me in the head with a baseball bat! What? No, I, I didn't hit you in the head with a baseball bat. That was Jeffy. I, I did not do that. No, it was an accident. It was a complete accident. Why can't I feel my legs? What? Why can't I move my arms? I, I can't move any of my muscles in my body. Wait, wait what? I can't move. Wait, wait, what, why can't he move, doctor? I, I guess getting hit on the head caused him to be paralyzed from the neck down. Wait, are, are you just joking with us? I'm not joking, Mario. I can't move a muscle. You, you, you can't move? No. Well, that's not good. So can't can you fix it? Uh, no, there's no fix for paralysis. Well, you, you, can't, you don't have like medicine or something? No, there's no medicine for this kind of thing. Okay, so what do we do? Well, somebody has to take care of him. Well, take care of him? Uh, yeah, and because you caused this, it has to be you. What, me? Yeah, you. That's right, Mario. You get over here and you wipe my ass. Well, I'm, not, I'm not doing that. No, you, you're a doctor. Why don't, why don't you do it? You, you deal with gross stuff all the time. <laughs> I'm not a doctor. Do you see this shirt? I got this at a Halloween store. What? Mario, my ass needs wiping. What, what, but you, come on, you, you, you can move. Look, look, you can, you, you can, you can move. Oh, oh, come on. Nope. Oh, oh come on. Look, you're not really paralyzed. Like, your leg is... It's... It's... Uh... I'm like a spaghetti noodle, Mario. Uh, uh, oh, okay. F fine. I'll wipe you, but... Are you, did you even have an accident? Yep. Wet and floppy. Spaghetti noodle. <sighs> Alright, Goodman. I put a diaper on you in case you have another accident. Oh, it wasn't an accident, Mario. Oh, well, in case you poop again, uh, just say, uh, I made a messy, so I'll know when you poop. Okay. Hey, Mario. What? I just took a shit right in my diaper. Uh, right, right in your diaper? Oh, yeah. A big rhinoceros shit. Uh, uh, okay, well, anyway, is there anything you need? Is there anything I can get you? Yeah. My diaper changed. But I, I just put one on you. You can't just, I mean, you, you can't even feel it, right? So why don't you just sit there in it, you know? Rhinoceros shit. Fine, I'll, I'll change it. <sighs> okay, Goodman, I just changed your diaper. Is there anything else you need? Yeah, I'm actually really hungry, Mario. Uh, okay, you're hungry? Uh, what do you want? A filet mignon. A filet mignon? You mean like the steak? Yeah, medium rare, peppercorn, with blue cheese crumbles, and a side of caviar. Caviar? Where am I going to find caviar at? I don't know where to get that. I don't know, Mario, but you better find it because I'm paralyzed because of you. <sighs> Okay, fine. I'll find a way to get it. Is there anything else you want? Yeah, one more thing, Mario. Can you hand me the remote control? What? Hand you the remote? It, it's right here. I'm paralyzed, Mario. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Oh, okay, so how are we going to do this? Where do you want it? Just put it in my mouth. Oh. That's what she said. Wow. Wow, Mario. Just wow. A grown man is on your couch in a diaper because you paralyzed him. And at this horrific moment of my life, you're going to sit there and make a that's what she said joke? Wow. I'm appalled. I'm appalled that you would make that sort of joke, Mario. Uh, I'm sorry. I, I didn't know it was going to hurt that bad. That's what she said. <sighs> oh, here. <sighs> okay, Goodman's steak is almost done. Hey, Dad. Look at my pee-pee. Je Jeffy, that's not a pee-pee. That's a squash. What is a squash? It's a vegetable, Jeffy. Oh, like the guy upstairs? No, Jeffy, it's a vegetable. Just put put it back. Put it wherever you found it. Okay, do you want me to squash it? No, it's, it's, it's called a squash. I don't want you to squash it. Look, I'm working on a steak, Jeffy. Just don't don't bother me. Okay, guy. Okay, I, I think I think it's almost done. You want it medium rare? Squash! Jeffy, stop it! Jeffy, stop it! Jeffy, no, no, don't squash it. Get out of here with that. Get out of here with that. Don't, don't get near the steak. It's done anyway. <sighs> All right, Goodman. I got your dinner right here. I got your filet mignon, medium rare with peppercorns. I got your caviar, and I didn't have any blue cheese, so I got you American cheese. Oh, I didn't know we were playing hockey, Mario. What, hockey? Yeah, that damn hockey puck on my plate covered in roly-polies. Oh, no, no, no. That, that's your filet mignon. It's medium rare. Oh, uh -huh, my ass. And what about this cat throw-up? 
Oh, no, no, that, that's your caviar. Oh, uh -huh, sure. And there's still plastic on the cheese I didn't ask for. Oh, plastic? Oh, yeah, I'll take it off right now. No, 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 I'm not gonna eat that, Mario. What? You want, you want to know what I want you to do? What? I want you to take this butter knife down here and just castrate me. Because I would enjoy that a lot more than eating this dinner. Go ahead. I'm ready for my neuter. Oh, okay. What do you want me to do, Goodman? You want me to recook everything? I can recook everything. No, Mario. I've completely lost my appetite. But I'm beginning to work up a shit. So change me. Change you again? Yes. Change me. <sighs> <sighs> All right, Jeffy. We're going to give Mr. Goodman a bath, but he's paralyzed from the neck down, so he can't keep his head up. So I need you to keep his head up so he doesn't drown, okay? Okay, guy. All right. Uh, keep his head up. Don't let go of it. I'm going to go get a shampoo, okay? <sighs> All right, I got the shampoo. Oh my god! Hey, Danny, look, I find a pumpkin with a pee pee on it. Jimmy, that's not a pumpkin, that, that's a squash! No, Danny, the pee pee back there was a squash. There's a pumpkin with a pee pee. No, Jimmy, that's a squash. Give us a good out of the bathroom, he's drowning. I don't know how to swim, Danny. Save him, Jimmy! Oh, my Danny, look! Goodman, I'm so sorry my son almost let you drown. Mario, you are the worst caretaker I've ever seen. Well, no, don't say that. I'm trying. I really am trying. Well, you're not trying hard enough. Well, yeah, I am. I cooked you dinner. I gave you a bath. I've changed your diaper like 5,000 times. Mario, a deaf, blind, dumb person can do a better job than you're doing. You know what, Goodman? You are the meanest person ever. You know what? You deserve to be paralyzed from the neck down because you're mean and you're greedy and, and this is karma for everything you've ever done to anybody else in the world. You take that back right now, Mario. No, 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 no. You deserve all this to happen to you, Goodman. You really do deserve it. And you know what? I don't have to make a house payment this month. I don't have to make a house payment ever again because you're paralyzed, so you can't make me. Yeah, you still have to pay your house payment, Mario. No, I don't. And look, you know what? I'm going to go drive your Lamborghini because you're paralyzed from the neck down, so you can't stop me. That's it. I've had enough of this. What? Stop. No, no. Stop right there, Mario. You're not taking my Lamborghini. How are you moving? It's a big fucking miracle, Mario. I was faking it the whole time. What? Faking it? Yeah, because you inconvenienced me by breaking my windshield, so I was going to inconvenience you by making you my servant for two weeks. What, two weeks? Yep, two fucking weeks, Mario. But I couldn't keep that shit going because you were just screwing everything up. Uh, what, so you were just faking it? Yep, you gave me cat throw up, a hockey puck for steak, and what the, what the hell was that? Cheese? That was plastic cheese. So you were literally just faking all that just to just make me your servant? Yep, but I couldn't keep it going anymore, Mario. I held my breath for five damn minutes underneath that bathtub while your kid played with a pumpkin. Uh, uh, so, Mario, I'll be back tomorrow for your house payment. Have a good night. So, guys, what do you want to do today? Dude, I just got this new yellow ball. Shut up. No, you didn't, Joseph. Dude, I'm telling the truth. I just got it. You don't have to lie to us, Joseph. Yeah, you don't have to lie and say you got something cool if you didn't get it. Bro, I promise. It's right here. Whoa! Yeah, I know. It's so cool, right? Where'd you get it from? I got it from the dollar store. How much did it cost? Well, if you got it from the dollar store, it clearly cost a dollar. Actually, Cody, I got it for free. How'd you get it for free? <laughs> I got that five-finger discount. But we only have four fingers. Well, four finger discount. That's so cool. We should go play catch outside. Oh, let's do it, dude. Well, I actually heard it's supposed to rain tonight. No, it's not. Well, okay, I'm just telling you what I heard. I heard that on the news. You heard it on the news? Uh, yeah. Okay, well, we're not going to let a little rain ruin our day. So let's go outside and play catch. But it's still dark. Like, we won't be able to see who we're throwing the ball to. Oh, wow. 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 No, no. wow. Yeah, he went there. Wow, 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 wow. 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 That's not what I meant. Okay, so, 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 so you're saying that you don't want to play catch because it's dark and we won't know who we're throwing the ball to. I can't believe him. But I wouldn't be able to see you either. Wow. Wow. Okay, okay, okay. okay. How about this? We'll play catch inside with the lights on. Is that fine? Well, yeah, actually, that'd be a lot oh, but, 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 but what if I want to turn the lights off? Hmm. Well, it would still be better than being outside. Uh, yeah, if we turn the lights off, who wouldn't you be able to see? I mean, it'd be pretty dark. It probably wouldn't be. You know what? Say it. I, Say it. No, no. Say it. What? How about we just? How about we just check the weather? See if it's raining, okay? Okay. If, if it's not raining, then you'll cancel. But no. It... Breaking news, okay? There's a crazy lunatic on the loose named Cody. He's a killer who eats fingers and eyeballs. He has had over 20 victims so far. If you have seen him, please call 911 immediately. What? Did you see the news? Yeah, the guy's crazy. Joseph, it's him. Dude, that has to be him. It looks just like him. That's, that's him. Bro, we're just sitting next to a murderer. I don't know. What if he kills us? Oh, man, I hope he doesn't kill me. What are you guys saying over there? Nothing. Nothing no, about no, no, you. Yeah, no, we're not talking about you. Not at all. Yeah, no, we're not talking about how you look just like the guy. 
Wait, wait. You guys don't think that that's me on TV? No, oh, no. Cody. Yeah, not you. Man. You don't look anything like him. It's not, it's not like I'll have the same glasses, or you both have the same name, or the same shirt. Nope. Well, I mean, guys, come on, look. I mean, there's a lot of people in the world named Cody, and he doesn't even spell it the same. He has a K in his name. And, and like, this is a very popular shirt. Plenty of people have it. And a lot of people have glasses, too. You know, it's not... What, guys? 911, what's your emergency? Please help, please help! That crazy Cody murder guy's at my house! Yeah, please help us! What, are you sure it's him? It's him, it's definitely him! Uh, all right, we're on our way! All right, the cops are on their way. Right, that's them! <laughs> Hello? All right, where is he? He's upstairs. Okay, you boys better stand back. You're lucky he hasn't already strangled you and eaten your fingers already. He's really dangerous. All right, hold on. Dispatch, I'm gonna need some backup. I have a feeling he's not gonna go quietly. Who are you talking to? I, I'm, I'm talking to Dispatch. Where's your walkie-talkie? Well, I have it. It's... it's where, where, where is it? It's... Okay, I don't have a walkie-talkie, okay? I just like to, to, to pretend I'm cool and talk to Dispatch. Well, go, 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 go get him! O okay, I will. Just, Dispatch, I'm gonna go get him. Huh, I wonder where they went. You're on the ground now! You're under arrest! What's going on? All right, oh, this one's a flighter. I wish my backup was here. Oh, oh, sorry I'm late, mate. Dispatch just called me. But but how? I didn't even have a walkie-talkie. Telepathically, mate! Ah, all right, tackle this kid. Uh, right, uh, ow. Stop resisting! You're under arrest, you come uh, with us. Oh, uh, come on, let's take him to the car. Thank you, officers, for getting that scum off the street. Oh, he's so dangerous. Dude, can you believe our friend Cody was a lunatic this whole time? I know, I never thought he was that crazy. And did you see the way he resisted arrest with those officers? Yeah, dude, if I would've did that, that would've been a whole hashtag. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who's that at the door? I don't know, dude. What if you escaped the cops? Oh, no! Oh, okay, wait, 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 let, me, let me answer it. Okay. Uh, hello? Ah! No, 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 it's okay, we goofed. Yeah, sorry, mate, we made a mistake. What do you mean you goofed? Well, uh, he's not really the crazy lunatic, he just kind of looks like him. Oh, so I made a mistake. Junior, I'm gonna kill you. Who was that? Uh, no, no, sorry, 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 wrong choice of words. Junior, I'm upset with you. But, but he looks he looks like the crazy lunatic, though. Yeah, I know, kinda. But the crazy lunatic has sharp teeth and no hair. I mean, they're both ugly as sin, but that's not a crime. Oh, well, I'm sorry, Cody, for getting you mixed up. You, you just look just like him. <sighs> Whatever, Junior. Well, you call us if you see the real crazy lunatic. Let's go. Uh, who was at the door, dude? It was just Cody. <laughs> oh, no! He brainwashed Junior! I gotta do something about this. Uh, hello, 911? That crazy lunatic is back at the house! Uh, y yes, it's him, I know it's him! Sorry, Cody, for getting you arrested. It's fine, Junior, just don't let it happen again. Get on the ground! Get on the ground! Get on the ground. Stop resisting! Get him, stop, stop resisting! Stop. Wait, Joseph, what'd you do? No, Cody was sitting right next to you. You didn't see him? <sighs> Joe said it's not really him. Cody's not the, the crazy lunatic. They just look exactly the same. Oh, <laughs> how silly. <sighs> Hold on, I'll answer it. Hello? We goofed again. Yeah, we made another mistake. Junior, why do you keep calling the cops on me? I didn't call the cops on you this time. Joseph did. He doesn't know you're not the crazy lunatic. Well, tell him that. Yeah, and uh, make sure you don't call us again unless you really know it's him. Yeah, please, because I'm getting hurt. Come on, Cody. Look, we'll go tell Joseph you're not the crazy lunatic. All right, Joseph. Cody's back. Ah! <laughs> not one one. That crazy lunatic's in my house again. No, 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 Joseph. Hang on, hang on. Cody is not the lunatic. Wait, are you sure, dude? Cody, tell him. I'm not a lunatic, Joseph. It's me, Cody. No, 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 put the phone down. 911? J Joseph, stop calling the police! Yeah, yeah, Joseph, you gotta keep calling the cops, you should just go home. Fine, I don't wanna get murdered anyway! <sighs> Alright, Cody, let's go ask Chef to make us something to eat so we can just forget about this whole you getting arrested thing. Alright, fine. Hey, Chef PB, can you make me and Cody something to eat? Yeah, sure. What do you want? Oh my god, it's Cody the crazy lunatic from the news! Hey, Cody, what do you want to eat? Oh, I don't know. French fries or cheese sticks. You want cheese sticks or french fries? Oh, okay, okay, I can fix that. <laughs> of course he will want that. Cheese sticks or french fries? <gasps> because he's a lunatic. It reminds him of fingers. He wants to eat fingers. Uh, uh, sure, sure. I can make that for you. How about you, uh, go over there and sit at the table while I call the cops? I mean, I mean, fix your food. <laughs> Come on, Cody. Right. Oh, I gotta stall. <laughs> All right, the food will be out in a minute, guys. Just stay right here. Especially you, Cody. Don't move. Is Chef PB acting weird to you? No, he always acts like that. Hello, 911? Yes, that crazy lunatic Cody, he's here at my house. Y yes, I'm sure it's him. He's in the kitchen. Please hurry. <laughs> All right, guys, here's the food. Bon appetit. Get on the ground. Get on the ground. Stop no. resisting. No. Get that criminal. <laughs> Come on, Chef PB, he's not the crazy lunatic. What do you mean? He looks just like him. I know, but it's not him. He, he just looks like him. Oh. 
Uh, hold on. Hello? This is getting embarrassing. Sorry, mate. Junior, this is getting ridiculous. Ooh, look, look, look. No one else is going to call the cops on you because everyone knows you're not the lunatic. Yeah, how about this? How about we just don't answer to any more calls from this address? Yeah, I, I like that idea. I like that idea. All right, let's go. All right, Cody, how about this? How about we just don't we don't stay here. We go to a restaurant and get a nice sandwich so we don't have to be here, okay? Okay, that sounds like a good idea. Let's go. Welcome to Foot Long Bangers, where we put a foot long in your mouth. What do you want? What do you want, Cody? Uh, I have... Oh, my God! Uh, hello? Hey, I don't know why you decided to leave the house. This is the one place you knew we weren't gonna arrest him. I know, but I didn't think anybody else was gonna think he was the one that can call the cops. Yeah, well look, I think he should probably just avoid going out in public for a little while, at least until we catch the actual lunatic. Okay, officers. Come on, Cody, come inside. Junior, I think it'd probably be better if I just go home. I'm tired of getting tackled and put in handcuffs. <laughs> Unless it's Ken doing it. <laughs> okay, I'll see you later, Cody. Okay. <sighs> at least I'll be safe at home. Tyrone, I have a question. What is it, baby? And make it quick. You know I don't like all that talking. Why do you cheat on me so much? Look, baby, it gives me time to miss you. Let me explain. When I'm with another chick and she talk, starts to talk too much, I just think about you. And I'm like, man, I should go back to my wife right now. You're so sweet, Tyrone. Hey, <laughs> yeah, you know me, baby. Hey, Mom and Dad. Ah, it's that Cody lunatic from the nose! Somebody call the cop! Ah! Get on the ground now! Get on the ground! Hello? What, again? I thought we told you to let him stay here. He got arrested at his own house? Yeah, his parents thought he was the lunatic and they called us. Look, just keep him here this time. Uh, okay. Junior, I'm not safe anywhere. Oh, look, Cody, you're gonna stay with me upstairs. No one's gonna call the cops on you. Come on. <sighs> so, Cody, what do you want to do? Stay in this room forever because I'm tired of being arrested. Ooh, I got an idea, Cody. What if we put a disguise on you and then people won't recognize it's you? What, like a goofy glasses and nose and mustache? No, no, no. Better than that. <sighs> Better than that, huh? Well, Cody, look, it's the best disguise. No one's gonna notice it's you. Well, at least I don't look ridiculous. Look, I'm gonna prove it to you. Chef, baby, get in here. Oh, what do you want, Junior? Who's that? Nani? Ah! Is that crazy lunatic in the skies? What? 911? That crazy lunatic's in the house. He's in the sky. No, 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 no. no. Yeah. Oh, stop resisting! Oh. Yeah, beat him up, beat him up. <laughs> Trying to get away with that. <laughs> I'll get it. Wait, who's that? Hello. Okay, now I'm getting mad. Well, you said you weren't going to respond to any more calls to this address. Yeah, but when we got a call that he was in a disguise, that was really suspicious, you know? Especially because we said not to leave the house. Well, we just wanted to go out in public with him with a disguise. Okay, okay, fine. I'll tell you what. How about we just don't respond to any more calls from this house tonight, no matter what? No matter what? No matter what. All right, let's go. Come on, Cody. <sighs> Sorry, Cody, for the disguise idea. Junior, I'm just going to sit right here, and I'm not going to move until they catch the lunatic. <gasps> Say that again. I'm not gonna move until they catch the lunatic. Say those last three words again. Catch the lunatic? We should catch the lunatic! Junior, the police haven't even caught the lunatic. What are we gonna do? Well, if we catch the lunatic, then no one's gonna think you're the lunatic because the lunatic will be in jail. Junior, how are we gonna catch a lunatic? Well, to catch a lunatic, you gotta think like a lunatic. And the cops aren't thinking like a lunatic, so let, let's think about it. The lunatic likes to eat eyeballs. And Shrek eats eyeballs in the movie. He says he squeezes the eyeballs and uses it as jelly on toast. Okay, I don't really see where you're going with this. Well, if we can get an eyeball and put it by the front door, then he'll come find it, and then we'll capture him. But Junior, where are we gonna get an eyeball? Hmm. Oh, I got an idea. In this bag of gross, stretchy body part toys. Okay, but Junior, I don't think the lunatic is just going door to door looking for eyeballs to eat like Halloween candy. Look, it's worth a shot, Cody. Do you, do you wanna stay in this room forever? No. Okay, let's go put this eyeball by the front door, and if we catch him, we call the cops. Okay. All right, Cody, there's the eyeballs. Now we're just gonna have to wait for him to come, and we're gonna jump on him. Junior, this seems dangerous. No, we're gonna clear your name, okay? Come on. Is that a yummy eyeball I smell? Ooh, yummy eyeball. Give me yum, 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 yum. All right, Cody, jump on him. Don't the closet, don't the closet. Oh, my God. Okay, 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 you keep the door closed. I'm gonna call the cops. Okay. Come on, please answer, please answer. 911, what's your emergency? Oh, yes, officer, we have the crazy lunatic stuck in the closet right now. No, 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 no. We've done this too many times tonight. What? No, 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 it's true. We really have them this time. No, no, it's what you said last time. We told you we're not coming over there anymore. No, no, one more time, just one more time. I promise, it's the real crazy lunatic. No, 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 I'm not falling for it. Bye. No, 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 no. They say, Junior. They said they're not coming because there's been too many bad calls that, are, that aren't real. What, what, what do we do now? Oh, okay, okay, how about this, how about this? How about we invite him to dinner, and then we call the cops at dinner, so, so they arrive at dinner. Wait, Junior, you want to invite a serial killer to dinner? Yeah. Okay. Okay, open the door. Uh, ah! uh, stop it! Hey, stop, stop it right now. Okay, how about this? How about you go to dinner with us, and then we call the cops at... Wait, wait no, I'm not telling them that plan. Yeah. Uh, 
Oh, hold on, hold on. Tell me that. Okay, hold on. Well, you go to dinner with us, yeah. and you eat the waitress's eyeballs at the, at the restaurant. Yummy eyeballs. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. So, you'll come with us? <laughs> yeah. Okay, okay, come on. Welcome to Foot Long Bangers, where we put a foot long in your mouth. What you want? What do you want, lunatic? <laughs> oh, my God, it's a lunatic! Somebody call the cops! Oh, the cops are coming! Get on your ass! You got the wrong guy! <sighs> you got the wrong guy. We got the wrong guy. But we also got the right guy. See? Look how similar they look. Anybody can make that mistake. Well, you got the right guy. Yeah, yeah, we were driving back and we just found him munching on a guy's face, so we grabbed him. Okay, well, at least Cody's free. Come on, Cody. Yeah. Well, Cody, how's it feel to be a free man now? Feels pretty good, Junior. I'm tired of being in handcuffs. Anyway, let's check the weather and see if it was gonna rain. All right, let's do it. <laughs> news, okay? A crazy lunatic named Junior is on the loose. If you see this man, please call 911 immediately. Whoa, that guy's crazy! What? Uh, 911? What? Get off Get the ground! Ground! No, 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 no. Jeffy, it's time for dinner! What's for dinner, Danny? Uh... Don't you say it. Green beans? Wrong answer, Danny! Uh, Jeffy, why'd you shoot me in the face with a tennis ball blaster? Cause I don't wanna eat your crappy food! Then what do you wanna eat, Jeffy? Uh, a sandwich. Okay, then let's go get you a stupid sandwich. Gooch. Welcome to Foot Long Bangers! What kind of sandwich you want, baby? Uh, can I get a foot long banger with cheese? Okay, you want some ham? Yes, I would like ham. Okay, what about some turkey? Yeah, I'll take some turkey. Well, I want about some bacon! Yeah, I'll take some bacon. And what about some roast beef? Yeah, I'll take some roast beef. Okay, well, why don't you check between my legs then? <laughs> what, what? Freeze everyone on the ground now! Ah, Jeffy, run! Put the money in the bag. Ah! Oh, but I, I didn't mean to do that. Sorry. All right, that's all the money. Oh, sorry for the, the, the tennis ball to the face. Oh my god, Jeffy! We just saw a robbery happen! We just saw a robbery! But I didn't get my sandwich! Jeffy, forget about your sandwich! We just saw someone rob a store! What do we do? Do we call the cops? We go back and get my sandwich! Jeffy, shut up about your stupid sandwich! Who's that? Oh, oh, hold on, Jeffy. Oh, let me see who that is. Uh, hello? What? The cops! Thank God you're here! I was just about to call you! Why? To turn yourself in? What, turn myself in? No, what? Well, you're under arrest. What the hell? For robbing a sandwich shop. Well, I didn't rob a sandwich shop. Oh yeah? Well, we found your hat at the scene of the crime. My hat? Oh, okay. Well, I was at the sandwich shop, and it must have fallen off when I ran away. Yeah, you were running away because you just robbed the sandwich shop. Well, no, no, I ran away because the robber came in, and he robbed the sandwich shop. Okay, what'd the robber look like then? Well, he, had a, he had a ski mask on. But really? Like in a cartoon? Yeah. Oh, what? Did he have like a big bag with a money sign on it too? Yeah, yeah, he did. Come on, what do you think? I was born yesterday? Because I wasn't. I'm 42. Okay, obviously you don't look like you were born yesterday. Owie, okay, well you look old too. Okay, boomer. Well, well, okay, look, I didn't rob a sandwich shop. I was there with my son buying a sandwich and my son's upstairs right now. L let's go ask my son, he, he will vouch for me. I did not rob a sandwich shop. All right. All right, officer, there's my son who was with me during the robbery. Hey, daddy. I just opened up my piggy bank. Look at all his money. And there's the money you stole. What? No, that's his piggy bank money. That's not the kind of money you keep in a piggy bank. What kind of choice was he doing that he has that kind of money? Well. I pretend to be a girl online, and I sell pictures of my feet to weirdos. Wait, is that a tennis ball blaster? Yeah. Well, that's exactly what was used in the robbery. Oh, come on. Everybody has a tennis ball blaster. Well, I don't. Well, you're just a square. Well, okay. What is it? Make fun of me, Day? Why do you hate me so much? God. Well, be because you're accusing me of a robbery that I didn't commit. Well, look what I have to work with. We found your hat at the scene of the crime. You have a whole bunch of money that's missing, and here's a tennis ball blaster that was used in the robbery. Okay, but that's just all a coincidence. Yeah, okay, whatever. How about we go back to the scene of the crime and see if that jogs your memory? Okay, fine. My son wants a sandwich anyway, so Jeffy, just stay here. All right, buddy. All right, here we are at the scene of the crime. Look familiar? Welcome to Foot Long Bang. Hold on, ma'am, just one minute. Of course it looks familiar. I was just here. Robbing the place? No, I was ordering a sandwich. Well, then where's the sandwich? Well, she never had time to make it because the robber came in. Which was you? Because you were the robber? Well, no, no, I was just ordering a sandwich. All right, I'm going to ask the cashier if she recognizes you. Of course she's going to recognize me. I was just here. Ma'am, have you ever seen this man before? Yeah, he was the last person I saw before I got knocked out by a tennis box. Oh, really? Yeah, because I was here ordering a sandwich. Now, ma'am, what was the last thing he said to you before he knocked you out with a tennis ball? He was trying to get the roast beef that's between my legs. Well, no, I wasn't. Oh, this doesn't look too good for you, buddy. What? Just, just, just check the camera. 
cameras. The cameras don't work. They're purely for decoration. Oh, what? I've never heard of that before. Okay, look, you're under arrest because we have a witness here that says you were here on the day of the robbery and we found your hat at the scene of the crime. Well, just, just check for fingerprints. You're wearing gloves. Oh, come on. You're coming with me. No, no, tell, tell the truth. All right, say bye to your son. All right, Jeffy, apparently I'm going to jail for armed robbery. How long are you going to be gone for, Danny? You're facing 35 to life. Life? Well, no one, no one, you know, went to sleep forever. Well, that's the law. Apparently I'm going to jail for 35 years, probably. Well, what if I get hungry? There's Lunchables in the fridge. But what if I want wings? Just use your piggy bank money. Can I call my lawyer? You can meet him at the jail. Come on. <sighs> All right, Goodman. Tell it to me straight. Well, Mario, I reviewed your case. And? And you are so effed. What do you mean? The prosecution's gonna have a field day with you, Mario. They have so much evidence. What do they have? They have your hat at the scene of the crime, and they have witness testimony from the employee saying that you were the last person she saw before she blacked out. Oh, look, I know it looks like I did it, but I didn't do it. Well, if it looks like poop and smells like poop, then what is it, Mario? Poop? Ding, ding, ding! Poop! Your poop, Mario. But, but I was just there buying a sandwich. Well, Mario, do you have an alibi? Where were you during the crime? I was at the restaurant. Shut up. I want you to shut that dirty little mouth. I never want to hear you say that again, Mario. But I was at the restaurant. Shut up! You were on the beach in the Bahamas drinking fruity drinks from some dude named Pepito. No, no, I wasn't. That's a lie. I know, Mario, but if you want to win this, you have to lie. You have to lie, lie, lie. And once you're done lying, you have to lie some more, and then you're going to Tell one more lie with a cherry on top. But, but I want to tell the truth. Okay, if you want to tell the truth, Mario, then do you just want to take the max sentence? Life! Life, Mario! Or do you want to take the plea deal? Well, what's the plea deal? Fifteen years. Well, fifteen years? Yeah, or, well, seven and a half with good behavior. I don't want the plea deal. I just want to tell the truth, and I want to be found innocent. <sighs> All right, Mario. Let me see what I can do. Okay, I don't, I don't want to take the plea deal. I got it, Mario. Just let me see what I can do. Come on. Shut up, Mario. Let me do all the talking. Okay. All rise for the Honorable Judge Strongbottom. Order! Order! Court is now in session. Mario, you are being charged with armed robbery. How do you plead? Your Honor, we would like to take the plea deal. What? Perfect! Open and shut! Mario, you are hereby sentenced to 15 years in federal prison. Well, that was nice. Let's break for an early lunch. I didn't want to take the plea deal. They had us in a quarter, Mario. I had no other option. All right, you're coming with me. You didn't even try. I don't want to go to jail for 15 years. Seven and a half with good behavior, so be good. Oh. Oh, 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 take that diaper. Oh, 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 oh. Let's just look at that sad face. How am I going to tell him? Okay, I can do this. Come on. Hey there, champ. There's uh, something I need to talk to you about. What's going on? Well, uh, it's about your daddy. He's, uh, he's gonna be in jail for a long time. <laughs> Freaking rip! Pouring out for my daddy, my D-A-double-D-Y! Hope he doesn't drop that show! Right. Well, since he's not gonna be here, uh, we're gonna have to put you in a foster home. For imaginary friends? No, no, not like the TV show. This is a foster home for very real and sad children. Well, why can't I stay here? Well, you're just a kid. You can't live here by yourself while your dad's in jail. Well, my dad didn't do anything. I was there the whole time. Well, it's too late for that, kid. He's already in jail. Well, I'm going to get my dad out of jail. I'm going to prove he's innocent. Well, how are you going to do that, champ? You're going to get a spoon and dig a tunnel under the prison like in a movie or something? No, I'm Detective Jeffy. Dun, dun, dun. Take me to the scene of the crime. Oh, okay. I got nothing better to do. Come on. All right, kid, here we are back at the scene of the crime, but my men sweeped all over this place, so I don't know what you're hoping to find. There's no evidence here. Never question, Detective Jeffy. <laughs> What's that, boy? You found a clue? Gonna take a couple fives and a couple ones. Man, his methods are unusual, but he's the best detective we have. <gasps> what you dish? What? That's a hair. What? How did we miss that? I'm one step closer to freeing my daddy. Now I gotta track it. <laughs> Tastes like clown. Follow me. All right, kids. So why are you setting up a birthday party for yourself? Because we found clown hair at the scene of the crime. And if you set up a birthday party, a clown will come because clowns always go to birthday parties. Well, why do we need a clown to come when you're already here? Oh, 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 ooh, ooh, oh, eh, tss. Oh, you want me to go get my doctor outfit on so I can treat that burn? Woo! 
<laughs> yeah. All right, but seriously though, what it, what is the plan? Or right, we set up a birthday party and the clown will come. So we just gotta sit here until the clown comes. Oh, oh, I think that's him at the door. Let me go see. Hello? Hey kid, I heard there was a party, so I thought you needed a clown. So I came over and I brought my tennis ball blaster so I can do tricks. So you gonna let me in? Yeah, sure, come on in. All right. All right, here's the clown. Na, 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 na. Which one of you kids is the birthday boy? Uh, I guess that'd be him. Oh, I, I didn't mean to do that. I accidentally did that to some woman's face earlier. Hmm. Sorry for making a mess. You guys got any napkins? I'll just use my ski mask I used earlier. Hmm. hmm. So how are you guys gonna pay me today? I only accept cash. Hmm. What's my hair doing on the table? Must be falling out. Didn't know I was getting that old. <laughs> hmm. Can we hurry up and cut this cake? I'm starving. You really work up an appetite after you rob a sandwich shop. Hmm? Now wait a minute. Did you rob a sandwich shop earlier? Uh, no. Okay, you were just saying a lot of weird stuff, but I'm sorry for accusing you. Where were you earlier today? I was robbing a sandwich shop. Oh, I knew it! Oh, that's it. You're under arrest, screwball. Oh, rats. Nice job, kid. You're a natural. All right, Mario, you're free to go. Wait, what happened? Well, you should thank your son, Detective Jeffy. He's a real Sherlock Holmes. Jeffy, what'd you do? Daddy, I got that long song that Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers. What? She sells seashells by the seashore, you know. But, but what happened? Danny, how much wood could a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? I, I don't know what happened. Irish wristwatch, you know, rubber baby buggy bumpers. But what happened? Danny, I'll tell you. A skunk sat on a stump and thunk the stump stunk, but the stump thunk the skunk stunk. What? Exactly, exactly. Greek grapes. Oh, no more no more tongue twisters. What is happening? It was a clown, okay? Which means it was you, because you're a clown. Oh, 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 I got him. Oh, oh, yeah, if you feel like a pimp, go and dust your shoulders off. Oh, uh, oh, uh, look what I'm doing. Oh, uh, because I'm a pimp. Oh, uh, eh. Oh, I'm going to go get my doctor outfit. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> all right, all right. So I can treat that burn. Oh, they're gone. Well, man, I put on the doctor outfit and everything because, you know, it's funny because doctors treat burns. And... Well, I thought it was funny. It would have been so funny if you would have heard it. Oh, you're leaving already? Oh, yeah. See you later, man. Oh, see you later. Oh, wait, wait, wait. So I can treat that burn? What, Debbie? What do you want? Danny, I have a problem. What is it? I want to color with my crayons, but we ran out of paper, and now I don't know what to color on. Well, if we don't have any paper, I'll buy you more paper tomorrow. But I want to color. Well, I want a million dollars right now. Me too! Jeffy, just be patient. Jeffy, just be patient! Jeffy! Jeffy! Jeffy, don't talk back! Jeffy, don't talk back! Jeffy, just take your stupid crayons, and if you can't find any paper, just wait till tomorrow. But Daddy, I don't know what to color on! Well, if we don't have any paper, you're not coloring on anything, so leave! Daddy, I'm gonna find something to color on! No! Stop it! No, you're not coloring on anything! Oh, he makes me so mad. Stupid Danny won't give me paper to color. Well, it's 2021 and the wall identifies this paper. Mario, what's that sound? It sounds like Jeffy. Come on. Jeffy! What are you doing? I'm drawing a pretty, pretty picture. Oh, that's a pretty, pretty picture? Who's that pretty, pretty picture supposed to be of? Oh, it's a character I made up. Oh, it's a character you made up? Are you sure it's not me? No, it's not you. Oh, 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 oh so you're saying I'm a bum. I never said that. And you're saying I sniff butts? I don't sniff butts, Jenny. I never said you did, Danny. Jenny, that is it. You are grounded because you are a bad boy. <laughs> Say I'm a bad boy! Because you are a bad boy! <sighs> baby, baby, is that a drawing of me? It kind of looks like you, I guess. It is me! What the? What happened right there? Oh, I first tried drawing on the wall with a hammer. <gasps> Jenny, you are a bad boy! Go to your room! <gasps> Oh, Jeffy just makes me so mad. I feel like my head's gonna explode. Mario, we should go for a walk. Calm down. Yeah, yeah, I think I need some fresh air. Okay. <sighs> Do you feel better, Mario? Yeah, kinda. Wait, are you not wearing shoes while walking outside? I'm earthing, Mario. Th that's gross. Your feet are gonna be all, like, dirty on the bottom. It's okay. I can bathe. What's that noise? 
Mario, it's a shooting star! Do we, do we call someone? No, Mario, make a wish! Okay, I wish Jeffy would be a good boy for just one night. Let's go inside, Mario. Yeah, I don't want to get hit by the crossfire. Oh man, today has been the perfect day. Nothing could ruin this day, nothing. Hi, Boyne. But you're gonna try, aren't you? Boyne, how was your day today? Karen, my day has been fantastic. I had the day off, I played video games, I watched TV, I drank root beer, it's been a great day. Boyne, that's wonderful, I'm glad to hear it. You know, I was at the grocery store and I saw the cutest baby! And it made me realize that I wanna have a baby with you, Boyne. Like right now! Oh, no, no, man, you ruined it. You ruined it. You ruined the whole day now. But, Boyne, you don't want to have a baby? No, no, I don't, care. And Kids are terrible. How about this? How about we start with a goldfish, and if you don't kill that, we work our way up to a hamster. And if that's still around, then maybe we can have a cat, and then another cat, and then we get another cat, and we just keep getting cats forever instead of having a kid. But, Boyne, imagine a kid with my eyes and your gorgeous no, no, I don't want to imagine that, Karen. Kids are terrible. Why don't we just get a cat? Cats are clean. They clean themselves. You know, they poop in a box, and then they cover up the poop. You know, kids, they poop on everything. And if you raise them wrong, they commit crimes. Cats don't commit crimes. Mr. Puffy Pants doesn't commit crimes. Pointy, I really want to have a baby! Uh, 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 okay, okay, you, you know what, Karen? Just, just stay, stay right here. Stay right here. I have an idea. Wasn't that a nice walk, Mario? Yeah, I guess it was. Ew! Look how dirty your feet are! Oh, I'll shower later. Ugh. Hey, man. Ah! How'd you get in my house? Oh, I just let myself in. Well, what are you doing here? Okay, I need a huge favor. What? All right, you got a kid, right? Yeah. And he sucks, right? Oh, he's the worst kid on this planet. Oh, that's great. I mean, it's not great for you. That sucks for you, but it's awesome for me. How is it awesome for you? Okay, look. My wife wants to have a kid, and I want to show her how bad it is to have a kid. Okay, so I'm going to bring her over here, and I'm going to show her your kid and how bad he is, and that'll make her never want to have kids. I mean, that's a good idea. Yeah, bring her over. She'll hate Jeffy and she'll hate kids. Oh, awesome. Okay, I'm going to bring her over and just make sure he's like breaking stuff and screaming and pooping his pants and stuff like that. No, 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 no. I'm not going to get Jeffy to do all that because I already deal with enough of that already. So no, I'm not doing that. <sighs> okay, okay, man. Look. I will pay you $10,000 to do this for me. Why will you pay so much? Because if I have a kid, it's going to cost me way more than $10,000. I'm going to have to deal with 18 years of screaming, okay? If I can make one payment to not have to deal with that, it's worth it. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, definitely. Oh, yeah, I'll have Jeffy breaking stuff. I'll have him pooping his pants, everything. Mario, we shouldn't exploit Jeffy's temper tantrums. Oh, we're going to make money off his temper tantrums because I have to pay for my wall that he broke. So, yeah, we'll definitely do it. Yeah, go, get, go get your wife. Okay, yeah, I'll go get her. Wait, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Look at my wife's feet. Ew! Why do they look like that? Because she goes outside without, without wearing shoes. Wh why? That's what shoes are for. I am one with the earth. Yeah, you're going to be one with a podiatrist if you keep that up. That's gross. Yeah, it's disgusting. So, yeah, go, go, go get your wife. Okay, I'm going to go get my wife. Just make sure your kid's all riled up when I get back. Oh, I will. Oh, I will. <laughs> Karen, 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 baby, I just realized something. What, Boydie? I was wrong. I actually do want to have a kid. Oh, really, Boydie? Yeah, yeah, you know, I, I met this kid today, and he made me want to have a kid. He was just such a great, awesome kid, and I think you should meet him so you can see how great it is to have a kid. Okay, Boydie, I want to meet him. Okay, come on. Okay. Hey, buddy. Oh, hey. Here's my wife. Oh, hey. Boydie tells me that you have the nicest son. Oh, yeah, my son is so nice. The nicest kid ever. But yeah, yeah, well, uh, where, 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 where is he? Oh, he's, he's laying down in bed. What, you didn't have him ready? Like with hammers and chainsaws and stuff? Oh, no, 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 no. When I wake him up, he's going to start acting bad, so I don't want you to miss anything. <laughs> That's good thinking. That's my man right there. All right, all right, go get your good son. I'll go get my good w son. Wait, 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 wait. Where's your wife? Oh, I told her to wash her feet with a whole bar of soap. Oh, thank God. That was disgusting. Yeah, yeah, well, I'm going to go get my good son. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you do that. Oh, honey, you're going to love this kid. He's the best kid ever. We could never have a kid better than this one. Jeffy, wake up! Good morning, Father. What? Jeffy, why are you dressed like that? Oh, these are the clothes that you bought me by being a very working hard father, and I appreciate it very much. But you've never worn those clothes before? Like, Jeff, Jeffy, like, you're acting really weird. What, what happened to the pits on your nose? Oh, well, I realized that it was very unhygienic, and I apologize for ever shoving it up my nostril. Jeffy, no, you're not acting the same. What, what happened to your helmet? Oh, I thought it was very foolish of me to wear my helmet when I was not riding a bicycle. And I apologize for embarrassing you in public. No, Jeffy, no, 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 no. I don't have time for you to act like this. I understand I called you a bad boy, so now you're trying to act like a good boy to try to be sarcastic and be an idiot. But no, 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 I need you to act like a bad boy because there's a guy in there that's paying me $10,000 for you to act crazy and break stuff and act stupid. So I need you to take this lighter. 
Okay, would you like me to light some candles, Daddy? No! I need to take this lighter and light the house on fire. Like, that'd just be really bad because the guy's paying me $10,000 for you to be a bad boy. So I don't have time for you to be a good boy. Be a bad boy! Well, lighting the house on fire would put everyone in danger and that would be extremely unsafe. I need you to be like that! Jimmy, stop it. You're coming with me to the other room and I need you to uh, crazy, break stuff. Just, just go crazy. Come on! <laughs> All right, here's my son, Jeffy. It's a pleasure to meet both of you this evening. Ma'am, you look very beautiful. Oh, my gosh! You're so yeah, yeah, he's really nice, dude. What's going on? Oh, I, I think, I think uh, he's... Oh, 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 I see what's going on. You're just making him look nice so that later when he starts breaking stuff, he'll look really crazy. All, all right, it's a good idea. Uh, yeah, that's, that's what's happening. That's definitely what's happening. All right, Jeffy. Um, Father, if it's not too much trouble, I would like to be called Jeff from now on. It sounds more proper. He's so well-mannered. Yeah, yeah, he sure is, but when's he gonna start cussing, though? Oh, don't, don't worry, he's gonna start, he's gonna start cussing. Um, uh, all right, uh, Jeff, um... I found this hammer. What are you going to do with this hammer? Oh, would you like me to build an orphanage for all of the homeless orphans? He's so caring and selfless! Yeah, yeah, some people would even say he's a little too caring and selfless. Oh, no, no, he's going to go crazy. Whoa, whoa, watch this, watch this. All right, Jeff, why don't you take this hammer and go break a hole in the wall and, and yell the F word really loud? Well, that would be very immature of me and cost you a lot of money and damages. <laughs> All right, all right, time out, time out. Me and Mario are going to go into the other room, and we're going to talk about why Jeffy's so nice, because I, I want to know how you get a kid to act like that. Come on. Okay, Jeff and I will get better acquainted. What is going on? What the hell is going on? I, I don't know. He usually acts bad. I don't know why he's acting so good. Yeah, I don't understand this. Why isn't he being bad? I don't even recognize that kid in there. I, I know. He was, he was bad earlier. Look what he did earlier. What? what, 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 what where's this kid? I want this kid back. I, I, I sniff butts. That's gold. My wife would hate that. I, I don't know. He, he did this earlier. He even, he even broke a hole in my wall earlier. Well, that, I, I actually did that a few videos ago. But this, this is awesome. Why can't he do this? I don't know. He, he usually is always bad. I don't know what could have happened. Well, did you tell him to be good or something? Well, actually. What? Well. What? Earlier, I wished on a shooting star that I wish he would be good for one night. Well, you did what? You wished upon a shooting star? Everybody knows that when you wish upon a shooting star, it comes true. I I, I would sing the Disney song, but Jiminy Cricket would fuck me. Well, well oh, okay, I, I got an idea. I got an idea. Why don't we just show your wife this wall and say that Jeffy did it earlier and, and then she wouldn't want him? Yes, yes, that's good. That's great. That's great. Okay, yeah, yeah. We'll show her this and then we'll just tell him that, 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 that yeah, yeah, that he's on meds and that's why he's being good now. Yeah, 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 yeah. He, he always goes crazy, but he has to be, he has to be on a lot of medicine not to go, not to not to act normal. Yeah, yeah, okay, okay. I'll go, I'll go, I'll go get that. Hey, baby. Boy, Jeff is the sweetest kid. I told him I was so seen. He got me this bottle of water. Yeah, how sweet of him. Father, may I use the restroom? Yeah, whatever. Uh, anyway, I did tell him that one thing. Oh, honey, yeah, yeah. I, I mean, this kid seems nice, but I think this kid is bad news. Bad news? But he's such a sweetheart. Yeah, well, you're not going to think that after you see what he did to this wall. Come look. All right, honey, check this out. What? Jeff, what are you doing? Oh, I noticed there was some graffiti on the wall, so I thought I would repaint the wall for you, Father. Aw, he's a handyman, too! What's wrong with you? Be normal! Boydie, why are you yelling at him? Because he's not usually like this. Yeah, he's usually breaking stuff and... Ooh, I got an idea. What? Okay, okay, every time Jeff sees some green beans, he throws them. So, 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 let's, so let's go down to the kitchen and try to feed Jeffy green beans, and then your wife will see how crazy he is. Yeah, yeah, that's good. Oh, oh, man, honey, I'm really hungry for, for green beans specifically. I think we should go downstairs and eat a whole plate of green beans. Yeah, yeah, let, let's go do that. Come on, come on, Jeff, it's time for you to eat some green beans. Okay. Mm-mm-mm. This looks like a scrumptious plate of green beans, doesn't it, Jeff? It actually does. Thank you, Father, for going to work and working so hard to provide this amazing meal. Shall I say grace? What? Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for this food, and thank you for allowing us to live another day. God is good. God is great. Thank you for this food. Amen. Shall we eat our green beans? No! No, no, we're not going to do that. This is not how you usually act. This whole thing is bull. Here's what you're supposed to do. You're supposed to pick up the plate, and you're supposed to throw it like that. That's what you always do. What? We're going home right now. I don't think you're mature enough to have a kid. Really? Uh, okay. <laughs> Thanks, man. Well, Jeffy, I'm so mad at you. The day I need you to act bad, you act really good. And I don't know why you had to act so good. I just need you to act bad, but you had to act so good. Why did Mario! Why are you yelling at Jeffy? He can't do anything right. You yell at him when he's bad, and now you're yelling at him when he's good, and it just doesn't make sense. Let's go! Uh, uh. What's that noise? Oh no! 
Jeffy, what are you doing? You only wish that I would be a good boy for one night. And it's the next day, so. Mario, I wonder what Jeffy's doing. He's probably staring at a wall. Ow, Jeffy! Hey, Daddy, can I go outside and play kickball with my friend? No! Mario, Jeffy could use some fresh air. Yeah, Daddy, listen to your woman. Well, well, let me turn on the news and check the weather and make sure it's not gonna rain or something, or like a tornado. You're watching the news! And now, time for the weather. But first, it's time for the joke of the day. Why did the ducky get arrested? Because you got caught selling quack. <laughs> get it? <laughs> And now, time for the weather! Today's weather forecast is a sunny, no cloud day. Sunny blue sky AF. With a random chance of lightning. So make sure to look out for those random quacks of lightning. Huh? Get it? Quacks? Like a duck? Huh? Well, would you look at that? Too bad, so sad, you can't play outside, there's lightning. But Mario, it's a sunny day today and no clouds. Yes. What? What? No. what? Hey, Jeffy, I hope you get struck by lightning. Mario! Well, he's being annoying. Show sure, hold, Daddy. Oh, no, 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 go away, Jeffy. Go play outside. Good. Oh, he's so annoying. All right, Jeffy, are you ready to kick the ball? Yeah, Junior, I'm going to kick the ball so hard, I'm going to kick it over the fence. Please don't, because then we have to go get it. Oh, don't worry about it, dude. I have wings. I can just fly over there and get it. Okay. All right, Jeffy, you ready to kick it? Yeah, Junior, send it. Okay. <laughs> Whoa! Whoops. Jeffy, you kicked the ball in the forest. Well, I told you I was gonna kick it over the fence. What are we gonna do? Uh, dude, I'll go look for it. Okay, how about you look in the air and me and Jeffy go look on the ground. Okay, I got you, dude. All right, Jeffy, let's go look for the ball. All right, Junior. Okay, Jeffy, do you see the ball? What color was it? What color was it? It was red, you just kicked it. Oh, I don't remember it being red, Junior. I thought it was more like a maroon or like a crimson. It was red. Oh, hey, Junior, it could have been green. I don't even know, I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> Was that lightning? It's not even raining outside. Jeffy! Ah! Jeffy! Yeah. Jeffy, are you okay? Oh, I'm fine, Junior. I just got a tree stuck on my leg. My leg's probably broken. Probably needs to be amputated. I'm doing just fine, Junior. Okay, good. No, Junior, get the tree off my leg! Okay, I'm gonna try. I've already tried that, Junior. Good luck with that. Uh, it's so heavy. Yeah, just like your mom. Oh, okay, look, I need more people to help me lift the, the tree off your leg, so I'm gonna get help, okay? All right, Junior, hurry! All right, just stay right here, okay? I don't have a choice, Junior. Okay, look, if a lion comes, just, just try not to be a cheeseburger, okay? All right, thanks for the advice. Right, just stay right here. Hurry, Junior! Chef, baby, Chef, baby, Jeffy needs help! Guess who made pizza rolls? Pizza rolls? Yeah, isn't it your favorite? Oh, I love them, Chef, baby. I want one. Ah, you haven't done your chores, Junior. You're going to take out that trash. Well, take out the trash? Yeah, you know you have to do your chores. You can't eat anything until you've done your chores. Okay, I'll take out the trash real quick, Chef, baby. You better hurry up. Uh, okay, I took out the trash. Now I can eat pizza rolls. All right, Chef, baby, I took out the trash. All right, Junior, there's your pizza rolls. Oh, they look so good. Be careful, they're hot. Jimmy, I burned my mouth. What? I burned my mouth. Junior, I can't understand what you're saying. You probably burned your mouth from the pizza roll. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Oh, Jimmy, I gave me help in the way. What? You gave me any help in the way. Junior, I would not be able to win a golf tournament against Tiger Woods. He's really good at golf. Uh, you gave me any help in the way. Junior, I don't understand what you're saying. Just eat your pizza roll, okay? Go. Uh, any help. <sighs> Stupid tree. Stupid outside. Stupid dirt, stupid fly, stupid goofy looking alligator. Hey there, need some help? No, I'm fine. My friend Junior said he's gonna help me. Oh, well you look stuck. I can lift this tree up. I'm pretty strong. No, I said I'm fine. My friend Junior's gonna go get some help. Well, what, what's going on here? Oh, hey, Mr. Squirrel. Our friend here is stuck. Oh, you need to get that tree off for you? No, I said my friend Junior is gonna go get some help. And also, my daddy told me not to talk to strangers. But the tree! Yeah, it's stuck on your leg. I said screw off or before I turn you into shoes and turn you into a yard ornament. Well, jeez. Well, God. Don't want our help with it. Junior, where are you? Okay. Heavy knee help. 
<sighs> Come on, get clean, get clean! Hey, yeah, baby, I'm red! Uh, shut up, Junior, I'm trying to clean the stove, okay? Well, I'm gonna be better here, I'm Debbie! Look, look, I don't care about that, I'm trying to clean the stove! Look, I got- Debbie needs help! Uh, yay? Me? How? Junior, I'm tired of you playing games, starting fires in the house. Look, look, oh, you smell like smoke in the outside. You need to go and take a bath. Oh, uh, Debbie, need help. Go and take a bath right now before I tell your dad. Debbie, need help. You know what? I'm going to take you in the bath. Come on, we're going to bathe. Oh, I'm starting to think Junior's not coming. Hey there. Ah, a lion! Mmm, a cheeseburger. I'm going to eat good tonight. <laughs> oh, Junior said that if I see a lion, then I'll act like a cheeseburger. So I'm going to be a hot dog. <laughs> I'm a hot dog. Ew, a hot dog. I thought you were a cheeseburger. Ah, hot dog! Nani? Kevin, Kevin needs help! Junior, I don't want to hear it. You need to take a bath. And then you're gonna be in your room all day. Grab it for starting that fire. Look, here's a bar of soap, and you better clean behind your ears. Ow! Yeah, wait, who's that? Uh, Junior, I'll be right back. Hey, Debbie, help! Hello? Could you tell Junior that I couldn't find the ball? Wait, Joseph, you have wings? Oh, yeah, this is my new shell. I can fly. <laughs> oh, that's nice. But, uh, Junior is grounded for trying to burn the house down. So go away. God. Oh, okay then. Ha <laughs> ha ha, Junior. That was your stupid friend. Joseph, but I told him that you couldn't play because you're grounded. Jeffy, uh, I can talk better. <laughs> Jeffy's stuck in the woods and needs help. Look, I don't care about your stupid friends. Hurry up and get out of the tub and go into your room and get in the bed. Jeffy, uh, Junior, Junior, help me. Oh man, it's been hours. Oh, hey there, you need some help? Yes, Mr. Camel. My name is not Mr. Camel. It's Camille Habib Habab. And I'm going to try to move this tree lock. I'm going to try to move it with my hoof. Push, push, push. Well, that's all I can do. Bye. Oh, no, Mr. Camel, please don't leave. Oh, Junior, where are you? Chef, baby, you have to listen to me. I don't want to hear it, Junior. You're grounded. You're going to stay in this room, okay? But Jeffy needs help. He's in the woods, Chef, baby. Look, a tree fell on Jeffy's leg, and he's stuck in the woods. Wait, what? Yeah, Jeffy needs help. His leg's broken. There's a tree on it, and we need, we need to eat the tree off his leg. Come help him. You better not be pranking me, Junior. I'm not pranking you. Jeffy needs help. Follow me, Chef, baby. Oh, my God. All right, Chef, baby. Jeffy's out here somewhere. Where is he, Junior? Uh, I don't know. I kind of forgot where we we were at. I mean, it looked like this. There were trees and there were leaves. Hurry up! You're wasting my time! Uh, Chevy, you know, I promise. Look, Jeffy's out here. He needs our help. There's a tree on his leg because we were looking for my ball that he kicked in the woods and lightning struck a tree and it fell on his leg. Lightning? Yeah. Junior, it's sunny AF. There's no lightning around. Uh, that's what I thought, but then lightning struck a tree and it landed on his leg. We need to help him. Junior, I'm about to go home. Okay? No, no, Chevy, no, please look. We have to find Jeffy. <gasps> Chevy, look! What? My ball! Junior, wow. You're the lowest of the low. I can't believe you. You're actually going to tell a lie about your friend getting stuck under a tree and breaking his leg so I can come and get a ball for you? Well, well no, no, no. That, that is true. That really did happen. But I just found my ball and it's up in that tree. Can you get it? Junior, that's not going to work. Look, I'm going home, okay? No, Chef B, please. Get my ball. Please, Chef B, Please. Shut up, Junior. I'll find a freaking stick or something. Okay, Junior. I got a really big stick. And I got this okay size stick, too. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about, Junior? <laughs> Chef, your jokes aren't funny. Can you just help me get my ball? Well, you should be laughing at my jokes since I'm doing this favor for you. I just get my ball, Chef Pee-Pee. All right, shut up, move. Uh, 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 come on. Uh, yeah. Wow, Chef Pee-Pee, you suck. Uh, what, do you want to try, Junior? Huh? No, no, that stick's too heavy. Yeah, that's what I thought. But I, I would just try aiming for the ball. Uh, what do you think I'm aiming at, huh? The branches? No, I'm aiming at the ball. Uh, uh, I got it. What was that? Yeah. <laughs> you got my ball, Chef Pee Pee! I knew I would get it. Yay, Chef Pee Pee, my ball! Thank you for getting it! Are you happy now, Junior? Can we go home? Uh, yeah, I mean, we have my ball now. I forgot why we came out here anyway. Well, get your ball. Let's go. Okay. Junior! Oh, where are you, Junior? I'm gonna be stuck out here forever and then I'm gonna die! Hey, kid, you wanna play a game? Ah, a clown! Mm -mm. Screwball, and I'm here to help. You're gonna help me? Yeah, I'm getting shaved! Alright, kid. Well, I'm tired, so here, you can do the rest. Oh, where are you going? What am I supposed to do? 
Oh. Oh. I know. Dude, I'm so glad you got the ball back. I know, I love this ball. Where did you find it? It was stuck in a tree. Wait, how did you get it down? Shepi, we had to get a stick. Oh man, I couldn't even see it from the sky, dude. Wait, really? No, not at all. I just feel like I'm forgetting something. Wait, what could you be forgetting? We have the ball. I don't know, I just feel like I forgot something in the woods. Hey, Junior, forgetting something? Uh, 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 we got the ball back, Jeffy! Yay! Let's go play! Yeah, let's go play! Yay! Oh, man, I can't wait to get Marvin's house payment. Hey, Danny, can me and Junior go outside and play with my balls? What? My soccer ball. Uh, oh, yeah, sure, as long as you're playing with that ball and, and not something else. All right, Danny. <sighs> Who's at the door? Uh, hello? Hey, Marvin. Uh, Goodman, what are you doing here? Well, just like your period, I come once a month. So, where's your house payment? Uh, my house payment? Yep, it's due on the same day every single month. So, where is it? Uh, uh it's in my wallet. Okay, where's your wallet? Oh, where is that thing? Uh, where's my wallet? Oh, oh, it's, uh, it's upstairs. I have to go look for it. All right, cool. I'll come help you. Come on, buddy. No, 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 no. I think I left it in here somewhere. Now, where did your pesky wallet run off to? I have no idea. What are you looking for? Oh, baby, I lost my wallet, and we can't find it anywhere. Oh, it's right here. Oh, thanks, baby. <laughs> You're welcome. Now we should open it up and see if my house payment's in there, because you said it was. Uh, well, wait a minute, baby. That's my old wallet. What? Yeah, you know, I got a new wallet today, remember? Um, I don't remember having this conversation, Mark. Baby, I got a new wallet. Remember, it, it was purple with green polka dots, and it plays a song when you open it? No, that shouldn't be hard to find. Yeah, yeah, so that's my old wallet. Uh, Marvin, I don't remember you getting a new Shut wallet. Shut up. I got a new wallet, and I showed it to you today. I said, look at my new wallet. It's National New Wallet Day. I don't Look, 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 get that out of there, okay? L listen, watch. Uh, let, let's look for my new wallet. Uh, it could be. It, it, look, check the cushions. Uh, check. You check. In another room somewhere, so you can stop talking. Fine. Look, look, look underwear. I don't see it. All right, Jeffy, are you ready to kick the soccer ball? Hey, Junior, this guy left his keys in the car. Don't worry, no one's gonna steal it. This is an upper middle class neighborhood. I know, Junior, but I'm saying we should steal it. What? We'll go to jail, Jeffy! No, Junior, check this out. How about we just hop in, ride to McDonald's, get us a couple Happy Meals, come back, he'll never know! Oh my god, Jeffy, that's a genius idea! I know. Hop in! I call shotgun! I call AK-47! Alright, Junior, you ready to go to McDonald's? Heck yeah! Alright, let's go! Welcome to McDonald's, how can I help you today? Yeah, you can start by taking them panties off. And then we'll get two chicken nugget Happy Meals, and instead of the toy, put your panties in the box. All right, your toy will be six fifty at the window. We ain't got money, bye! <laughs> Jeffy, how are we gonna get the Happy Meals? We don't have any money. Don't worry, Junior, I got this. Hey, this will be six fifty. Well, I gotta get the food first, and then I'll pay. Uh, that's not how this works. Well, when I eat at other restaurants, I always get the food first, and then I pay later. Okay, that's a good point. All right, thank you. All right, Junior, there's your Happy Meals. Yes. Okay, 3 Oh yeah, hold on, let me get your money. <laughs> Shut the door! Yes! We got the Happy Meal! Happy Meal! Woo! Yes! We got the Happy Meal! Woo! What? Jeffy, look out! Huh? Oh, you hit it! What did I hit, Junior? I think you hit Remy from Ratatouille! Oh man, let's get out and check on him! Uh -huh. Oh no, Jeffy, he's dead! Well, he shouldn't have been jaywalking! Do you think if I do CPR, I can bring him back to life? I don't know, maybe, Junior, you should try it. Okay. Ah! He's not dead! Hey, run over again! Run over again! Oh, he bit me! Oh, let me see! <laughs> Do you see any bite marks? Hold still, Junior, you're moving too much. <laughs> vroom, vroom. Oh, do you see any? No, hold still, Junior, I'm looking. What? The car. I'm not driving. Why did it start? <laughs> hey, hey, get back here. Someone stole the car we stole. Oh, man. Hold on, we have to call the cops, Jeffy. They won't, they, they stole our Happy Meals. Oh, the Happy Meals too, no. Oh. Okay, okay, we have to call the cops and say that someone stole the car we stole. All right, let's go. All right, Jeffy, I'm calling the cops. It's ringing. Okay. Oh, I should really call my daddy and tell him what happened. 
Hello, Jeffy, what do you want? Um, Danny? What? You know the guy that's at the house right now wearing the suit? Yeah. Well, me and Junior stole his car. You what? And then we lost it. You lost it? Jeffy, why'd you steal his car, Jeffy? Well, because me and Junior thought it would be fun to go for a ride and get some Happy Meal. Jeffy, Jeffy, you find that car and bring it back right now, because if he finds out it's missing, he's going to kill me. I can't bring it back right now. I lost it. Find it and bring it back. All right. I'll see what I can do. Don't see what you can do. Find it and bring it back. All right. I'll see what I can do, Dang. Bye. <sighs> Is there a problem, Marvin? Oh, no, 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 no problem at all. I just I just really wish we could find my wallet. Where is that thing? Yeah, well, since it's taking so long to try to find your wallet, I think I'll just come back in the morning. But, no, 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 no you, you can't leave. You, you can't leave. Why? B because, because, like, don't you want your house payment today? I mean, I'd prefer it today, but... Yeah, 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 just, 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 don't leave. You can't leave. Don't don't go out to your car. Look, look, just, just, just help me find the wallet. I feel like we're really close to finding it. Okay. It, could, it, it could be over here. Well, I am getting kind of tired, so I'm going to run out to my car and grab my energy drink. But no, 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 you can't go out to your car. Why? But you, you don't want to drink energy drinks. They'll give you kidney stones. That'll hurt your pee-pee. Look, look, uh, you need some water. Let's, let's go to my kitchen and get some water. Come on. All right. Oh, yeah, look at that water. Doesn't that look good? From the fridge. Yeah, it's good. I usually get water flown in from Fiji. What well, look, just try it. I promise you're going to like it. Okay. Isn't that good? Tastes like ass, and I would know. <laughs> uh, let's just go look for my wallet. Come on. Hey there, you call the cops? Uh, yes, sir, officer. Somebody stole our car. What, your car? Y you're a child. Uh, yeah, but it's a friend's car that we were borrowing, but he didn't really know we were borrowing it, but we really need it back. Yeah, and I'm legally able to drive, so we're good. Okay, do you have a driver's license? Yeah, hold on, let me find it. <laughs> That's really up there, huh? <laughs> You want to smell? No, thank you. Ugh. Look, we really need the car back or we're getting in trouble. Okay, what'd the car look like? It was blue. And fast. Okay, a blue fast car. Yeah, and in the little steering wheel thingy, underneath it there's a little pedal that when you press it, it goes really fast. Yeah, yeah, they tend to do that, especially those fast ones. Look, we really need the car back or we're gonna get grounded. <laughs> okay, look, I gotta go in my trunk and get my notebook because I gotta write all these details down. Hey, Junior, we should totally steal the police car to go get the car that we stole back. We can't steal the police car, that's illegal! I know, Junior, but we have to do it or else we're going to get in trouble. We have to steal the police car to go get the car that we stole back before we get in trouble. Oh, you're right. If the cop can't find out we stole the other car, we're going to get in trouble for that. Exactly. So we got to go, Junior. We got to go. Okay, okay, I call shotgun. All right, go. Okay, just going to get my notebook. What? Karen, she left all her stuff back here. Oh, man, if the boss finds out that I've been using the undercover car for beach trips, I'm going to get in a lot of trouble. Wait, wait, what the? Why is the car starting? What? Hey, 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 get back here! Hey, hey, get back here, you kids! D dispatch, dispatch, my squad car's just been stolen! Oh, we stole a cop car! This is crazy! Okay, we have to use the stolen cop car to find the other car we stole so we can get it back so we don't get in trouble. Alright, let's do it! Okay, I'm gonna try to track the car with this, like, computer thing. Okay. It's gonna be like some cop stuff in here. Yeah. Oh, man, where's Jeffy with Goodman's car? Did you find your wallet yet, Marvin? Uh, no, no, I haven't found it yet. Yeah, I wouldn't think it'd be behind the blinds either. Yeah, no, it wasn't behind the blinds. Well, since I'm near a window, I might as well take a look at my car. Well, no, 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 you don't want to look at it. I, I, already, I already looked at it for you. It was really nice. It's a really hot car. Yeah, I know it is. I, I, I just love the color blue. I got it the same color as my balls. Yeah, blue balls. Because I still haven't gotten my house payment yet. Oh, whoa, 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 we're gonna find my wallet. Let's just get away from the window. You don't need to look at your car. Come on. Oh, man, Junior, I don't see him anywhere. Oh, oh, Junior, look! They're right there! Oh, junior? Oh, Junior, what's wrong? Oh, oh, man, you're getting away, Junior! I'm gonna chase you! Right, hold on, Junior! I'm gonna get our car back! Hey! Hey! Hey, you blow the car over right now! You give us our car back, you asshole! Wait, why aren't we moving? No, oh, ran out of gas. Hey, hey, you get out of the car right now! I'm not gonna chase you all over the damn town! But I was having fun. You get out of the car right now, because I'm not getting grounded over you! <laughs> Junior! Junior, we got the car back! <laughs> Junior? All right, Junior, you just sit right there, we're gonna get you home and get you a Happy Meal, and you'll be feeling good. All right, let's go. Oh man, the car won't start. Oh, oh, we're out of gas. The hobo done drained the tank. 
Hey, hey, you you think it's funny to steal a cop car? Huh? Do you punk? Well, I had to steal your cop car in order to get our car back. Well, I guess if you get your car back in the end, it was worth it. You know what they say, two wrongs do make a right. Yeah, but uh, we're out of gas right now, so could you give us some? Oh, I got your gas right here. <laughs> oh, it's a good one. Yeah, it's a man's fart. Well, I guess I can push your car. All right, well, you start pushing and I'll steer. Okay. Keep pushing! I'm doing it! Keep pushing! Oh, okay! <sighs> Almost! Oh, God! <sighs> <sighs> okay, kid, you're home. Thanks for giving me a push. Yeah, do you think you could give me a ride back to my car? I'm out of gas. Oh, yeah, right, of course. That's, that's the whole point of all this. Okay, I guess I'll just walk back to my car. Uh, let's check the couch again. No, Marvin, I'm tired of looking for your stupid wallet. I'm just gonna leave and come back in the morning. No, 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 please don't leave. Look, look, I think we can find my wallet. I think we're really close to finding it. I can just feel it. Marvin, Marvin, look, I found your wallet. Is my house payment in there? Let me open and look. Uh, looks empty to me, but it plays a cute song when it's open. How did you even find that wallet? I lied about it existing. You lied? Dang, dang, I'm back. What? And the package is secured. The pee is in the toilet, and the poop is in the sink. So you got the car back? Mm -hmm. Yes, I lied about the house payment. You know I don't have it. You lied to me and wasted my whole day? I didn't, you didn't even have your house payment? Oh, I'm so mad. I'm just going to be back in the morning. Yeah, I'll try to have it by tomorrow. Jimmy, you stole Goodman's car? Well, I got back, Daddy. But I think Junior has rabies. Oh, I can't wait to get out of here. That was the biggest waste of my time. Uh, why is my car not starting? Uh, out of gas? Ew! Poor! Hey, um, Daddy, can I go outside and try to eat my golf ball? No, Jeffy, it's raining outside. Jeffy, how many times do we have to tell you do not eat golf balls? Well, then why do they look so yummy? They don't! Well, they look like marshmallows. <laughs> Mario, why is it raining so badly? I don't know. Let's turn on the weather channel and see what happens. Breaking news, okay? A hurricane named Hurricane Sally is hitting us right now. It's a Category 2 storm, so stay inside. Oh, what's that? We have word now that reporter Goodman is on scene to tell us how bad it is. How bad is it, Goodman? It's bad. A hurricane? I didn't know a hurricane was hitting. Mario, we have to prepare. We need supplies. We need food, water, ice, flashlights, batteries, and gas. <sighs> There's your gas right there, Mommy. Rosalina, we don't have to prepare. Everything's going to be fine. It's just a little bit of rain and wind. But Mario, it's a category two. That ain't nothing. Um, Daddy, what's a hurricane? A hurricane's a big storm that just destroys everything. Well, I want to be a hurricane. You can't be a hurricane, Jeffy. Well, why does Sally get to be one? Sally's not a real person. It's just the name of the storm, Jeffy. Well, Daddy, when I grow up, I want to be the biggest hurricane ever. Well, you'll never be a hurricane, Jeffy. Well, Daddy, since you don't believe in me, I'm going to grow up and be the biggest, baddest hurricane ever. And then you're going to see me on the news. So, he's so stupid. Mario, I'm really worried. There's nothing to worry about, baby. It's just a little bit of rain and wind. Everyone, look out for Hurricane Jeffy. I'm going to destroy everything in my past. Jeffy, why are you destroying the living room and hissing like a cat? Because I'm a hurricane, Junior. You're a hurricane? How'd you become one of those? Well, I was watching TV, and I saw this girl named Sally, and she became a hurricane. And now everyone's afraid of her. But she's a total two, but she blows like a ten, Junior. And she's got a whole lot of wop. What's wop? Wind and precipitation. Oh, she sounds so hot. Well, if you want to meet her, she's right outside. She's outside, like right now? Yeah. I'm so nervous. I'm not ready to meet her. Oh, I need some advice from Chef Pee Pee. All right. Oh man, that won't fit. I bought the wrong size. 
Well, it's not the first time I bought the wrong size for something that's not gonna fit. <laughs> hey, Chef PP, can I ask you for some dating advice? No, Junior, not right now. I'm trying to make some food just in case the power goes out. Stupid Hurricane Sally. Sally? You know about her too? Yes, Junior. Everybody knows about her. She's dangerous. She's dangerous? Yes. But is she bad, though? Yes, she's bad, and she's huge! Oh, she's a big girl. That's why everyone's saying she's a two. No, she's a category two, but she's nothing to play with. Well, what if I think I can handle her? Junior, you can't handle her! She'll blow you away! Oh, how bad is she? What, Junior, Junior, hurricanes are nothing to play with. They could take your car, your house, maybe even your life. Well, what's she look like? What? what? Junior, what are you talking about? I think I'm thinking with the wrong head check. I'm going to go outside and see her. Junior, don't go outside! What's wrong with you? Uh, Sally? Um, I really like you, and I heard you're bad, and I don't care if you're a 2, I think you're a 10, and I think big girls need love too, so I'd like to be your boyfriend, Sally, you, you can give me your answer later. Uh, Chef Pee, Pee I didn't see Sally. What do you mean you didn't see her? She's huge! Hey, Chef Pee, Pee you stop talking about my girlfriend like that! What? Yeah, I know you think she's a two, but she's a ten to me. And just because she's fat, I love big girls. I think they need love. But Junior, it's a hurricane! <laughs> what? <laughs> what are you doing, Chef I'm a hurricane! Oh my god, Mario! Mario, the storm sounds like it's getting worse! It's just wind and rain, it's not getting worse. Mario! What's wrong, Chef PB? Chef, he's destroying the entire house! He is! Jeffy! <laughs> Jeffy, what are you doing? I told you I'd be a hurricane daddy! Jeffy, you're gonna clear up this mess right now! You can't stop a hurricane daddy! <laughs> oh, daddy. What's wrong, Mario? Go ahead, tell her. Jeffy thinks he's a hurricane and he's destroying the entire house. I'm sure he's not destroying the entire house, Mario. Just my kitchen. Yeah, in the living room. He's making a huge mess. Mario, we'll clean it up later. He's letting his imagination wander. Well, he needs to stop wandering around my kitchen and making a mess. <laughs> oh, no, the power went out. That was so annoying, I think I want to date men now. Oh, okay, look, we knew this was going to happen. Uh, hurricanes make the power go out, so look, we, we knew this was going to happen. So what's the first thing we got to do? Oh, Mario, do we have to reproduce now? Because she's the only girl here. Oh, that's why I'm scared of the dark, Mario. Oh, okay, look, 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 look. Okay, we need to look for flashlights. Does anybody know where a flashlight is? Oh, I have a flashlight on my phone. Okay, grab that. See? Oh, God, what? I'm blind. Oh, yeah, put it that way. Yeah. Okay, look, we need to go find Jeffy first. So I mean, it shouldn't be hard to find. He's going around saying, <laughs> well, well, let's go look for him. Uh, Rosalina, can you shine your flashlight down the stairs so I can see? Sure, Mario. Okay, thank you. But what if he's upstairs? <gasps> I didn't think about that. Where's the light? <laughs> Sorry, Mario. Uh, you, you good, Mario? Uh, I think I broke my back. Mario, do you see Jeffy anywhere? He's throwing chairs in the dining room. Jeffy, stop doing that! They have to. Come on. Uh, Jeffy, where are you? Uh, Chef PP, why are the lights off? Because of Sally, Junior. She turned the lights off? Yes. Probably because you guys keep calling her fat, so she feels ugly, so she turns the lights off so we can't see her. What? Junior, no, you have it confused. Sally is not a person, it's a hurricane. Yeah, you guys keep saying she's nasty and stuff. Well, maybe her neck game's like a giraffe, you know? Big girl's hungry. But Junior, Junior, if you want to see Sally, I will show you Sally. Come here. Well, right now? I'm really nervous. Are you, should, should I see her right now? Yes, I will show you Sally. Come here. See, Junior, that's Sally. She's dangerous. Wait, why are the street lights on? Hello? What? Wait, who are you? Oh, my name's Sally. I got lost and it's raining. Can I go inside? Uh, uh, Chef Baby, she's not fat. What, what, this is not Sally I was talking about, Junior. I'm sorry, Sally. Everyone's been calling you a two. <gasps> it's category two. It's a real storm. Look, look, I don't have time to deal with this. Look, 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 I don't think you're a two. I've been thinking you're a ten this whole time, and I didn't even see you. And you don't have to turn the lights off. I don't think you're ugly. Aww. So you can come to my room. Okay. Turn the lights back on. All right, so this is my bed. See, I got Thomas sheets. Maybe I can call my friend over later and we can run a Thomas on you. Oh, I like trains. You're so pretty. I don't know why everyone says so much bad stuff about you. <gasps> they do? Yeah, you're all over the news. I am? Yeah, they keep saying you're a two and <gasps> that you're fat and dangerous. And apparently you play the trombone because your mouth getting crazy. You blow really good. Oh, that's not nice. Yeah, so 
I don't know. I don't care what they say. All I care about is that you're with me now, and I'm always going to treat you great. Um, do you have a phone so I can call my parents? You want me to meet your parents? Yeah, I'll get my phone. Okay. Hello? Mom? Dad? I was at the park and it started raining and I found a house and they let me in and some kid told me the news is saying I'm fat in the number two. Oh, you're gonna come get me? Okay, see you soon. Oh, what'd they say about me? Oh man, I don't wanna embarrass you. You think, you think your parents are gonna like me? Oh, I, should, I need to impress them. I, I need to brush my teeth. I need to put on deodorant. Oh, I'm so nervous. Why are you so nervous? I, I've never met a hurricane's parents. Oh, are they mean? Are they nice? Oh, no, I don't know. Jeffy, where are you at? <laughs> Oh, he's in the pantry. Mario, the street light's on. But the street lights are on? Yes. That doesn't make any sense. Why don't we have power? I don't know. Let me go and check the circuit breaker. Oh, Jeffy, stop it. <laughs> Jeffy, stop it. You are not a hurricane. Babu, bab, bab, babu. What? Mario, maybe if you tell him he is a hurricane, he'll stop. That doesn't make any sense. It's not going to work. Day, I'm hungry for destruction. <laughs> Actually, you know what? You are a hurricane. You're the biggest, strongest, meanest, most dangerous hurricane of them all. I want you to keep doing it because that makes me proud. Well, now I don't want to do it anymore. That's lame. It actually worked. Oh, somebody messed with it. Mario, we have power. What? The power's back on. How did that happen? <sighs> Jeffy must have turned him off when he thought he was a hurricane. Oh. You know, before your parents pick us up, I was thinking, maybe we should porky pig. Um, I'm Jewish. I don't eat pork. Well, I'm a whole lot of turtle. Mmm. Ah! What's wrong? Ew! Oh! Ew! You, you look better with the lights off. I thought you were fat. What? Ew! I, I don't want someone who's pretty. I'm a chubby chaser. I thought there was cushion for the pushing. Ew! What? You're a total two with the lights on. With the lights off, you're a ten. Oh, oh. Get out of my house. Aww. All right, we survived the Jeffy hurricane. And you're lucky, Daddy, because I was going to keep going. But now we have to survive the real hurricane that's happening outside. At least we still have power, Mario. At <laughs> least we have power, Mario. That's what you sound like. Oh. Sit down. All right, so now let's just sit here and we have power, we have food. Everything's back to normal. Hey, Daddy, you know how I wanted to be a hurricane? Well, I don't want to be a hurricane anymore. I want to be an earthquake. Jeffy, stop! All right, Simmons, I'm going to show you where we keep the baddest of the bad inmates. Solitary confinement. There's no food, there's no electricity, there's no hope. Well, what do they eat if they don't have food, sir? They eat cockroaches and rats and whatever else they can find on the ground. Okay, so this is our first inmate, Bubbles. What's up, beautiful? Back away from the bars. Oh, wait, you afraid to get kissed, huh? Don't kiss him, Simmons. I didn't plan on it, sir. One kiss from him and you'll fall in love. Yeah, welcome to my love chamber. Come on in. Come on, Simmons, let's go. Wait, wait, come on, kiss me. Kiss me. Come on, come on. All right, Simmons, follow me this way. Oh, no, hurry up, hurry up. All right, Simmons, this next inmate is the worst of the worst. Her name is Nancy. Can I see what she looks like? Oh, of course you can. She's a caged animal. Hey, Nancy, get out here, you old bag. N Nancy? She's coming. N Nancy? N Nancy, D don't make me come in there and pull you out. You're making me look bad. <laughs> Nancy, you old kook. Just one second, Simmons. Nancy, you're pissing me off. Let me come and grab you. Nancy? Nancy, you better be dead in here because you didn't answer me. What? Oh my god! Oh no, she escaped! Simmons! Simmons, sound the alarms! Nancy escaped! We got a cold red! Lock down the prison! Go, go, go! <laughs> Today's gonna be a good day.
let's see what we got here. She's perfect. Uh, let's go get some kids. Now, where are those kids at? Hmm. Maybe some musical help. Oh, kids! Where are you, kids? I got some free candy for you, kids! Ugh, I did it. I finally escaped. And on Jeffy's 18th birthday. Now all I gotta do is kidnap him and get my millions of dollars. Now, where the hell am I? Ugh. Oh, God. I'm so glad to finally be out of that prison. Oh, oh shit, it's the cops! Well, wait a minute, that's not the cops. Maybe, maybe he'll give me a ride. Woo-hoo! Oh, you-hoo! You-hoo, big boy, can you give me a ride? I don't think he's stopping. Stop! Hey there, baby. You really shouldn't stand in the road. I almost hit you. Can you give me a ride, big boy? No, I only take kids. Oh, really? Well, there's a kid I need you to help me take. Sorry, I work alone. I'll give you $50,000. <laughs> That'll buy me a lot of candy. Get in. Chief, Chief, Chief! Don't worry, guy, I didn't forget today's your birthday. <gasps> Chief, you remembered my birthday! Happy birthday, guy. I didn't know it was your birthday, mate. Yes, Simmons, today's my birthday. At least somebody remembered. Well, happy birthday! That's too late now. So what were you gonna tell me, guy? Huh, I don't even remember, I'm just so happy now. The prisoner escaped! Oh yeah, the prisoner escaped. <gasps> Chief, the prisoner Nancy escaped from solitary confinement. We locked down the entire prison, but she still somehow got away. Damn it, guy, how could you allow this to happen? Sir, I don't know what happened. She dug her way through concrete. I don't know how, it was like some Shawshank Redemption shit. Damn it, guy, you better bring her back dead or alive or you're fired. Sir, you can't fire me, today's my birthday. Then I'll wait till tomorrow and then fire your ass. Well, you can't fire me, cause I quit. I'm just kidding. You know I need this job. Come on, Simmons, let's go find him. All right, Marvin, is this good enough? I think we need a few more balloons. A few more balloons? I bought all the balloons from the store. I just want to make sure that Jeffy's 18th birthday is special. <gasps> Marvin, this looks amazing. You did this just for Jeffy's birthday? You know me. I love Jeffy, and I want to make sure his 18th birthday is the most special birthday he's ever had. That's so sweet, Marvin. Jeffy's going to be so excited. Hey, Chef PB, can you go to the store and get 50 more balloons? 50 more balloons? I'll get your stupid balloons. Now leave me alone. I just want to make sure that Jeffy gives me money. I mean, I want to make sure that Jeffy knows I love him. Marvin, you're not doing this just because Jeffy's inheriting millions of dollars from his dead father, are you? Jeffy's inheriting millions of dollars from his dead father? It completely slipped my mind. Oh, really? I'm being serious, baby. You know I love Jeffy. I mean, it's his 18th birthday. Marvin, come on. Just let him enjoy his special day. Baby, it is our special day because he's turning 18 and he can move out of the house. Marvin, we're not kicking him out of the house on his birthday. It depends on how much money he gives us. Marvin! Oh, listen, let me go wake up Jeffy because it's his birthday and let me get his king crown. King crown? Hey. Hey. My snore in Russian. Jeffy, hey. wake up. It's your birthday. Really, Daddy? Yeah, Jeffy, you're 18 years old. <laughs> Yeah, that too. So how about you take off that bunny suit and come downstairs? Well, what if I don't want to take off my bunny suit? Then leave it on. You can keep it on all day. Really, Daddy? You never let me leave my bunny suit on all day. Well, it's your birthday, so you can do whatever you want. And look, for breakfast, I got you candy bars. <gasps> candy for breakfast? Daddy, you're being really nice to me today. Well, you know I love you, Jeffy. I wouldn't be doing it for any other reason. And look, since it's your birthday, is there anything else you want? Strippers. Wait, you want one? Yeah, with big yummy cans. Well, I'll call one up for your birthday party, which is downstairs. Whoa, I got a birthday party? Do I have chocolate and cake? Of course there's chocolate cake, buddy. <gasps> So how about you go downstairs? Wait, wait, wait a second. You're now king of the house. I totally forgot you're king of the house. King of the house? So, 
Here is your birthday crown. You can tell people what to do. Oh, well then I banish you to the dungeon. Well, don't banish me yet until you see how cool your birthday party is. Okay, let's go see it. Come on. All right, I'm gonna take off my bunny suit and put my birthday suit on. Well, don't get naked. How about you just take the bunny suit off? Come on. Here it is. Here's Jeffy's cake. All right, Jeffy. Here's your birthday party. <gasps> Daddy, look at all your balloons. Wait, uh, Chef Baby, where's the 50 extra balloons? They were sold out. I just got a cake. Wait, go get some more balloons. Please go find some. Drive a hundred miles to go get some. I'll find the balloons. Go get some. It's Jeffy Daisy's birthday party. I want it to be special. <gasps> Dang, this is the coolest birthday ever. It's a birthday fit for a king. Yes, Jeffy, and look at all your presents full of expensive items, and maybe one day you'll repay us like today. Murphy. Which one has the stripper in it? Uh, she's on the way. What? what? That's what Jeffy wanted for his birthday party. No, Marvin. Hey, Daddy, since I'm 18 now, can I throw this glass cup against the wall and shatter it? I mean, I'd rather you didn't, but if that's what you want to do on your birthday party, then go for it, buddy, but please don't. Hmm, I've suddenly grown out of childish behavior. Wait, really? No. Oh, uh, you know, that doesn't even make me mad because it's your birthday party, so just go, go crazy, Jeffy. <laughs> There's someone at the door. Stripper? Wait, no, not yet. I, I'm about, I'm, I'm, she, uh, it's your friends. Oh, my friends. Jeffy, your friends are here. Happy birthday, Jeffy. Yeah, happy birthday. Happy birthday, dude. This party's so crazy. Thanks, guys. Look, I'm a king. Oh, wow, that crown is so cool. And you're 18 years old. That means strippers. Bye. Yeah, you can also vote now. What? Well, he can. You can also buy an assault rifle. Gun laws are so crazy. I'm gonna hide when you turn 18. See that house right there? Yep. That's where the kid lives. What does he look like? He's got a blue helmet and a yellow shirt that says Jeffy on it. You can't miss him. It's his birthday, so he's probably got a party going on. All right. What I'll do is I'll just go up to the house and pretend I'm there for the birthday party. And when I see him, I'll grab him and bring him back to the van. Good thinkings. So, Jeffy, what are you going to do for your 18th birthday? I might eat cake, I might stick my wiener in an amp pile, the possibilities are endless! I'm really digging your LGBT birthday napkins, super homo. Yeah, super, dude. Thanks for giving us a shot. No problem, Cody. Jeffy, there's someone at the door. Stripper? Maybe. Hello? Hey, I'm here to see the birthday boy. We didn't hire a clown. Well, someone did. Who? Listen, man, I don't ask questions. I just do what I'm told. I'm here to eat cake, make snake balloons, and snort blow. Uh, I mean, a, a clown would make Jeffy's birthday party really cool. It sure would. So come on inside. Planned on it. Jeffy, there was a special guest at the door. Was he the stripper? No, it was a clown. No, wait a minute. I can strip too. Stop that. We don't need that. Oh, yes, we do. Keep going. Stop that. What? Just focus on making animal balloons. Oh, darn. I left my balloons out in my van. Which one of you kids wants to come out in my van with me and get the balloons? Ooh, I will. No, I really think the birthday boy should come with me. No, the birthday boy needs to stay here and open his gifts. No, I really think the birthday boy should come out to the van with me. No, get one of the other kids to do it. Listen, bub, I'm taking this kid with me whether you like it or not. No, you're not going to talk like that. I didn't even hire a clown, so you need to leave. Just get out of here. Come on. All rats. Go on. Get out of here. Uh, hey, 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 listen, 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 listen. What? I'm sorry. Get out of here. Oh, damn it. I gotta get that kid. What What happened? Where's Jeffy? He didn't want to come to the van. His dad said no. What, why would you tell him about the goddamn van? Nobody's willingly gonna get into a van that says free candy on it, goddammit. Listen, he's yelling at me, you're yelling at me, it's hurting my feelings. Well, what are we gonna do now? How are we gonna get Jeffy? No, hold on, I'm thinking of something. Well, think faster! Oh, you know what? I got it. Hold on, I'll be back with the kid. Jeffy, are you ready to hit your piñata? I have a piñata? Yeah, it's waiting for you outside, Jeffy. Oh, I'm about to whack that shit. A piñata? That's so crazy. All right, kids, everyone outside to hit the piñata. Yay! All right, Jeffy, hit your piñata and make all the candy come out. Shouldn't he be blindfolded? No, it's Jeffy's 18th birthday. We want to make sure he gets all the candy, so hit it, Jeffy. Stand back, everyone. Yeah, because I'm about to go ape shit on this horsey. Take this horsey! Ah! 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 Mr. Lollipop, get back here! 
I keep you crazy lollipop. Come here. All right, here's the kid. This man is so crazy. This lollipop hurts to eat. What? Who the hell is this? Where's Jeffy? I thought this was the kid. No, I said blue helmet, yellow shirt. Oh, I thought you said blue shirt, no helmet. What, what are you, knocking fucks? This is the wrong kid. It is? Yes, now we gotta kill him so he doesn't tell on us. Why would I tell on you? This van is cool. <sighs> okay, listen, kid. You get out of this van and you run and you don't stop running. Okay, I love running. Well what do we do now? Uh, okay, since you can't do it right, I have an idea. Now pull the van around in front of their house. All right. All right, kids. Did everyone get some candy? Yeah! All right, Jeffy. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to put candles on your cake and sing you happy birthday. Can you sing me happy birthday 18 times since it's my 18th birthday? Yeah, Marvin. You did say anything for Jeffy's birthday. Uh, I mean... 18's a lot of times. You sure you want 18? Yes. Uh, okay, yeah, yeah, we'll sing it 18 times. And can everyone dress up like me? But why would we dress up like you, Jeffy? Because it's my birthday and it would be fun if everyone dressed up like me. <sighs> All right, everyone. Go put on a yellow shirt and a blue helmet to look like Jeffy, I guess. Come on, baby, let's go dress up like Jeffy. This is the coolest birthday ever. Everyone loves me. I can't believe I'm doing this. I look ridiculous. Baby, hurry up. Aw, Marvin, it's just too big on me. Baby, it looks like a dress. Look, we have to dress up like Jeffy to make him happy on his birthday. You really want that money, huh? But baby, I already told you this isn't about the money. I would do this for anyone on their birthday. You would do it for me on my birthday? Well, I mean, listen, baby, it's not about the money. Breaking news, okay? World-renowned painter, Jacques-Pierre Francois, the famous painter we all presumed was dead. Turns out he's actually still alive. He faked his death to make his paintings more valuable. I have an exclusive interview with him now. All right, everyone. I'm here with the now alive world-renowned painter, Jacques-Pierre Francois. So tell us, Jacques, why would you fake your own death? Uh, you see, paintings are worth more when the artist is dead, and I was drowning and gambling debts. So I fake my own death, and now my paintings are worth millions. Extraordinary. But how did you fake your death? You jumped off the bridge and we saw the splattered remains on the canvas. Now oh, that was quite simple. All I had to do is push a pig off the bridge, and when it splattered on the canvas, the body was unrecognizable. And I bought that painting for $200 million, and now that you're not dead, that painting's not worth That is, as you Americans say, too bad, so sad. I'm gonna slap that stupid little pipe cleaner mustache clean off your stupid face. Don't hate me, because you ain't me. Well, what about your son? He was supposed to inherit your multi-million dollar fortune. Ah, uh, yes, the boy. Listen, son, if you are watching this, look into the camera. Look at your papa. Fuck off. Well, you heard it here first, folks. I'm out $200 million. I will now celebrate my millions by eating one of your American hamburgers from the McDonald King. Oh, wow, Marvin. Good thing it wasn't about the money. Otherwise, you'd be really upset right now, huh? He's not getting any of the money! I'm taking a Jeffy off and I'm going to throw the cake away and pop it out of the balloon! But you said it wasn't about the money! Of course it was about the money! You think I would take care of it for years for free? Marvin, we love Jeffy! I don't, you might, but I don't. I definitely don't. He's got so much hell in my life. He's broke stuff. I want him gone. Jeffy would be really upset right now if he heard the awful things you were saying. I'm very upset for the things I heard on the news. I thought we were going to get money, baby. I thought we were going to be paid. That wasn't even your money. That was Jeffy's money. I thought he was going to give us some. I thought he was going to be like, hey, hey, Marvin, uh, sorry for screwing your life over the last few years. Here's a, here's a quick milli. Here's quick milli cash. You honestly think Jeffy was going to share? Yes, I thought he gave a shit. I, I am so mad. I'm going to go throw his cake away. I'm taking that damn king crown off his head. I'm only singing him happy birthday once. Marvin, you're going to sing happy birthday to him 18 times on his birthday. Let's go. No, the only 18 thing that's happening is how old he's turning because he's out of the house. No. Oh, Marvin, you don't mean that. We're kicking him out of the house. You think I'm going to deal with him for free? He's not going to live with us till he's 30 or 40. I'll kill myself. Listen, I am going to go tell Jeffy that he is gone when he leaves his house. Uh, we, we can see him happy birthday once, but I'm taking that crown. We're gone. Stop right here. Stop right here. All right, what's the plan? Okay, we're going to roll the windows down, and then you're going to play some silly music so the kids think you're an ice cream truck. And then when the kids come out to get their free candy, you're going to grab Jeffy, and I'm going to jump in the driver's seat and speed off. That's a good idea. I wish I would have thought about that. All right, roll your window down. Free candy, kids! Okay, Jeffy, we're dressed up just like you. Yeah, even Ken. Oh, that's sick. It's like I'm Gru, and you guys are my minions. We got to get the girl another unicorn toy. You guys hear that? It sounds like an ice cream truck. Ooh, ice cream? I want ice cream. Mother effing ice cream truck! This birthday is the tits. Let's go! 
Guys, I can't believe it. A free candy van. What a dream come true. I hope they have Starburst. Oh, they better have Snickers, dude. I want M&M's. Guys, doesn't this seem a little suspicious? How? Well, it's a white van with free candy spray painted on it. That's like typical kidnapper stuff. Cody, nobody kidnaps people anymore. That's illegal. Yeah, there's cameras everywhere, dude. Yeah, nobody's gonna go to jail for kidnapping. Uh, okay, okay, yeah. I guess you guys are right. This isn't sketchy at all. Cody, let's just go get our free candy and shut up. Up oh, here they come! All the kids are coming! Good! Now you tell the kids they have to go to the back to get the candy, and then you grab Jeffy and I'll speed off! Alright, got it. Alright, Jeffy, let's hurry up and sing happy birthday, and then you're getting the hell out of the house! Where Jeffy? Where's Jeffy? Where's all the kids at? Uh, Marvin, I couldn't find any more balloons at the store. Don't yell at me! I don't care. We don't need any more balloons. Wait, seriously? Well, you wanted balloons earlier. I don't care about this party. I don't care about these balloons. We don't need anything. Thank God. Do you know where the kids are at, Chef PB? Uh, I think they're outside at the ice cream truck, getting ice cream. Ice cream truck? Yeah, you don't hear it? What? Ugh. We want candy! Yeah, do you have Skittles? Oh, do you have three musketeers? Yeah, 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 I have all the musketeers and mousketools. So just, if you want candy, meet me at the back of the van. Okay! Wait, 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 guys, this is getting worse. How? He wants us to meet him at the back of the van. Yeah, that's where he stores all his candy. You see how big this van is? Oh, dude, just shut up! Oh, okay, but if somebody gets kidnapped, don't come crying to me about it. Come on! Candy! 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 Who wants candy? We do! Oh, please look for the sneakers first! All right, let me see if I got it. No, no Snickers. Aw, oh, man. What other candy would you kids want? Uh, do you have Starburst? What, what, what the? Hey, hey, what are you doing here? Just go away, Jeffy. Nope, no Starburst. Aw. You have circus peanuts? Let me check. Hurry up and grab them, damn it. All right. They all look the same, though. What are you kids doing, oh, Jeffy? All you kids go inside right now. Hey, I got what are you doing? Let go of me. Ah, I don't want to get the bird. I got it. There, all the candles are lit. I can't believe we didn't get any ice cream. Or candy. I don't even think they had candy. Jeffy, are you ready to blow out your birthday candles? Yeah. Are you guys gonna sing happy birthday to me 18 times? Of course, Jeffy, but wait, where's Marvin? Oh, he was outside and he yelled at us to come inside and said we couldn't have any candy. Oh yeah, he's in a bad mood, Jeffy. But he's been in a good mood all day. I know, but I think he has a headache or something. Are you ready to sing happy birthday to Jeffy? Yeah. yeah. All right, ready? Go. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Jeffy. Happy birthday to you. Again, again. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. All right, Jeffy, blow out the candles. So, Jeffy, did you like your birthday today? Well, you guys had me in the first half, not gonna lie. But the second half blew major donkey balls. What was wrong with the second half? Well, for starters, all the presents downstairs were just empty boxes wrapped with wrapping paper, and Daddy ran away. Well, you know, Jeffy, I think your dad's going through a midlife crisis today. Today? Of all days? Maybe he's at the store getting you real presents since your gift bags were empty. We can only hope. Well, do you want to watch some TV, Jeffy? Ooh, well, since I'm 18 now, can we watch naughty shows? I'm talking full frontal. No, Jeffy, let's watch the news. Oh! Uh Breaking news, okay? A prisoner in a maximum security prison has escaped. Please be on the lookout for this woman pictured here. Her name is Nancy. Real mommy is game from prison? Uh, Jeffy, let's watch something else. Nudity? No, Jeffy. Mommy, what if real mommy comes and tries to kidnap me? We wouldn't let that happen. You promise? I promise. Okay, good. Um, now where's Marvin? I'm gonna give him a call. Nipple time! Jeffy, change the channel. Mommy, look at these rocking cans. Jeffy, change the channel now. See Bobby, hi, 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 hi. Jeffy, stop it! Oh, he didn't answer. Well, he's missing a good show. Jeffy, I'm changing the channel. No! <sighs> 
Okay, let me see Jeffy. He's right here. He is mommy. Wait a minute. Uh, uh, what are you guys doing? Let me go. This isn't Jeffy. Sure it is. See the blue helmet and the yellow shirt? No, no, no. This isn't Jeffy. This is somebody else with a blue helmet and yellow shirt. Uh, listen, this is too hard. Can we try something easier? Wait, wait. You're Jeffy's mom. Wait a minute. You're the bozo who put me in jail. Well, no, no. You put yourself in jail, but I had nothing to do with it. Okay, look. I don't want you. I wanted Jeffy so I could take his millions of dollars that I rightly deserve. Well, good luck getting that money because his dad's not dead. He's actually alive and he's not giving Jeffy any of the money. <laughs> nice try. You really expect me to believe that? Wait, it's on the news. Just turn it on. Yeah, right. You'll say anything to get me to let you go. No, I have a better idea for you. I'm gonna hold you hostage until Jeffy gives me that money. He doesn't have the money. Well, if he doesn't give me the money, you're dead. <laughs> hey, can I use your phone? Sure. I gotta call his family. All right, what's Jeffy's number? Jeffy's number? Why do you need his number? Because I'm gonna call Jeffy and you're gonna tell him you're kidnapped and that you're gonna die if he doesn't give me that money. He's not gonna believe me. Well, we're gonna try anyway. Oh, okay, his, his number is... Yeah. I'm changing yeah. the channel, yeah. Jeffy! No, you're not! I've waited 18 years to watch shows like this! You're not gonna take this from me! You can wait a little longer! Wait, wait, wait! My phone's ringing! Maybe it's Marvin! No, it's not my phone. Yeah, it's my phone. Yo, you have reached the plug. Please, Shibby. Shibby. Go on, talk. Uh, Jeffy, it's, it's me. Say Shibby. What? Say Shibby. Uh, Shibby. Wait, what was that? Was it some kind of code? No, he told me to do that before I talked. I... Just say what I told you, damn it. Uh, uh, hey, Jeffy, it's, it's me, Marvin. Uh, I was kidnapped. Sorry, wrong number. What? Who was that, Jeffy? It was some salesman trying to sell me a car's extended warranty. But you don't have a car. Exactly why I hung up on him. Aw, you're so smart, Jeffy. I know. What'd he say? Uh, he thought it was a wrong number. Oh, damn it, make him believe you or I'll shoot you in the head. Oh, yeah, call my wife, call my wife. Okay. Hi, 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 Jeffy, hi, hold hi, on, my hi. phone's ringing. It's a blocked number, hello? Talking no funny business. Uh, hey, baby. Marvin, where are you? You? Why are you calling from a block number? Oh, it's a long story, so I got. Oh my god, are you calling from a side chick's phone? What side chick would I have? Listen, baby, look, I'm kidnapped, and they want millions of dollars, so can you. Marvin, me? is this your sick way of trying to make money because Jeffy's dad really isn't dead? Wait, he's not? But, baby, no, I'm not trying to make money. I, I can't believe you abandoned Jeffy on his birthday. You're a deadbeat dad. But no, I'm kidnapped. I didn't I guess just come home whenever you feel like no, it. Hang up. Okay, what'd she say? Uh, she thinks I'm a deadbeat dad and I left Jeffy on his birthday. Oh, God damn it! that's it, I'm killing him, get my gun. Oh, no, 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 don't, don't get the gun, oh, okay, how about one of you call him, because you guys have scary voices, so who has the scarier voice? She does. Okay. Mommy, is my real dad really alive? Yes, he is, Jeffy. Well, I want to meet him. No, I don't think you do, just don't watch the news. No, I want to meet him, because I bet real daddy wouldn't leave me in my own birthday party. I don't know about that, Jeffy. Wait, my phone's ringing, I bet it's Marvin. What do you want, Marvin? If you ever want to see Marvin again, you'll give me five million dollars. Wait, this isn't Marvin. No, it's not. And if you ever want to see Marvin again, give me five million dollars. What's going on? Okay, I kidnapped Marvin, and if you want to see him again, you will give me five million dollars. But I don't have five million dollars. Well, then I guess you're not going to see Marvin again. What, should I kill him now? No, don't do that. Um, I'll just call you back in five minutes. What? Okay. Wait, but uh, you called from a block number, so I don't have your number. Oh, yeah. Hold on. Uh, what, what is your number? Mine? No, the guy who's tied up. What's his number? What? No, I was being sarcastic. Yes, your number. Well, then you should have said something. You should have said, hey, Screwball, what's your phone number? Hey, Screwball. What? What is your phone number? 555-555-5556. It's... It's all fives with the six at the end. You can't screw it up. Okay, I'll, I'll call back in five minutes, okay? Jimmy, your dad's been kidnapped! Which one? Uh, Marvin! Oh, well, good. He deserved it. He left me at my own birthday party. Oh, I'm gonna call the cops. What'd they say? They're gonna call me back. But if they don't call me back in five minutes, I'm killing you. Uh oh, they're gonna call back. Hey there, somebody called the cops? And I brought backup, because in case you haven't heard, there's a goon on the loose. And she's a real rascal, that goon. So have you seen any goons? What about you, kid? You look like you've seen a goon or two. That goon kidnapped my husband. It's the woman that escaped from prison that was on the news. I'm sorry, what? The woman on the See, see, I just distinctly didn't hear you say happy birthday to the birthday boy. Oh, is it your birthday today? Nobody loves me. I'm so sorry. It's just, it's my son's birthday today, so. Oh, yeah. God, I hate people who have the same birthday as me. I wish they'd all die. Can we focus?
is here, please. This woman kidnapped my husband. She's asking for $5 million or she's going to kill him. Wait, you were contacted by the woman who escaped from prison? You hear that, Simmons? We have a lead. We have a lead? We have a lead. So where is she? I don't know. She called from a blocked phone number. A blocked phone number. We lost the lead. We lost the lead. We lost the lead. But she did give me her phone number. She gave you a phone number? She gave you a phone number? She gave you her phone number. Okay, great. So we can just call her. So we can just call her. So we no, no, can... Simmons, Simmons, stop. Stop singing. It's starting to piss me off. Okay, so we can just call her and hear her demands. Yes, but I already told you her demands. She wants $5 million or she's going to kill Marvin. Hey, listen. You've never met a negotiator like me. I can get that price way down. You should have seen me get my Hyundai Sonata. I got them to take five grand off the sticker. Oh, man, it was great. Hey, you, you want to ride in my Hyundai Sonata? No, please. Can we just focus and no, call this woman? No, come on. You got to take a ride in my Sonata. Come on. There she is. That's my baby. It's very nice. Now, can we it please... It is very nice. I insist you take a ride in her. No, that's not necessary. Can we please oh, go call... Oh, it's very necessary. When you feel the seats are going to be in heaven. I'll take your word for it. Please, oh, let's go call. Oh, you don't have to take my word for it. Come on. Let's take a ride. Ugh. Oh, man, I love being in this car. It's way more comfy than the cop car, which I have to go get in soon. Yes, this car's very impressive. Now, please this go back. This car has so many features. Like, check this out. You're going to love this. You know what that is? That's a blind spot camera. So if some little brat tries running up on me while I'm turning, I can see him. It's very convenient. Can we go back inside yeah, and, and I got call? all of these features for a steal at the Hyundai Sunday sales event. I'm so happy for you. Can we please go call Jeffy's? I Jeffy? think we should take a quick little ride around the neighborhood. No! Yeah, come on, come on, you'll love it. Ugh. Oh, man, how lucky are you? You got to ride in my Sonata. Not a lot of people get to do that. Not even my daughter, you know, because she eats crackers and the crumbs get between the seats. Oh, big mess. Can we please? Huge mess. Can we please? And then you got to get in there with a vacuum, and that takes forever, and it's Can loud. we please? And then you got to pay the vacuum with quarters, and that just sucks. Can we please call the woman now? Oh, yeah, we can call her. Just hold on. <sighs> it's ringing. Hello? Hey there, ma'am. I just wanted to let you know that this is the police and you're going to jail, bitch. <laughs> Say hi, Simmons. Hi, Simmons. No, Simmons, you're supposed to... Just call her a bitch. Bitch! You hear that? That's my buddy Simmons, and he's gonna kick your ass. I sure am! Yeah, he'll hit a woman. He doesn't care. I don't care! He doesn't care. Oh, no, you're not, because I got a hostage. Oh, man, I hate when they have hostages. What do you want? I want $5 million. You're gonna meet me in the field. Y you know the one. Oh, yeah, of course I know the field. It's the field. It's the one field. You're gonna meet me in the field in an hour with $5 million and Jeffy, because I want to say hi to him. Uh, okay, okay, but, but hear me out. How about $3 million? No, it's $5 million or I kill this guy right now. Oh, damn, you're not playing, so I don't get the Hyundai Sunday sales event price? No. Uh, okay. Simmons, when we get there, we're going to shoot her in the face. And no weapons. Oh, come on. That's not fair. So do we have a deal? <sighs> okay. Stupid. I didn't get anything out of that phone call. I'm sorry, mate. What did she say? She wants us to meet her in the field in an hour with $5 million and Jeffy. But we don't have $5 million. Yeah, I know. So when she gets there, you and I are just going to tackle her. I mean, it's two against one, and she's had no weapons, so I think we can take her. Yeah. Come on, Jeffy. Let's go see her. So what's happening? We're going to meet the cops and Jeffy in an hour to trade you for the money. Yes, screwball. Why would we meet with the cops? Wouldn't they just shoot us? No, because I told them no weapons. Oh, that's smart. But guess who's gonna bring their gun? Who? Me. Well, that's not fair. Shouldn't you tell them so it's fair? No, I don't care if it's fair. Come on, we're going. Okay. Okay, Simmons. I'm assuming they're in the van that says free candy on it. Oh, mate, you think we can get some free candy? I don't think they have any free candy, Simmons. Well, why would they put it on the van if it's not true? I'm gonna take a wild guess and say it's so they can kidnap people. But that's illegal! I know, and that's why we're gonna arrest them. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get out of the van and we're gonna play good cop. We're gonna be like, hey, we got your money, and then bam, we whoop her ass. And then we save Marvin, we get the key to the city, and the chief is gonna give us promotions. Sounds good, mate. All right, Jeffy, you stay here. All right, bitch. We're here. Ow, God damn it! Ow. Right, no, Simmons, I'm not alright. I closed the door in my hand. You Ow. Need to go to the hospital? No, we're doing this. Hold on. <laughs> okay, look, we brought your money and we didn't bring any weapons. <laughs> well, I did bring a weapon, so show me the money or I'm gonna blow his head off. That's not fair. That's not fair. That's, That's not, not fair. fair. We said no weapons. We were gonna beat your ass. <laughs> you really thought I was stupid enough not to bring a gun? Now show me the money or I'm gonna shoot him and all of you. 
<laughs> well, you see, it's actually kind of a funny story because we didn't bring the money because me and Simmons thought we could beat you up. All right, that's it. I'm killing him. Oh, no, no, no. No, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. Don't, don't shoot him. We, we have Jeffy in the back of the car. You wanted him, right? Okay. Hand over Jeffy. Uh, Jeffy, could you come out of the car? Hey, Mommy. Jeffy, run! Hey, Jeffy. Mommy missed you. Now come to Mommy. Go! <laughs> hey, at least we saved Marvin, right? Go on, Jeffy. Oh. Well, you're not gonna let her take Jeffy, are you? We don't have any weapons, bro. I don't know what you want us to do. Hey, Jeffy. Happy birthday. <laughs> okay, since you didn't bring my money, I'm taking Jeffy with me. And whenever you want to stop playing games, maybe we can make another deal. Come on. Oh, Daddy, help me! She took him. She really just took him. I mean, hey, at least you don't have to deal with him anymore. Well, I know, but like, I don't want anything bad to happen to him. Why? What do you care? You were always complaining about him anyway. Well, I know, I just, I still care about him. Yeah, I mean, look on the bright side. At least it's a nice day for it. You know, it's not too hot, not too cold. You know, if my kid were to get kidnapped, I'd want it to be in weather like this. True. What are you guys gotta do something about chase the van? We can't do anything, man. We don't have any weapons, and she has a handgun. She could shoot all of us. Wait, mate, don't we have a sniper rifle in the trunk of the car? Oh, yeah, we do have a sniper rifle in the trunk of the car. Okay, Simmons, I want you to camp out somewhere. Get up in one of these trees and shoot out her tires. On it. Okay, Marvin, me and you are gonna chase that van down. Come on. Let's go. Someone's gonna die today. All right, Marvin, you're about to see how I drove on my driver's test when I was 16. Poorly. I'm trying, man! driving like crazy. I guess I can add reckless driving to the list of charges. You know, I can make corny cop puns because we're in a police chase. Let's just focus on the road! Okay! <laughs> Jeffy, I'm sick of you. I never loved you. You were an accident. After I get my money, I'm gonna kill you and bury you in the deepest hole I can find, and then I'm gonna kill your other fan. Daddy, help me! Ram her! You should ram her! Okay, I'm gonna do a pit maneuver. Yeah, go! Wait, 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 what's going on? What's going on? Wait, what's going on? Oh, shit! What? I ran out of gas. Ran out of gas? Well, she's getting away! Can we get more gas? Hmm, I don't see any gas stations in this fucking field, do you? Well, no, but she's getting away! It's up to Simmons now. Simmons, I need you to shoot those tires out right now! I'm on it, mate! Oh, still you bastard. Uh, Simmons? You are only supposed to shoot the tires. Whoops. Jeffy's dead. Uh, uh, uh d d dispatch, we, we, we need we need an ambulance and a fire truck, just, just, just all of it. Get out here now. Marvin? Oh my god, Marvin, thank god you're okay and no one was hurt! Ooh, uh, Simmons, I think we should probably leave. Why? This is about to be really sad. Marvin, where's Jeffy? Uh, he's, uh... He's not coming back, baby. What do you mean he isn't coming back? Where is he? His, uh, his, his mom took him. No, she didn't. Marvin, we have to go back there. We have to go get him. Get the cops. No, he, he, he's dead, baby. He's dead? What are you talking about, Marvin? Listen, the mom took him in the van and the van exploded and Jeffy died in the explosion. Exploded? No, no, Marvin. Jeffy can't be gone. No, he just can't. He can't. He, go, go get Jeffy. He's dead, baby. He's dead. But, He's not Marvin. coming back! He's not coming back! Marvin, no! It can't be real! This, is, this isn't happening! It's his birthday today! Marvin, no! I know, I know! He died, baby! I know. I should have been nicer to him! I, I just can't believe this is happening! I know! I know! It's I, our baby boy! I know! I should have I should have been nicer to him! I shouldn't have... I shouldn't have been mean to him on his birthday! I'm no, sorry! If, if I had a chance, I'd say sorry! I, I, I wish he was here right now! No, Jeffy! <laughs> Oh man, Simmons, I feel bad. But you must feel way worse, because you fucking suck at shooting. This was entirely your fault. It was a moving target, mate! Gas cap? Tire. Big difference, Simmons. But they're both round. <sighs> okay, Simmons, let's just go. I just wish Jeffy was back. I know, baby. I miss Jeffy, too. <laughs> I wish I could just hear him do that annoying uh sound one more time. <laughs> 
Marvin, that was a really good impression. What? That wasn't me. I thought it was you. What? Don't be sad, Daddy. It's not like you had to walk 50 miles in the dark getting eaten by mosquitoes on your birthday. Well, Jeffy, you're alive. Oh, my God. Yeah, I jumped down the back of the van before it exploded. What? what? Yeah, this is what happened. Uh, hey, we're almost out of gas. Then find the gas station. Uh, oh, Jeffy, uh, Jeffy, no, Jeffy, uh, Jeffy. Uh, Die, bitch. So that's what happened. Thank God you're home, Jeffy. Yeah, we love you so much, Jeffy. <laughs> well, it's not like every day you kill your mom on your birthday. Well, Jeffy, listen, I know you're 18, but you don't have to move out of the house. You can stay here as long as you want because I can't imagine life without you because I've gotten so used to you. I know I know, I was mad to you today on your birthday, but that was just because I thought we were getting money, but I don't care about the money. I, I just want you, Jeffy. I love you so much. Aww. Well, love you too, Mommy and Daddy, but I didn't plan on going anywhere. <laughs> Who's at the door? Hold on. Hello? Hey. What, what are you doing here? I just wanted to say, I'm sorry. Well, I thought you died. You were driving the van. No, I heard a gunshot and I got scared and jumped out. Uh, hey, we're almost out of gas. Then find the gas station. Uh, oh, Jeffy, Jeffy, uh, no. Jeffy, Jeffy. Uh, gunshots, I'm out of here. So, do you accept my apology? Well, get out of here. I don't want to see you ever again. I'll call the cops right now. Who was at the door, Marvin? It was one of the kidnappers. What? I already called the cops. Hey there, you call me? Oh, hey, you're not dead. How the hell did that happen? Oh, listen, listen, one of the kidnappers at the door, he survived. Oh, hey, that means nobody died today. Well, actually, I shot my mom in the face before the van exploded. Oh, okay. Well, with the explosion, there's no trace of the body. So that means no paperwork from me. And that's the best birthday present I could ask for. This video is about me. It should have been called Brooklyn Guy's 45th birthday. No balls, name it that. Ding, 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 ding! Congratulations, Daddy! You're now on the Jeffy Game Show! And if you answer this one question correctly, then you have to buy me the new PlayStation 5 and the new Xbox Series X. I don't want to play. Well, too bad, Daddy. The first question is, what color is my helmet? Red. No, you just changed your helmet. Nah, nah. Mario, you said he had a red helmet on. Now he's wearing a red helmet. Well, no, it was blue and he just changed. It doesn't count. Well, Danny, I don't make the rules. I just follow them. Well, I'm not buying you the new PlayStation or the new Xbox. Just wait till Christmas. Christmas? That's like next month. I don't even know if I'll be alive by then. You'll be alive next month. I know. Mario, that's true. The sun could explode tomorrow. Yeah, and if the sun explodes, then I don't know what it's like to have a PlayStation 5 or a brand new Xbox. Box. Well, no one will know because if the sun explodes, we'll all be dead, so no one will care. Look, Jeffy, look, Christmas is next month, and you have to be good because Santa Claus is watching. Oh, Santa Claus is watching? Well, what about this, Santa Claus? I got a big diaper full of shit. Jeffy, Jeffy, that's it, you're grounded. Grounded? What did I do? Mario, how about we make him a good boy chart? What's a good boy chart? Here, look. Every time Jeffy does something good, we put a gold star on the chart, and when he has 25 gold stars, he gets a prize! G good idea, baby! He'll never do 25 good things, so he'll never get a prize! Mario, that's not the point! <laughs> Jeffy, look! Uh, we got you a good boy chart! Good boy chart? Yeah, good boy chart! If you do 25 good things, I'll buy you one of the new systems! 25 good things? I might as well just wait till Christmas! Then wait till Christmas. Well, no, Daddy! Tell me what the 25 good things are! Okay, you, you have to do good things, like you can't be annoying, you can't poop your pants, ooh, and uh, you can't break stuff. Well, I haven't broken anything all day, so... Gold star. Oh, I'll go get the gold stars! What, no! All right, Jeffy, there's your first gold star. I got a star? Daddy, that is the tits. And you lost your gold star. I lost it? What did I do? You said a bad word. That's a bad word? Most people would say that's a good word. Jeffy, look, you can't say bad things. You can't do bad things. You can only do good things to get gold stars. Well, Daddy, my butt's mad at you. So you better gotta listen to what he's gotta say. <laughs> Jeffy, that is disgusting. Look, you can only do good things, so start doing good things. Okay, well, what good things do you want me to do then, Daddy? One, take the microphone out of your pants. Okay, next, go clean the entire kitchen, and you'll get a gold star. All right. Well, this might actually be a good thing if he starts doing good stuff. Yo, 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 Mario, what's up, folks? What's up, Black Yoshi? Yeah, man, I know you see that new PlayStation 5, you know the PS6 one? Yeah, I saw it. And the new Xbox. Yeah. Well, my pockets run a little thin this month, so I was wondering if you'd be done slide me that Thowie so I can get the consoles. I don't have a Thowie. Owie! Look, Black Yoshi, I'm not going to buy you any of the systems because I have to buy Jeffy one if he finishes his good boy chart. Good boy charts? <laughs> what's that about, folks? 
Well, if Jeffy gets 25 gold stars, I told him I'd buy him one of the systems. Well, why don't I get some good boy chops? Because you just don't get one. Well, hold up, Owen. <laughs> <laughs> Mario, check this out right here. This is my own good boy chops. And instead of 25 stars, I got 50 stars on there. Like the American flag. <laughs> I play the leap to the good boy chops, to the United States, or give me both the console. Black Yoshi, what good things have you done? Uh, I be done checks the mail. What, uh, th that's why my mail was stolen. Oh, yeah, your grandma be sent you $5 for your birthday, but I already be done spimps it. Like, that's a federal offense. Mario, I don't care what type of filth it is. If it's a picket fence, a huckleberry fence, the Miami doll fence. Look, you're not getting any of the systems. I don't care if you have a good boy chart. <laughs> well, fine then, folks. You green. I'm just going to take my chart somewhere else. Maybe I'll take it to Walmart, and they can see how good I've been. And maybe they just give me the console free. <sighs> Oh man, I don't want to clean all these dishes. Hey Jeffy, what are you doing? I'm about to have to clean the kitchen so I can get a gold star. What happens if you get a gold star? Well, I get to get all the new systems. Uh, really? Yeah. We well, want to see my new toy that I just got? Heck yeah, Junior. All right, turn off all the lights. All right. All right, Jeffy, check this out. It's a lightsaber. Junior, that is the tits. I know, right? It's a real lightsaber. So if I touch it, my fingers are gonna come off? Yeah. A liar. Well, you must be made out of armor or something. Yeah, yeah, maybe. I am the BFD with the BFD. Yeah, so what if instead of cleaning those dishes, you got rid of those dishes like a Sith? Oh, heck yeah, Junior, heck! Yeah, here, use your Jedi powers to clean those dishes. All right, Junior. All right, Jeffy, the dishes are all lined up for you. Dishes? I am your father. You showed those dishes. Well, I sure did, Junior. Whoa, Jeffy, look at the big mess you made. I know, Junior, it's so sick. Ooh, you made a big old mess, now I'm gonna go tell your daddy. Oh, please don't go tell my daddy. I'm supposed to be being a good boy and get the gold star so I can get the new systems. Well, hey, if you help me get the new PlayStation 5, then uh, I won't tell your daddy that you made a big old mess. So, this is what the plan gonna be. So what you gonna do is, you gonna go steal the gold stars and put it all over your good boy card, and then you gonna take that card to your mama. You gonna tell your mama that your daddy gave you the stars, and then she gonna buy you the Xbox. Then you take that same card and take it to your daddy, and then you tell your daddy that your mama gave you the stars, and then he gonna buy you the PlayStation. And then you give the PlayStation to me. Oh, that idea sounds pee Well, wh when do I get a system? You don't. Aww. All right, so go steal the star and get a card to your mom. All right. Oh, my stomach's rumbling. I'm really hungry. Oh, me too. Hey, since Jeffy's cleaning the kitchen, I can go get us some food. Yeah, you should definitely go get us some food. Okay, well, what are you in the mood for? McDonald's. Definitely McDonald's. Oh, McDonald's. We always get McDonald's. But I love McDonald's. And just don't tell Jeffy we're getting McDonald's because I don't want him to eat any of it. Why is that? Because I want him to eat healthy. Oh, well, okay. Well, I'll be right back then. All right. Oh, hey, Mommy. What is it, Jeffy? Oh, uh, before you leave, I cleaned the kitchen so good that Daddy gave me all the stars on my good boy <gasps> chart. He did! Jeffy, I'm so proud of you! Yeah, thanks, Mommy. Oh, uh, I am pretty proud of it. Uh, but when you go out, can you go ahead and get me my Xbox? I will, Jeffy! I will! Oh, sweet, Mommy. Thanks. Ooh, yeah, all oh, Daddy, guess what? what? Jeffy, why are you talking like that? Right there, good, good boy chart full of stars. Jeffy, stop talking like that. What are you saying? Well, Daddy, I cleaned the kitchen so good that Mommy go ahead and gave me all the stars. But she's not supposed to do that. She's only supposed to give you one star for cleaning the kitchen. Well, now you gotta go get me my PlayStation. Well, Jeffy, no, explain to me what each star was for. All right, well, the first star, because I cleaned one dish, then I cleaned two dishes, what? and then I cleaned three dishes, and then I clean four dishes. No, you don't. Then I clean five dishes. You don't get a star per all dish. All the way down to 25 dishes. Oh, oh, you know what, Jeffy? Fine, listen. I will go ahead and buy you one game system, but only one. But on Christmas morning, when you wake up and there's no other presents, what are you going to think? That there's no Santa Claus? No, no, because I'm giving you a Christmas gift today. So when I give you your one game system right now, that means it's all you're getting for Christmas, okay? So wh which, which system do you want right now? Uh, the PlayStation 5. All right, I'm going to go get it, but that's all you're getting. Good. Oh, folks, it's working, folks! Uh-huh. Uh, uh. All right, Jeffy, here's your PlayStation 5. Daddy, this is cool as... Jeffy, do not say that word. 
Look, here, just take your PlayStation 5, Merry Christmas. And a Happy New Year! Jeffy, go! Take it. <laughs> Jeffy, I have your Xbox! Oh, Mother, that is the bosoms! Thank you for being such a good boy, Jeffy! Oh, I'm the bestest boy ever! Enjoy! Thanks, Mother. No, 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 this ain't right! What's wrong? They went ahead and got us the digital dishes or the PS5 and the Xbox, so they went cheap on us. Is that bad? Yeah, it's bad! Because what happens if our Wi-Fi goes out? Then we can't access our games! So we need the ones with the disc dishes! So what we need to do is, I got some plan. We're gonna go downstairs and we're gonna break both of these consoles so they have to take it back and get us the better ones. So, come on, let's go. All right, Jeffy, so what we're gonna do is, we're gonna break them, and then you're gonna take them back to your parents and tell them that they came like that. Then they're gonna take them back to the store, and then they're gonna exchange them for the good ones. All right, All right so I'm gonna hit this egg bot with the hammer. Are right, you ready? Here we go. <coughs> I got an even better idea. All right, folks, we're gonna throw the Xbox out the balcony. Here we go. <laughs> that I'll do it. All right, let me get the PlayStation. All right, right here. PlayStation 5 is next. Bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go check it out, folks. Oh, 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 yeah, folks. They broke it. So now what you gotta do is you gotta take them to your parents and then tell them they came like this. All right. Mario, I'm back. Oh good, I'm starving. Where's the food? <gasps> Mario, I completely forgot. I was just so excited about Jeffy being such a good boy. I mean, he was a good boy, right? Yeah, right? I mean, he cleaned the kitchen, right? Yeah, right? Um, Mommy, uh, I need to talk to you in the other room in private. Oh. It's an emergency. Okay, Jeffy. All right. All right, Mommy. So I was getting ready to play the Xbox and I was so excited and I opened up the box and it looked like this. Oh no, Jeffy, it's broken. Yeah, and I read online that all the digital Xboxes are broken. So when you take it back, I think you need to ask for the one with the disc because uh, those are stronger. Oh, Jeffy, I'm so sorry I got the wrong one. I'll go to the store right now, return it and get the right one, okay? Oh, oh thank you so much, Mommy, I appreciate it. Oh, Daddy! What? It's awful! What? Play the shot, old yeller! What are you talking about, Jeffy? Daddy, I was getting ready to play my new PS5. I was so excited. And I opened up the box and it was broken! What, broken? Yeah, and I read online that all the digital PS5s are broken when you open them up. Well, well, so then what am I supposed to get? Well, you're supposed to get the one with the disc player. I heard those are stronger and they don't break. And they're not broken when you when you get them. What, it looks like this thing just snapped back on. It doesn't. It, well, 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 let me try it. No, it doesn't. Let, let me try it. Okay, it was dropped off a balcony. What? I mean, it looks like it was dropped off a balcony. I don't know what they're doing over there at Sony. But. Uh, okay, well then, I'll try to... Okay, I'll return it and get you the one that can play disc if this one came broken. Okay. All right, thanks, Daddy. <sighs> Jeffy, I got your PlayStation 5. Jeffy! Baby, why'd you get him an Xbox? Why did you get him a PlayStation 5? He said you gave him 25 gold stars. He said you gave him 25 gold stars. I didn't. I didn't. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, 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 oh. Jeffy, that's it. You're grounded. You lied to us. Father, please don't raise your voice at me. No, don't talk to me in that British voice. It's not going to work this time. You lied to us so that you could get both systems. Well, only one of these systems is for me. Then who's the other system for? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, you got the PS5? Oh, I can't wait to play it. No, you're not playing the PS5. We're going to return these consoles. Jeffy, you're grounded. Well, am I grounded too, Daddy? Yeah, you're grounded too. You know what? Actually, I think I'm going to play the PlayStation 5. Oh, I think I'm going to play the Xbox. What? <laughs> yep, we're going to play these systems because we bought them. And you guys can just sit back and watch and be grounded. Come on, baby. Let's play these systems. Come on. <laughs> oh, man, this PlayStation 5 is so fun. This is so much fun, Mario. Yeah. Ooh. Last time on Jeffy Ball Z, Jeffy collected all the Dragon Balls just for Brooklyn Guy to steal his wish. Will Jeffy get revenge? Does Brooklyn Guy have any powers at all? Let's find out. I'm going to spirit bomb you. <laughs> oh, yeah, not if I spirit bomb you first. <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh shit, nothing's happening. Oh, I'm gonna get destroyed, aren't I? Destroyed, aren't I? <laughs> Yeah, you kicked my ass. There you go. You can have your stupid outfit back. I'll be taking that. You really just wasted his wish on his stupid outfit just to give it back? Well, look, I thought by getting the outfit I'd get the powers too, but I guess it doesn't work like that. You just wasted a wish. We could have wished for a billion dollars or for Grand Theft Auto 6 to come out. Yeah, I know. I should have just wished for the powers. Look, I'm sorry, okay? I'll help you find the Dragon Balls. You'll help us find the Dragon Balls? Yeah, I'll go look for them, and if I find any, I'll bring them back here, and if you find any, you bring them back here too. Oh, uh, okay. All right, Daddy. I'm going to go look for some Dragon Balls. Oh, I hate this. Hmm, where are these Dragon Balls at? Oh, well, I need to get my power level up. I'm about to ride the F out of this ducky. Oh, oh yeah, oh yeah, daddy, yeah, oh yeah. Jeffy! Oh, hey, Junior. My name's not Junior anymore. It's Vegeta. Vagina? Why would you want to be called that? Well, no, no, not Vagina, Vegeta. Oh, like the sizzling hot plates from Chili's that come out like psst. No, th those are fajitas. My name's Vegeta. Virginia or West Virginia? What, not Virginia, Vegeta! Oh, Vagina. What, no! Listen, where are the Dragon Balls at? Well, the only Dragon Balls are the Dragon Balls across your face. What, no! You're, like, you're gonna regret saying that. Yes! <laughs> oh, Vagina, what was that for? I wanna kill you because if I get rid of you, I'll be the only one looking for the Dragon Balls. Well, you can't kill me because I'm more powerful than you. We'll see about that. Get me! Get me. Uh, uh, you're gonna make me go Super Syndrome. <laughs> what, are you, what are you doing? <laughs> Uh, you messed up now. Johnny! Johnny! Oh, no, 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 please! Uh, any last words? You can't kill me. I'm the prince of all sayings. Oh, that's how the cookie crumbles. Now that he's gone, let's go find these dragon balls. Oh, man. I can't wait to eat my apple jack. Mommy? Is that a Dragon Ball? Don't touch that Dragon Ball! It's mine. You'll never get my Dragon Ball, you monkey tail turd! <laughs> you take that back, you bitch! Oh, we're gonna have to fight for this Dragon Ball! With pleasure! <laughs> oh, oh, dude, that hurt! Oh, I'm gonna go King Kami on your ass! Wait till I use my special bean cannon. Oh, watch me charge up. Uh... Oh, hell no. I'm gonna charge up my special pee pee cannon. <laughs> 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 it's not fair, dude. You let me charge up. Uh. Well, why are we fighting? Daddy, he took my Dragon Ball. The Dragon Ball was in my cereal. But I want it! Oh, okay, wait. How much do you want for it? Three bucks. Uh, three bucks. All right, look, there, there's three dollars. Take it. Ah, <laughs> sucker. Oh, I win. All right, Jeffy, go get your, gra your stupid Dragon Ball. I will. Finally, it's man. <laughs> I have returned after a long and treacherous journey through the depths of hell, conquering many adversaries and dodging many obstacles. I, Jeffy, have defeated the one they call Pinocchio, and I have obtained a single ball of the dragon. And none of this would have been possible if I didn't show great strength and power. I paid three dollars for this, Jeffy. And I thank you for that, Father, but I still need six more, so if you want to cough up some more change, we can get this ball rolling. Balloon tits. Well, Jeffy, isn't it your job to find it? But it's so hard, Daddy! Imagine dedicating your life to looking for balls! You have to eat, sleep, and breathe balls like a girl on OnlyFans! Look, Jeffy, just go find the other six ones. Aye, aye, Captain! We should've done Naruto. <sighs> How did I lose to Jeffy? No! The Saiyans of legend were an invincible warrior race, and I am their son! And at long last, I have risen to claim my birthright. I have stepped into the ranks of greatness. All my life, I have worked towards this goal. And for what? To be brushed aside as easily as a common house fly by an android? A true Saiyan would not have fallen. Maybe I'm not who I think I am. 
Perhaps there are still new plateaus for me to reach. Far greater heights for which I must ascend. Yes, I will ascend. The universe will marvel and... Dude, what the hell are you doing talking to yourself in your room? Ah, go to sleep! Shut the hell up, weirdo! Sorry, Dad. Like I was saying, there might be new plateaus I can reach. The universe! Junior, if you're gonna keep on talking to yourself like a weirdo, take out that damn trash, boy! You know what, Dad? Dad it gun! <laughs> Don't do that weird stuff in my house! Oh, take out that damn trash! I'm not gonna repeat myself again! Okay, Dad! Ugh, ugh, just looking for something to eat. What type of apple is this? Ow, that hurts my mouth! Ow, that still hurts my mouth! Oh, stupid Dad! Doesn't understand that I'm a Saiyan God. Hey kid, you wanna trade me something for this apple? <gasps> that's not an apple! That's a Dragon Ball! Give me that! No, you gotta trade me something for it. Uh, uh, how about I trade you this Gallic gun? <laughs> oh hell no! How about my Rudolph the Red Nose Ring? <laughs> <sighs> no one can beat a Saiyan God like me, what are you thinking? I have a balloon. Well, can I have it? <laughs> Stop! Stop hitting me! <laughs> Hey, you popped my balloon. Oh, and now you're going down. No one can beat me. Now give me that Dragon Ball. No, my apple. I've done it. I've gotten a Dragon Ball. Now I must beat Jeffy to find me the other six Dragon Balls so I can wish to become the most powerful being in the universe. Not so fast, Vagina. Jeffy, what are you doing here? We're here to kick your ass, me and old Giraffe Tushy, and then we're gonna take that Dragon Ball. You're not getting this Dragon Ball unless you pry it from my cold, dead hands. Well, the dead part can be arranged. <laughs> He's so strong, but I'm stronger. You're no match for Giraffe Booty Hole. Come on, Giraffe, give me a big stink. Finally, I have two balls. Hey, man, welcome to the Black Market Pawn Shop. What can I get you? Okay, well, uh, what I'm looking for is uh, pretty hard to find. Well, we are the Black Market Pawn Shop, so we have all kinds of sketchy shit. Just tell me what you're looking for, and I'll tell you if we can accommodate you. Okay, well, uh, what I'm looking for is some balls. Whoa, man, no, 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 we're, we're not that kind of shop. We don't do that here. No, 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 not like that. Like, I, I, it's like these seven balls. What, I don't know what you're into, man, but you should probably get some help. No, not like that. Like, there's like, there's like seven balls, and I just want to, like, rub them and make a wish. Okay, I think I need to ask you to leave. No, it's like, they're like dragon balls. Like seven dragon balls? Oh, we don't have seven dragon balls. Oh, well, I'm, I'm sorry for wasting your time, then. We do have five, though. Wait, wait, really? You have five Dragon Balls? Yeah, but you wanted seven, so sorry, we don't have that. Well, no, no, I'll take the five Dragon Balls. It's fine. I'll take whatever you can give me. Hmm, that's kind of weird. Like, you wanted seven Dragon Balls, but now you want five? That's kind of fishy. No, 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 really. I, I, I can go find the other two. It's fine. Just give me the five Dragon Balls. Huh. But you see why that's weird, right? Like, you wanted seven Dragon Balls, and now you're going to settle for five. It's kind of like if you told me that you wanted a puzzle with seven pieces, and I told you I only had five, and you were fine with that. It's like... Like, you can't finish the puzzle, so so what's really going on? No, 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 look, it's up to me to finish the puzzle on my own, okay? Just just give me the Dragon Balls. Okay, fine, but uh, that's going to be $100. What? A hundred bucks? What? That is a ripoff. Oh, okay, I'll tell you what. I'm not going to give you any money until you show me some balls. And so, some, some Dragon Balls, not Dolphin Balls. All right, fine. Here are the goods. Oh, they are so beautiful. Okay, here you go. Here's your stupid money, you scumbag. It's Dragon Balls. Hey, Danny, look, I got two balls. <gasps> you got two balls, Jeffy? Yeah, Danny, the other one finally dropped. Oh, you're talking about these balls. Yeah, I got two Dragon Balls. Well, Jeffy, you only need five more, and then you get your wish. Hey, guys, I found five Dragon Balls. <gasps> you got five Dragon Balls? Well, I got two right here. That's great. That means we have all of them. Now we just got to put them together. Give me your two. No, you give me your five. No, give me your two. No, what if I give you my two, and then you steal my wish again? Look, bro, I'm not going to do that again. I got the two slots right here. Just give me those. No, you give me yours. <sighs> Look, I clearly learned my lesson last time. I'm not going to steal your wish again. Look, how about this? I, I swear on my mother's life, I won't steal your wish. Actually, you know what? I swear on my brother's life, too. And my wife's. My whole family. I swear on all their lives, I won't steal your wish again. Okay. <gasps> They're glowing! <gasps> the dragon's coming! Dragon come, dragon come. Let's all make the dragon come. <laughs> hey, Blair! I'm Boofy the Dragon! And because you play with my balls, you get one wish! I wish I had superpowers.
You get ha <laughs> Your wish is my command. <laughs> I finally have superpowers! You stole Tuffy's wish again! Yes, I did, because I got five of the seven Dragon Balls, and I think it's only fair that I should get the wish. But, but, but you swore on your family's life! I don't care about my family, they can die for all I care, I have superpowers now! And that means I can finally kick your ass! So take this! Ugh. Ugh. You didn't do the Kamehameha thing. Oh, yes, yes, you're right. Thank you. Kamehameha! What What the hell is that? What, what, what the hell am I supposed to do with this little tiny baby laser? What, what? Okay, what the hell was that about? You may have powers, but you're not powerful. Take this. Will Jeffy ever get his wish? Will Brooklyn Guy ever learn to use his powers? Find out next time on Jeffy Ball Z.